seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Boy, doesn't that just get you ready for the addiction comic number two? It is Grail Day, everyone. It is Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. I have no fucking clue what day it is. Anyways, it's good to see you. Um, I'm really tired. Thank you, Vivi, for having a drop at 2 a.m. and then one now. And thank you for rugging me last night because I got like 15 comments and one rare. I think I got six. Six issues. But it was fun. As always, it's always fun losing. But anyways, I'm glad to be here. Glad to see all my friends here. So fucking excited. Anyways, let's see who is here in chat. We got Christopher. Good to see you, man. He is addicted. Uh, yes, I am too. I'm addicted, but not to this comic. Actually, I don't hate these comics. I think it's a great idea. Kind of wish they'll, they would have some animated panels. Uh, I do like the fact, though, that there is some crafting going on. Look at this. So here's the one thing real quick. I couldn't tell. Is 158 the first mint? I don't even know. But anyways, look, we're going to be able to craft these. They don't really give us much information. Uh, but of course, I think the ones with the VV logo are going to be uh, really big. So today I'm thinking, although obviously you want the secret rare, um, the ultra rare. I'm just making sure that I didn't miss a VV logo and the uncommon are probably going to be the most valuable IMO. I have no clue what I'm doing, but that's what I think. Good to see you, Christopher. We got Graz in the house. Good to see you. How are you doing? Are you going for this today? Normally, you're just here to hang out. Uh, hopefully, uh, you're going for something today. We'll see. Maybe you went la for something last night. Ahoy, ahoy. Denny O.C., good to see you, man. On the road, we'll be listening in. Good luck to all going for the drop. Smash the thumbs up. Yes, please smash the thumbs up. I really need it. Uh, I'm exhausted. Maybe it'll wake me up. Alejandro. How you doing with a Cardinals family member? He's he's my new favorite in chat. Uh, good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. We got uh, Watma Miss. Yo, yo, I'm frothing from the mouth this morning. Spring cleaning. Yes, that's my favorite, isn't it? I love getting rid of stuff. It feels good. Uh, VB comic drop and muzzle run. Let's hope I don't get stung by a wasp. I hope you don't. Actually, my dad's allergic to them. If he gets stung, that's it. Uh, land a comment and get rugged by BE's race. Well, you're definitely going to get rugged by not my race it's b dog's race but yes you're gonna get rugged look who's in the house ghosty is here good to see you just a heads up in case you actually want to take a nap racing probably won't start for a little while um because i'm gonna cover the comic we got a few things to go over uh but yes i'm planning on doing a race or two uh, i don't know if big a is here if he's here i might even run an insane deal for pack openings but uh i don't want anyone spending money they don't have i'm just getting my tablet ready here for some reason my apple it's not full screen anymore so i'm getting rugged by my apple it's awesome i'm so freaking happy about it <laughs> but like i always say just join the wait list even if you're not going to get it it's always worth it and you know what before i move on let's get our uh, poll up here See, who's going for the comic today? Help us all out decide who's going for it. I have not decided. I'm After last night, getting rugged. I don't know. I put a lot of fiat into that. But are I do like this. Are you going for, I got to capitalize that, the addiction number two comic? So anyone, if you're not familiar with the addiction comic, it is actually... Um, uh, Vivi's a partner in this whole deal in the comic, and so it's kind of big. So uh, this is the second one. So let's see. Get get your vote in. Let everyone know what you're going to do. It's weird that I can't vote. But yes, got Michael Oliver. Hey, hey, brother. Good to see you, man. Thank you for dropping by. Appreciate it. 
Uh, I don't know if I've seen you in here before. If I have, then I'm sorry. Um, but good to see you. We got Rewind 2001. Good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. Rug City. Okay, you're going to be from uh, from Muzz. <laughs> good to see you yes definitely it, just in case i'm i don't think i'm gonna be running anything for a little while normally do vv and then go into a stream this is important enough to go over and we got wolverine uh collectible to go over we got mark in the house i got all kinds of srs it's so nice like i do okay on these drops i totally suck at the 2 a 2 a.m drops i get commons on come i did get a rare and i did sell it for a little bit over retail but i i got screwed uh, smoking a bowl might get me in the mood for this comic. Yes, it can get you in the mood for a lot of stuff. We got Legis. Good to see you. Good morning. Good to have you here. Hope you were doing well. Hope you're ready. Get some comics. Join a race. It's a special race that I will rug you all in, including myself, which sucks. But anyways, I have to do that, so I have a chance. Anyways, Ken Ojo in the house, a new Muzzle Run person. If, if you're not familiar with Muzzle Run, well, I've got something for you right now let's just take a look at what muzzle run is and we'll come back and we'll take a look at the addiction number two comic That's what you get when you put two seconds into production value. And it's worth about two cents uh, for those two seconds. But anyways, that's Muzzle Run. If you are interested, I will be running races. I run races uh, every week. So you can see Vox and Ghosty. They run races every week. They like to do like crazy ass races like me for free crypto. Uh, all you need is one racer. That's where it starts. We have a lot of people. They started with that. They didn't put anything in and now they're addicted. So if you're interested, I might be able to get you a free racer today, or we can work on getting you one in the next couple of days. But anyways, you want to be prepared because I give about $400 a week of crypto. So does, uh, you know, Ghosty and Vox. And there's a bunch of other streamers throughout the day and throughout the week. So definitely check it out. Here's my favorite person. It's big A. How are you doing? Bad weather in New Orleans, like uh, tornadoes. Uh, be safe. We get a lot of that fun stuff here. Um, yeah, it's just weird weather here. It's cold and hot. So it's almost tornado time for us here. I'm just looking at the date. Uh, we're going to get lots of them here. So I can't wait, but hope be safe. And hopefully um, you can still join the race in a little bit. There's Voxton. He was on other Google account. All right. Oh, no, big A. Yes, be safe. You're basically the only reason I go to YouTube anymore. Yeah, I. <laughs> this is the only reason I go to YouTube is to make a stream. Anyways, hit that like button, everyone, because it really does help me out. Uh, it helps my ego out, too. I, I bet you didn't know that, but it does. Not in a good way, but it does help it out. Hit that like button because we're only at 14. Uh, anyways, we are three minutes away from the wait list for the addiction comic. Let's go through the chat and then we'll get caught up with everything that's going on with the comic, Wolverine and everything else. Uh, does this have a crafter or not? So from what I read, good question, Mustard Plus. It's good to see you too, by the way. And you'll see here, uh, this is this crafting. There will be, it says there will be two secret recovers available for crafting. More details to come uh, crafting at a later date. So I don't think you have to worry about that today. I don't know what that means. Does that mean you need all of these? Does it mean, uh, for instance, maybe you get a secret rare to craft a secret? I have no clue. I have no clue. Uh, in my opinion, though, I do think that the ones with the VV logo, like on the first one, these are going to be worth more. So the uncommon and the ultra rare. Um, but I could be completely wrong. I usually am. So keep that in mind. Uh, but no crafting today as far as what they're saying. So yes. Um, all right. So you can craft the ultra rare and the uncommon. Those are the two you need. I don't know. I don't know if that's what you need. I absolutely don't know. Uh, they don't tell you. Um, 
and I don't do any research because that's how much effort I put into this. Um, <laughs> I don't know, but I do have, I do have some crappy uh, minty fresh numbers. I don't even know if these are real. Um, I really don't uh, because I just put this together like five minutes before the stream. So here's the deal. It did not say if 158 was the first minute, but it usually is on a 5,000. This is 5,000. Uh, 1980, I think, is David Yu's birthday because I found an article that said in 1997, when he was 17, he started his first business. Uh, I'm assuming 1980, if you get it at a floor, maybe it's 1981. I don't know. But I do know 2018 is when Vivo was founded. If you want to fight me on it, it's actually in the comic uh, details, and I'll show you in a second. 2023 is when the first uh, addiction comic came out. We got 2024. Now, this is a big stretch, but you know what? You got to stretch when you have nothing to look for. Uh, 3537 was the booth at NYCC that premiered this comic, and you could get the special comics. So maybe that's one you go for. I don't know. Maybe I just totally pulled that out of my ass. And then Mint 5000 is the last one. Uh, but just so you know here, so you don't think I'm lying. You go down here, it says it all the time here. It's been a fight right here. VV founded in 2018. So I think that's going to be big. And I think David used birthday, if I'm correct, that's going to be big. So kind of excited. All right. So we are here. You can join the wait list. I'm going to join the wait list. Don't think it matters. I'm not going to spend any MCP points. Don't think that would be smart, uh, especially with the Wolverine coming up. Uh, let's see. I spent a very, sele uh, very selective wet drops. I'm doing lately. I just spent very selective. I don't know what you just said there, but it sounds interesting. Uh, Double Quill, good to see you. Uh, everyone should be checking out Double Quill's blog on Twitter. It's better than this show. I'll tell you that. So good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Uh, what do you get for crafting Alter Rare and Uncommon? Does it burn or Alter? Holy crap. I better say this clear. I do not know what you craft. I'm just saying that I think that the Alter Rare and the Uncommon are going to be worth more because it's got the VV logo. And it's got lollipops right there. That's why. So don't, yeah, there you go. BE killing it. Nice promo. Yes, thank you. Thank you. For five seconds, that was pretty good. And Ronnie Lido uh, gave me some constructive criticism on another thing I did that we'll see later. Uh, when I did the Spider-Man drop, I used 5,000 MCP, got lucky to get picked, got a 607 mint. I keep it. Yep, that's a definitely uh, a nice mint there. Uh, let's see. Oh, just roll the fatty. Oh, you suck. But I do like, I always like seeing Buckethead. Still waiting to see him in concert. Uh, that's his profile picture. Uh, low efforts, very low. I mean, seriously, like I should just be asleep right now. That's how low it is. But I'm trying to put a little bit more production value in this. We'll see. Box Insane, I've been trying to find promising crypto earning blockchain titles. I've got the tingle of WWOX. I have no fucking clue what you're talking about. But I am always trying to find something to make money off of and hoping it's not a honeypot on base. Uh, that's what I'm hoping. Sorry, I've been uh, very selective on the drops. Yes, absolutely. I got it. Greedy One is in the house. Good to see you. Sorry, no Legos today, but it is good to see you. Sorry about that. <laughs> There's the wifey. Good, good to see her. Good morning, everyone. All right, so let's get this party started. Hit that like button. If you're just joining me, I apologize. Uh, this is gonna suck. Uh, if you are from Muzzle Run, it's even worse for you because you gotta wait like an hour because I'm gonna snipe for like two minutes. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for this. Let's take a look at the poll because that matters. We only have 38 votes. Normally we'll get to 100, but VB decided not to do drops anymore during the weekday, so I don't know what this is gonna be. We're at 69 percent going for it. Um, that's good enough for me. I look for 65 percent. We got 69 percent going for it. 31 or not. Um, pretty good. Um, people are excited about this. That does not mean you're going to make a profit. Uh, but I think it, it, it will be nice to have. It's worth the gamble, especially after I spent 50 bucks yesterday. Maybe Vivi, you could give me a secret rare. I'm just saying, I'm asking for a friend. Can you please God give me a secret rare for reals? All right. Uh, it's a FPS shooter with crypto winning, betting and earning potential. I like, I like stuff like that. I like being able to shoot people in a video game and make money. I think that's the best way to make money, actually. I'm looking for a way that actually I don't have to do anything to make money. How does that work? Um, I'm asking for a friend. Uh, Free, it's good to see you. Thank you for your military service. Good to have you here. Uh, we will be doing a race in a little bit. I mean, in a long bit, but good to see you. Uh, look who we've got in the house. We got Dr. Strange. I hope he'll be here for the race, too. He's been doing pretty good. Like, he's showing up here and there. 
and he wins. So that's pretty good. Yeah, stay safe, Big A. Um, the only thing I hope is that your internet goes out. That's all that I hope. I don't. I want you to be safe. I just don't want you joining the race so you can rug me. I'm just. I'm not kidding. I'm. I'm kidding. I'm not kidding at all. All right, this comic should uh, do good. Number one is over retail. The ones with the VV logo should do the best. Yeah, I totally agree with you, Alejandro. You totally stole that from me. Um, but again, you're my favorite now since you've got a family member who was a cardinal player. So that's good. We got Captain Obvious in the house. Good to see you. Uh, saving my jemmies for Wolverine. Yeah, we're gonna get into Wolverine here in just a second. Uh, let's see, Maureen Boxin. I gotta watch more of your streams to try and figure out these these donkeys out. Yeah, because if she listens to mine, you get dumber. But it's good to see everyone here. Uh, Addiction, you can join the waitlist. I suggest you do it. Uh, so far, we're it's gone down a little bit. We're at sixty four percent. If you haven't voted, please let us know in chat or in the poll if you're going to be going for this. Uh, it does help us out. C spill, good to see you. Anybody get anything this morning? Yes, I did. I did. I got freaking commons. I got one rare. I went for Spidey verse three uh, and X Men one and two. Totally got rugged. As everyone in the real uncommon podcast is like, oh, I got a secret rare. And Aljo Darrow, who always gets secret rares, got like fifteen of them. And I got commons. Mission though got screwed too. He bought eight, and I think he got like all commons too. So, um, yeah, I guess we do well on the real drops and not these fiat ones. Eric, good to see you. Hope you are doing well. Glad you are here limit of five blind boxes those who want more than uh one will be lucky to get three probably sold out before the market all right you're getting me excited although the poll is getting worse 46 votes in get your votes in 63 percent going for this now um but rewind i think i'm gonna go for it um and i might even go for a rebound why not i might as well support vv that's all i do is vv so uh good morning tito 420 glad to see you uh, good luck if you're going for this. Uh, Giant Portal opens app every month and puts money in my bank account. You ought to try it, right? I wish. That would be nice. That would be very nice. And then uh, uh, Rug Incoming. I have a whole home gener. Oh, I hate you. You're one of those people. You're one of the... When I lived in Florida, I got a generator. After 2004, I'm like, I'm never going to live without electricity again. Guess what? Never used it. Never used it. Um, so yeah, that was a waste of money, but it is good to know that you have power. Um, I'm going to pray to the, I don't know, internet gods that maybe that goes out. I don't think you can affect that. We'll see. I'll go for Wolf Wolverine. I'm just going to flip it. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't need to watch your streams. You talk about this all day. long. <laughs> that's true. Troy Carthage, I was just thinking about you. Good to see you, man. Loving the, uh, Mo Moco. Yes. Covers. Yes. I do like those. Of course, I didn't really get any. I did get one. But anyways, good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. Uh, if you're going to, I don't know if you, I don't think you have a racer for muzzle run. If you're interested, though, stay, stay a little bit longer. Uh, when we do the races, you can join. Uh, double call. I want to see the animation and sound before I make up my mind on the Wolverine. I agree. I'm kind of, kind of waiting for that, too. Uh, Mark Davidson, I bought about eight, got two SR. I mean, that's good. I mean, obviously, your chances shouldn't be better, but it seems like people's chances are very good. Uh, when I'm watching other people's streams, uh, you can do streams that are fully AI being you. People are making a living doing nothing. I like that. I do like that idea. All right. Hippie 2323. Hi, fam. Morning. Be good to see you. They're smart by. I have not seen you in here. And I've been thinking like, you know what? I really like that guy. I always liked watching him in vault streams. And here he is. I feel honored to have smart by smart by. Is this a smart by? That's the question I always ask him. We've got 54 votes in. We're at 65%. We're hitting my threshold. So I I'm I'm going for this now. Don't don't follow me. But yes, good to see you, smart buy. Uh, I've been in Florida for so many years and never had a generator. That's a smart thing. Just don't waste your money. Uh, hey, big A. Let's see. Generators drive people nuts. Try solar. Yes. Good morning. Free. Let's see. Are we going above retail on these addictions or VV addiction losing me money? Probably going to lose you money. But I do think if you look at the uncommon. And the ultra rare, and I think the ultra rare especially is going to do well, in my opinion, not financial advice. Do your own fucking research. I'd say I was just a dog, but I won't be one until later today. Uh, I do think that those are going to do better. Uh, and do remember that you are going to be able to craft. We have no clue what the crafting is going to be. They don't tell us anything, but I do think this one's going to be very valuable secret rare. Have no clue. 
All it says is there will be two secret recovers available for crafting. More details to come at a later date. Hashtag VV soon. So, all right. So that's that. Uh, we've got 15, a little bit over 15 minutes until you can't even join the wait list anymore. Uh, 66% are going for this. 56 votes. Get those votes in. Hit that like button. I need to get that to 50 today. I don't know how. We don't even have 50 people in here. Um, actually, we have 70 people. Uh, hit that like button everyone it does really uh help me it makes the wifey love me more too makes her think that i'm doing something here uh let's see best pulls am sr fantastic forward number 90 wow 404 also sr ultimate x-men one you're not allowed in here anymore rewind get the fuck out of here i mean you always get good stuff plus he's a good sniper so i hate you uh osmond good to see you he made it straight from the web v collective the man himself uh, not only does he do the Webbeat Collective, he started it, he runs it, runs Spaces Life stuff with a bunch of awesome people in there. Um, he also reads comics. Uh, he should start an ASMR channel actually doing that. That would be cool. But it's good to see you. He finally made it straight from England. Good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. I'm still working on getting a special Webbeat Collective muzzleworm race. We get all the content creators here. And my goal is to rug the good um muscle run players so all right so mark davidson does everyone in the usa try making a living doing nothing or streaming uh yes i think that's exactly what everyone's trying to do we do see the difference is in america we work all fucking year and you get two weeks off now if you're an executive or whatever okay so maybe you get four or five weeks it's not like every other country where you get months off at a time and you get half day Wednesdays and you get all this fun stuff. I mean, we work ass off. So we're like, yeah, but at this point, COVID came around. We're like, go fuck yourselves, businesses. I'll just do the gig economy and I'll make it work. So the only problem is, is that we have to live in tents. But other than that, it's great. It's very good. Uh, doctor is in the house. I saw him earlier. He has a power station. That's good. Bitcoin, 67,000. That's, I mean, we got the having coming up. What it, I guess we don't have an exact time, but about April 20th, 420. That would be awesome if it happened on 420. That's our uncommon and ultra rare above retail, in my opinion. So a better chance of getting a flip if that's what you are. To, yeah, I probably, I'm still going to do it, but we never got the details. Never the details on, wait, did I miss something here? Uh oh, what did I miss? Details on what? Oh, there's Ronnie Lido. I uh, could have swore we did get the details. Oh, are you talking about on uh, for crafting? I mean, it literally says here, we'll give you details later. Right there. If that's what you're talking about. I don't know. Uh, what up, BE? Good luck to those going for it. Yes, uh, Scar, good to see you, man. Another great sniper that pisses me off. Uh, we are at 69. Get your votes in. This is super important. Uh, we got to get that to 100 so we know. We got 75 people in here, so please hit that like button. Um, yes. Uh, Ronnie Lido, uh, so there will be nine covers for this book total. Yeah, I mean, uh, wait, nine. Five, seven. How did you get nine? I'm confused. That's some wonky math you've got going there, but you're a smart guy, so maybe I'm missing something. I've just tickled your light button for you. Thank you. I need. I definitely need that. Thanks, BE. You're too kind. Yes. Um, I'm not too kind, actually. I'm kind of a dick, but thank you for saying that. It's good to trick people. Uh, let's see. A lot of people in the U.S. get zero days off. That's true, too. Like If you're working just a regular hourly wage job at a restaurant, if you want a day off, you don't get paid. So, uh, yes, it sucks. Uh, so, yes, that's why everyone's like, screw you. We'll just go on YouTube and make no money. Uh, good morning, Mr. V. Glad to see you. He rugged me on my one, two, three symbiote. I'm just kidding. He wanted it, so I sold it to him. But I made him a deal. I think it's important to make people deals who are actually collectors. I know people want to make money, and I get that. Uh, but it's sometimes nice to work with people because then you've got somebody who will buy stuff from you all the time if you make them good deals uh so yeah good to see you mr v hope you're doing well i work every day sun's out yes uh let's see that's why they want to ban tiktok here it's creating a class that doesn't need to participate in the corporate workforce exactly and all they do is they get roses thrown at them and they do those what npcs 
and you can go in there and and throw them a penny and they got to go like boop boop popcorn popcorn something like that i saw a guy doing that he spent two thousand pennies and the poor man had to actually do all that weird stuff but anyways i'll shut the fuck up uh tom good to see you can you do a poll on who is buying the flip versus who is buying the hold crap interesting i could and i might if you remind me a little bit i'd like to see this get to 100 just we get a good idea of uh, it's very scientific when it gets to 100 said nobody ever but it's good for uh me i think if we get 100 votes so right now we're 67 votes remind me and i will i'll do that those two last covers are the ones for the craft yes these right here that's one for the craft that's one the craft both have vv logo but i do think that this is going to end up being the big one because vv's all over it uh let's see because we all know about all seven covers already but these we're not getting these today how we're not these are to be crafted i'm confused ronnie but i did take your advice yesterday i fucking centered that damn arrow you'll see later you'll see how good i did and then you'll just make fun of me uh the details were that you had to hold uh number two uh uncommon and ultra recovers to craft with no burn but now they change it to details coming soon so i don't know Ooh, and scar does know a lot of stuff so that's great so there you go that's great thank you vivi uh, and seeing them all right uh ah, okay there you go um are robots doing the farming and crop picking yet there no no that we saved that because that's a fun job. Uh, C. McCann, good to see you. Uh, what do you work at before this? Uh, before this, I recycled uh, aluminum cans. That's what I did before this. Hmm. No, I sell on uh, Amazon. I have a friend in China. We've been working together for a long time. And yeah, that's basically what I did. I've done other stuff. Uh, basically sales. I hate my life. Uh, Tito, eBay has been great for me the last 12 years. I uh, choose when I work. I get two months off. That's awesome. That's exactly right. I was an eBay slave for many years. I I, I mean, it's a good it's a good gig. You have any idea? I might do the airdrop uh, for the Omi. I have no clue. I don't even have any bronze tickets. So I don't really want to talk about that. Uh, maybe, but isn't this Robot Cats premiere cover? So the other SR craft is good too? I don't know. I mean, I think... What's funny is they're just obviously taking these issues here and putting BB on it. But it's nice if you don't get burned. While well, I said that they may be the case uh, with holding UC uh, and Alter in my vid. So there you go. That's what I'm going to do. Do ASMR streams, sit around uh, and crumble up foil for an hour for some reason it makes money. I actually do like uh, ASMR, especially after doing a stream. It relaxes me. Um, yeah, there's a lot of money. And that when that hit... There was an advertisement in 2018 Super Bowl. And man, I the, the people I watched, the big ones went from like a million to four million. And the small ones got up to a million. It was crazy. Oh, my God. That was exhausting. Go through all that. Hit that like button, everyone. Uh, if you are here for Muzzle Run, you're going to have to wait. Um, you just are because I said so. But because I want to bore you and I want to do something real quick. Let me show you something that's give you a little idea what Muzzle Run is, because I give away about $400 worth of crypto. It's free to join my races. We got Boxing Ghosty in here. They do races. There's like four or five other streamers, including Mo Knows, who do free races. Uh, so let's take a quick look. I'll be right back. for you that is a web 3 greyhound racing game uh and i will be doing that after the bb stream uh so yes and graz wow that's freaking awesome that you have a buckethead uh les paul yeah 15 grand 
That's crazy. That's probably about right. Um, I just literally, the whole thing just made, there it is. Uh, I would not bid for this. Uh, you've got about a little less than six minutes to do this. Uh, yeah, Buckethead is insane. This guy, has, his hand, if it's true about hands, uh, I don't know, but this guy has long fingers. So, uh, but no, he's insane. He's really good. He's very interesting to watch. Uh, he, you know, he, he played in Guns N' Roses a little bit in the 2000s. So, uh, but his other stuff, he's just amazing. He puts out like 15 albums a day. Uh, I have a bird cam on my TV. Uh, the struggles of bird nesting reality. TV. Sounds pretty fun though. Oh, snap. All right. Uh, wow. Great job. Thank you. I totally stole that. Uh, I watched the corn streams a lot. <laughs> I like that too, actually. I watch stuff like that. I have a nice chunk of weekly giveaways. Not fan advice, but it's free. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of free stuff. And people like Wap Miss and Free piss me off because they come in and Dr. Strange too, and Ronnie Lido and all the other fuckers who come in here and steal all my money. All right. But anyways, my life partner watches the crime ones. I hate them. They stress me out. No, I like them. I do like them. It makes me excited about life. Uh, let's see. Buckethead is released over. I know it's great. And they're usually pretty good. I do not like cops, but the unedited streams are cool. They, there's another one I watch that's pretty cool. All right. I'm going to shut the fuck up. Let's go take a look at. Let's go take a look at this. Let's go take a look at Wolverine and strategy. Because I was thinking about this. As everyone knows, there's a lot of these. 3,181. 10,000 is the minimum points and 50% now are saved instead of 40 are going to be saved for the people that have it. My thing is there are five other, I heard other people saying there's going to be other ones. Uh, there's a lot of these and maybe there's 450, 500 whales that are going to put down whatever they want to get this. There's 3,181 folks. I don't know. You're probably going to need to put some points down, but maybe you don't. And I don't know if I'm going to. Uh, I do want to see the animation. I don't hate this now that I look at it. I mean, it's still pretty. It, it could be really cool, too, depending on what he does. If he jumps around and disappears. But let me know your thoughts. I do think I, I originally said you need about 100,000 to get this. But now I don't know if that's true. I don't know if you're going to need that. Uh, let's see. Uh, who's on the breeding block today? Hmm. <laughs> I don't, I, well, I don't have anyone yet because I don't know if Big A is going to come on since he's bad weather. Uh, but if I don't do it today, you're talking about opening packs. I'm, I'm going to offer one good deal to one person and maybe it'll be me. Uh, Brune, thanks for the streaming today, BE. Really appreciate you. Uh, yes, last night, comic just like, it was horrible. It was horrible. It's good to see you out there. And it was wonderful to see everyone else win. That always makes me excited. Uh, Bakersfield in Los Angeles, I watched the most. All right, so what are you guys thinking on this? Uh, I'm going to bid 60 million points. No, you're not. Um, it's not stealing if someone gives it to you. That is true. Uh, I am giving it to you, so you are correct. Uh, there's no airdrop attached to this. Not sure how it affects the drop with no chasers. That's the thing. No chasers, and we know more are coming. We got to think about Hulk. I don't know. I don't know what uh, MCP points I'm going to want to uh, put on this. I probably will. I mean, I do want this, but I, I don't think you have to put down 100,000. We know we've done 22, 25. It's probably more like 50, and I'll say 50, and then you fuckers will do 50, so I got to do like 56, and I told you 56, and I have to do 60, and I told you 60. I'm fucked. I'm just going to put 100,000 down. It's the only way to trick you people. But you probably don't have to. You probably could do just like 50,000, somewhere thereabouts, I think. I think so. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, you were good at rebounds. I got lucky. No, I'm not good at rebounds, but I cannot believe. No, I'm not. Like, I did the Coke bottle and the symbiote, and then like half, more than half the time, like 90% of the time, I don't get them. 80 watching, only 35 likes. I agree. Come on, people. Just hit the like button. Seriously, you know, get off your lazy ass and go. Doop. That's all you have to do. That's all you have to do. There you go. We're at 36. Thank you, peeps. There's Kurzami, one of my favorite guys who rugs me in the market. He makes the floors. He's here now. Let's go, fam. Good luck. I'm kind of loving those Ultimate X-Men 2 comments. Not going to lie. Well, I got rid of all mine, so um, I'm fucked. Um, I don't even know what the price is now. Uh, I got spooked last night and just got rid of everything. That's what happens with Vivi. 
Uh, that's why I just like the things that I want to keep. Then it doesn't matter to me. But it's good to see you. I'm sure he'll be in there making a million dollars today. Uh, another yes, thumbs up. Uh, let's see. If Big A can't hop on with you, uh, and you have the folks who want to rip, we can hop on. Oh yeah, we could do that too. And you can use uh, our breeders uh, to sell packs. That works. Uh, we don't need want any cuts or anything. Uh, that is a possibility. That is definitely a possibility because I do have the reroller. I just don't have. Um, I don't have any good breeders. Uh, you want to folks you have opportunities you want to get them uh broski i want the um what's the one we need for the month i already forgot and if you have a big deal plan just shout all right i will let's see i got some whippets available if someone wants to mint them celia phillips stefan and all comments all right uh let's see stefan makes great white coat whippies i need to learn more about this uh what up with those comics any idea on the prices i don't so anyways, uh, my final thoughts on this, and you got like seconds now, two seconds to join the wait list. You're fucked now. You can't get it. You'll get this on the rebound. I, but in the end, I think Wolverine, I think it's worth getting. I think I'm going to go for it. I know it's 50. No guarantees you're going to make a profit, but I do. I think you will, in my opinion. I just don't know if you're going to have to spend 100,000 MCP points on that. So I, I just don't know. There's Vault. How you doing, man? I, I know he was getting his, uh, let's see, he got on the wait list the last second. Good job. I know he's getting some stuff done. So hopefully he'll be able to join the muzzle run race. Uh, with the weather problems, can't jump on, but have my dogs available. Okay, cool. Um, and we could do that and still have uh, Vox and Ghosty come on. I think it's critical to start thinking about uh, the money you get for the MCP points you spend. Even if it goes for 100 gems on the secondary, are 50,000 points worth 50? Yeah, it's a hard to get those points. And you really want to save them for something, you know, that's going to be crazy rare. Um, if it's over 500, then you might actually have a chance. If it's under 500, you know, all the whales, those accounts are going to get it. But because this has enough, because Wolverine has enough, I think you should be able to get this if you put in some points. I don't know if you actually have to put in 50,000. But let's go back to why we're here, because we are here for the addiction comic. And again, I do think that the uncommon because of the VV logo um, and the uh, ultra rare are going to do the best. Uh, well, that's not true. The secret is going to do the best. And just remember the crafting. We don't know exactly what's going to happen. I know Dr. Strange said he covered originally it was going to be one thing and now they've changed it. Uh, we call that rugging VV, but that's all right. We still love you for rugging us. Uh, but yeah, Mr. V's a smart guy. He knows what's up. And he he thinks about the market a lot. So I would pay attention to that. We got Hamoon in the house. How are you doing? Small alpha iPhone clock is delayed. So refresh or get in and out of the comic to get a rebound. Yeah, I do. I do do that, actually. Dano C, uh, one week ever will green drop will be 20 gems for any regular mint. I don't know if it'll be that low. Because I don't know if low mint Mick is even going to allow that to happen. <laughs> That's why. 15,000 MCP. That might be a good one. Uh, Box is better breeders, though. Well, I can have box on. We can have them on. Uh, I'd rather buy in secondary and save MCP points uh, for more scarce stuff. Yeah, we talked about that. I think that's probably a good play. Uh, what miss Vox? Good to know. Thanks, Vox. Oh, yeah. Talking about the whippets. Uh, let's see. I have a breeder, uh, but don't know how to breed except for my own dog. See, the breeders, the big thing is having the re-roller. Well, no, the big thing is actually having the good breeders, but then the re-roller that allows you to re-roll if you get a bad roll, because a lot of times that helps. Uh, Seth, Thermal, Luna, Tinsley, Galaxy, all great for rips from a Stefan. Seven is a 3 4 Tinsley. Vox really dives in. If you come to my stream, by the way, we got 95 people in here. Hit that like button. Good to see everyone. Um, I mean, I'm going to be doing Muzzle Run Race after this. I almost want to play the video again, but I don't want to get uh, killed by you guys in a video game. Uh, but Vox really dives in, and he's figured out a lot of things, and that's why I can't win. So thanks a lot, Mike. I appreciate it. But he's a good guy to watch if you want to learn. Uh, you fucked, <laughs> you can't get it. Yes. It's 350 SR this time. Maybe. That would be cool. Hey, we got Kobe Collects in the house. It's Happy Wednesday. It's Hump Day. Kobe Collects does the Pokemon HRO pack openings. He's looking. There's a free pack on HRO, and he will pay you a lot for Mint 1. He's looking for Mint 1s on that. So if you get it, uh, give me a call, and then I'll sell it to him. No, Kobe's a good guy. You can check him out, kobecollects.com, Kobe Collects anywhere. That's how you get a hold of him. Good to see you. I think Wolverine will do better than people think. I do. I think Kryptonian, I do too. And I also think the Moonflower is going to do well. 
I have no way to contact you anymore. Are you on Discord? We need to start talking through Discord because we got to get that puppy rolling. Uh, I'm saving my points. I'm not spending them. All right, so we've got 59 seconds. Now, you can go for it or wait. I know Alejandro likes to wait. I don't really think it makes a difference if you wait, uh, but it could. Um, I do think going right away has not paid off for me. So maybe you do wait a couple seconds. I don't know. MCP points for Star Wars. Uh, I wonder if that has something to do with crafting. I don't know. We're going to have to find out. I'm not happy about that. We don't know what's going on. Uh, you're guaranteed to score uh, with enough. Absolutely. Look who's here. We got Hanano. I saw him at like 2 a.m. in the morning. I think it was like 9.30 for him. 9 o'clock. Good to see you. The real Uncommon Podcast is the real deal. It's a great show. Um, and I joke that I suck, but I'm not joking. They are really good. And uh, Hanano, I talked a while ago about how like we're not streamers, but we are streamers now. We're kind of falling into place. So it's fun watching them. Uh, and they are trying to get subs. They're almost at 500. Once they get there and you can buy now, they are going to be doing lots of giveaways. Unlike me, because I suck, but you should definitely check them out. And Hanano, you are a moderator. If you want, put your uh, YouTube channel in here. You guys should check them out and join them. Um, they get the check mark of approval from me. Uh, let's see. I believe you crafting uncommon ultra rare. Yeah, if you get those. Uh, let's see. Smash that like button. Yes, please smash that like button. It's good to see everyone here. Uh, just on the final here, we got 70% going for this 96 votes. So we almost at the hundred, a uh, 70% going for it, 30%. This is a go. Uh, and I may even do a rebound. I may even do it. Yeah. You are, can do better than the S it's possible. I mean, it's absolutely possible. Smart is a smart buy. Remember there'll be four more Wolverine. Some may be better. Than, and that's the thing. Not only could they be better, they could be more scarce. So I don't know. There's Splint. Good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. Good to have you here. Uh, usually 120 of SRs, only 5,000 drop. Um, uh, let's see. Free says I spent uh, 50,000 MC points in the boxing drop and got the SR, sold it, and made 400 bucks. So that's kind of a thing. Yeah, and I bought that for a lot, and now it's worth like 90% less. I'm, that was a big fuck up for me. Imagine scoring 41 with, yeah, I mean, if you get that, that would be great. If you get the 41. Tony Dolce, good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah, I think I'm excited about Wolverine. I'm definitely going to be flipping in the market. Too. I heard Low Mint Mick has 880 Stormtroopers. I thought he has a thousand. I thought that was the deal. Yeah, there you go. I just saw that he had a thousand. You see, Kryptonian, you got to get back on uh, Twitter. I've still not bought mine. Let me know what you got in the chat here. Let me get caught up. Good, uh, good heaven. <laughs> good to see. I said it right, right? I think I said it right. Uh, three digits in the new free HRO packs are going for hundred. Are you kidding me? So what about four digits? Cause I was like, Oh my God, I got like 59 50. Cause there's like 800,000 of each one. Uh, Kryptoni, are you buying the, uh, Bitcoin on Elmon X? Oh yeah. Moonflower double in price. Since we started talking about, it. I know. And we got to talk more about it. We got to pump our bags. Uh, I put like, uh, already bro. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. And thank you for coming by. Thank you for hanging out with us. Uh, how quick we forgot about Hawks. I know it's true. Uh, skipping uh, that one, Bruin. I don't like the newer art stuff. Uh, let's see. Wow. Even with severe weather and possible turning off, FedEx just delivered uh, my new cars. That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Wait a second. Did you really get an SR? Damn. OG Vault. This is the one to get the SR on. Good job. I mean, I haven't even gone for mine yet. We got the biggest, bro. What do you mean, L? Didn't everyone? no did you just overslept right it's good to see you just in case if you guys don't know the biggest bro not only is he the nicest guy on vv he also has an 18 inch foot and we all know what that means it means he's the nicest guy on vv that's exactly what it means uh win congrats vault oh my lord w's look at all these w's uncommon Hey, Hidden Jester, good to see you, man. Got a rare. Uh, so you want the ultra rare or the uncommon today, I think, or the SR. Oh, still haven't gone yet. Uncommon for me. Yo, SR. I can't believe he got that. There's your local scopper. Good to see a high mint rate for me, of course. All the storm stormtroopers under 10 bucks. I should sell them all for a profit. Oh, you got them for that. Wow. Uh, almost skipped the drop. Good thing you didn't. All right, I'm getting, uh, let's get caught up here, getting back. My HRO, yeah, I would trash HRO on my free pack. So you should check it out. If you're on HRO, you just go in there, get your free pack. A sec, Hulk, 35, sold them for 80. Yeah, I don't do that. Uh, I got 
uncommon. You're lucky today. Good day. Hit the ultra rare scar. Congrats, Mark. What did you get? I have three XX action comics. HR. Wow, nice. Uh, what number did you get, Vault? I didn't see. Hit the ultra rare. Nice. Got the uncommon. We got lots of common gain. Are you kidding me, Alejandro? You're no longer at the top just because you have a family member who's a cardinal. I hate you. Uh, let's see. Hi, Mint on this drop. But if you got a secret rare, it doesn't matter. Um, man, all of you suck. All this. Look at this. Rare. Look at this. Good stuff on HRO. Granddaddy Crypto. Good to see you. There's D. Good to see you. Um, they rugged me last night on the stream because they got all the good stuff and I got the bad stuff. I'm just whining. It's all right. Nice, Kryptoni. You are killing it. All right, let me go for this fucking thing. Let's just do it. Let me get my comment out of the way. Well, it's a shit mint. That's a good start. I will go to see. I'm somewhere around that mint, uh, Danny. Oh, see, we must have uh, minted around the same time because I've, I've got that 44. Uh, yes, he's he's. He does. He certainly deserves it. The Cobra got the uncommon, which is what you want today, babe. You might want to. I don't know if you want to hold it, get rid of it, and buy it back. But that's. I think that might go up in value later. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, Bitcoin BMW. Good to see you. Common. Uh, let's see, Kryptoni. Let's see. Good. Good job, man. I hate everyone. I hate you all for doing it. Uh, now nah, I want more than a hundred. Yeah, you're gonna want more than a hundred easily. Four thirty three. Congrats, C. McCann. Good job. Dr. Strange hitting the ultra rare. Uncommon here. All right, let me go check out common. Let me go check out how I got rugged here by BB because why would anything good happen to me today? But I, I'll probably go for the rebound. If there are, I'm sure there'll be rebounds. Yes! Woo! Ultra rare, baby. Would have rather have had the secret rare. Got the ultra rare. It's because they rugged me last night. Fucking did it. Can't believe it. By the way, everyone, we are going to be doing some muzzle run. Uh, and we got rebounds here. But before we do the rebounds, I want everyone to know why muzzle run is so awesome. It's a web three Greyhound racing game. I do racing every week. I usually do two, three, four races a week. I give away free crypto. I get 400 plus dollars in crypto to give away to people. I'm trying to get more VV people involved so we can rug the muzzle run people. What is it? Would you like to know? You have no choice. Watch this, and I'll be right back. Let's go. Thank you, Voxton. The wifey saying hi to D. Yes, we got rugged and they hooked us up. Thank you, David. You, I almost hated you today, but now you're my best friend. No, you're not. You're not my best friend. There's Mission. I loved his little thing with all the stormtroopers. That was awesome, man. Uh, and he got rugged last night. Got a common, though. You should have been on with us, with Bruin and I. Uh, but Mission gets lucky on everything else he does. So um, I guess that's why. He can't win everything. He's got the cool wife and the fam and all the good stuff from all the other projects. So he normally does pretty well. So I'm not going to cry too much. But he did get rugged last night for sure. Uh, nice pull B. Too many SRs. Alter Rare is the better pull. I hope so. Wiggins of Hip Fire. I don't know. I've never seen you before. Was this worth going for? Um Yes, for me, <laughs> it was. Oh, by the way, we better get ready for those rebounds. You got about seven minutes, a little less than seven minutes. I'll tell you how to do it if you're lucky. Uh, so the question is, is it worth going for? I think if you get the uncommon and the ultra rare because it's got the VV logo, that's what people want. You're going to do well. Um, plus, you need the ultra rare, I guess, with the uncommon 
to get the I don't know to get this to get these secret one of these secret rares to craft these. We don't know the exact details because it says we'll find out details later. Hashtag BB soon. But Doctor Strange in his videos, and you guys should definitely check out his videos. He goes over all the comics. Uh, he had said originally we were told with the uncommon and the ultra rare that you would craft those and you would not burn them. So I don't know. We'll see what's going on. But uh, try to go for the rebound. I will show you how to do it only because I learned from the best. The best is OG Vault. Uh, and hopefully you'll get the rebound because I'm going to do it. Uh, I skipped last night, so I got fucked with the common. Yeah, that, it, trust me, it was worth it. I literally got two hours of sleep. I'm exhausted. There's Jeff coming in way too late to rug me, Jeff. Way too. Jeff is, by the way, anyone who likes to stream and win stuff, um, Jeff rugs you. He's got bad luck. But when you hook Jeff up with my son, then you get like the most amazing drop. So I don't know how that works out. But good to see you, Jeff. Now get the fuck out of here. I'm just kidding. I'm not kidding. Get out of here. Uh, Graz got the 498 uncommon. Congrats, BE uncommon for me. I guess I got to get the uncommon and keep it. Man, I don't know what to do. Tang Ma, good to see you. I think it's so. Oh, don't say that. I, there's always rebounds. Uh, we going? Yeah, we're going for rebounds. All right. So because my tablet's all left up now, I'm not happy about it. I don't know how to do this Apple thing. Now my thing's not taking up the whole screen. But what you're going to do is you're going to go to the page right here where it says public pool. All right. You're going to click that like three seconds. You're going to, you're going to be clicking down on public pool and then be ready with the other finger to hit the, the buy button. You're going to hit that buy button. And then the final buy button, you got to be quick. This is going to be one you're gonna have to be quick. And I'll tell you again, uh, by the way, here's the bullshit minty fresh numbers that I don't know for they're real. I'll explain them in just a second. Uh, Brunade, yes, good to see him. Yes, I, I truly can't complain because I've been on fire for some time now. This is a cool, yeah, you got to have a cool off stage, absolutely. No, wasn't told, was trying to guess which two would be. Oh, okay, he's still a good guy to watch, you should still watch him, but he just rugged us because I was all excited. I mean, that sounds about right, that's a pretty good guess. Uh, yeah, that's a good guess. I think it's a good guess. Actually, I've been here since the beginning, I still right? You probably, yeah, you'll rug me somewhere. I'm maxing out now. 420 gate work today. Absolutely. That works. OG Vault. Thanks, man. Uh, Tony Dolce. So we need the uncommon ultra rare and the new drop in order to grab. We don't know that for sure. Doctor was just thinking. Uh, now I think we'll need to own, get them uh, via the market. Ooh. I'm confused too. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Uh, missed the wait list. So waiting for rebound. Yeah. Uh, rebound in about less than four minutes. Our meta. Why will this sell out? Uh, because it's a VV comic. It's a VV comic. Just real quick, I believe 158 will be the first mint. Normally, it's the first mint on a 5,000. 1980, I believe, is David Yu's birthday. It could be 1981, but I found an article that said in 1997, he was 17 years old when he started first business. So I'm just going to go with 1980. 2018 is when VV was founded. It actually says on the comic, 2023 is the first of this comic. 2024 is this year of the comic. And 3537, boy, what a stretch, is the booth at NYCC where the first issue was released. And they had special issues. So there you go. If you want those, they are on Twitter. Um, but here you go. Just so everyone knows, again, if I can find it right here, BB founded in 2018. And you can't see what I'm looking at. Here we go. BB founded in 2018. There we go. So there, that's the real deal. Um, that's weird how I had the window window off. Of top. Uh, I could be wrong. Don't quote me. Yeah, we don't know what's going on. Yeah, there's a lot out there, but there are two at the top. Uh, there's cool off periods in racing too. I was on a dry spell for a while. Just landed second in the daily with a 1-1 one -one entry. Yeah, those 1-1 one -one entries are scary. Back on the winning train. Choo-choo congrats all right so two uh, minute 44 seconds again you're gonna want to go right here and you can't fucking see because i don't know what i'm doing right there where it says public pool pool right there you're gonna click on that fast and you're gonna be ready with the other hand to click the buy for the rebound i think this might be a good buy 
Uh, but if Smart Buy was still here, he could tell us. Anyway, we got 71 votes, 100, I'm uh, sorry, 71% going for this, 107 votes. Definitely, I think it was good. There is Kate, but we all know that's Reggie in Kate's suit. Uh, good to see Reggie. Uh, we've got a little bit over one minute, one around 90 minutes. Wow. That doesn't happen to me. SR Baby, we got Thomas. Uh, Freaking unbelievable. Always doing well. Bruin, send me some pasta. <laughs> Uh, my guess, Vivi will sell an addiction syringe. Woo. I mean, I saw that in there. That's kind of cool. All right. I got to get off the chat here. We got 46 seconds. Don't listen to my time. Actually, listen to it. That way I have more chance. Again, you're going to want to be hitting right where it says public pool. You want to be tapping real hard on there and then have the other finger ready to hit the other buy button. You might get lucky. There might be thousands of these less, but why not go for it? Um, by the way, I see you guys talking about the cow. I did do the cow switchover. Was that smart? Was that dumb for me to burn my cow? I don't know. This ad is in form using uh, to smoke some ganja. Nice. Ultra rare random mint. Yeah, I got a trash mint. Uh, got rare number 430. Uh, I don't think it means anything. All right, it's time to go, people. Get ready. Uh, but it should do okay. You might get your money back. You might not. I don't know. Come on, come on, come on. Got it. It's processing. I'm waiting for it to say process. You could try to get another one. Still is not saying process. Is it sold out? Processing payment. I can still buy another one. Ooh, I don't know what to do. Do I buy more? Oh, you can still buy as soon as I try to go for another one. So you can buy one. I might have just rugged myself. Yeah, I think everyone got a rebound. Uh, we don't have any, we're not going to get any numbers here, but it looks like I can still buy. So I'm going to go for my two and be happy. Uh, of course, yes, I didn't buy the rebound. I did just because that's how I do it. Uh, what's the lowest, uh, uh, what the fuck, 48, 47 common, really? On the rebound? Well, whatever, you got the SR, you're a millionaire. You won big. Tell us what you got. Double rebounds. You can get it, people, if you want it. It will sell out, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm not sure at all, actually. I have no clue what I'm talking about. It may or may not sell out. Um, but if you are here, we are minutes away from another rebound, which doesn't look like you're going to have to get. Usually at 18 after, then 20 after, and every two minutes. At 20 after, we are going to have uh, the market open. So I'm going to go into the market and see what I can do, make some decisions. Wow, Jeff got the alter rare. Let us know what you got. If you're new here, let me know what you got on the drop. Oh, my bad. Another rare. <laughs> Bought seven, received four. Uncommon rare, alter rare, SR. Well, all you needed was that one SR and you're good to go. Wow, congrats. What? Fifth, another SR. I hate you. You're, no, you're not allowed to come to my chat and win SRs. Or maybe it's good luck. 98 people here. Actually, my goal was to get 50, but with 98 people here, I want way more than 50. I want more than 53. I used to get like 75, 80 because I would beg for them. Uh, all right. So we got greedy one, went for three. Looks like you can still, I can still buy it. Uh, Hanano got the rare 41, 55. Uh, got two rebounds, three total, two comments so far. Okay. You've got, you've got the SR. Uh, two rares, 44, 84, and four. Wow. They're minting them close. Bought 10, got three SRs. Kurazami. Get the fuck out of here, man. Quit stealing all the secret rares. God damn. I still like you to leave. Please leave or give me one of them. And he's going to go in and uh, buy all the other secret rares and then sell them for double the money. So since I sold half of my collection, I've never been so lucky. There you go. Splint rare and ultra rare. One pending. Congrats. Bought four, three SR. SR. There you go. Congrats, man. Now you're not allowed to be here. Get the hell out of here. And thank you for your military service, too. I uh, bought 10 legends. Did you get an SR? Please tell me. Wiggins? Common. All right, let's see what I got here. I got a rare. Ah, I love this game. All right, I got the altar. I can't complain. Congratulations. Yeah, I mean, to get that one or to get all those like see and this is what they do then we see we're like oh they got sr so let me go for more and then i'll get all comments 
All right, so got seven. All right, uh, what did you get though? A uh, record? Uh, what set? You gotta tell us. Did you get SR? Oh my god, three SRs out of seven. Oh shit. Do I go for another one? I hate you people. Bought nine, two SRs. Wow. Market not open. Nope. We got a minute and a half. How much money do I have? Fuck it. It's only money, right? Can we buy more? All right, I'm gonna do another one. One more for shits and giggles, for streaming, for content, of course. Because my content is so good when I buy and I get a secret rare. Rare 399 list price. I don't know what those are going to come out. I mean, I don't know if those are going to do well at all. I would definitely sell the rares uh, ASAP, not financial advice. Uh, I don't know, 15, 20. It could be go for a lot more. You may have to check. I got zero comments out of seven. Wow. Look at you. Three SRs, one ultra, rare, one uncommon. Wow. Oh, and I got another trash mint. Uh, two uncommon. One common, one rare. I'm dumb, so I bought five, two common, one rare. You're like me, Big A. We can't win. We can't win this game. We cannot win. And Greedy won. He's too greedy. Can't win. All right. Seconds away from the from the market opening. I don't even know what my third one is. I'm sure, I'm going to get rugged. I don't even know what to do. But you know what? I'm going to snipe for a little bit here. Let's go ahead and put this tab up here. These are the minty fresh numbers you might want to be looking for. That might be a stretch on the NYCC first issue release, uh, but the market should be open now. So I'm going to go, I don't even know. I'm going to go look. I have no clue what I want to do with the rare. I think I want to sell the rare first. Let's check this out. Probably going to snipe for just like 15 minutes. Um, oh, what the heck? Ooh, what is that? That's what was rugging me, I think. Okay. Uh, it's not up. I'm not showing it yet. Anyone else see it? I bought three, one ultra, one rare, waiting. Yeah, I'm waiting for my next one, too. Yeah, Kryptoni, you've been lucky. Oh, it's sold out. Well, I'm glad I bought another one. Wow, barely half sold. Oh, you're who's lying? Who's, it's, it's not even coming up. I don't see it. Anyone else see this in the market? What are the... Yeah, I'm waiting to see what's going on. I've noticed sometimes the market is a little slow. I don't see it in the market, but I was able to list. Yeah, I don't want to list until I can see the market. There we go. All right, three bucks on the common. $4.99 on the uncommon. Oh my God. I'm just going to go right to there. Yikes. I don't know what to do. Secret rares at 80 and $5.99 for the rare. Well, that's a big rug. All right. So the uncommon, see if I can get a good uncommon just because. That's what I'm going to go for. See if I can get a um, something or one of the mints. Like I said, 158. 2018, I should just be on, on the comment. But if it comes up on one of these other ones. All right, why not? I bought that. That might have been stupid. I just bought the uncommon 566 for seven. Maybe that was a good deal. I don't know. Maybe not. Um, we'll see. I do think the uncommon and the ultra rares will go up. Um, what would be nice is if you got it and then you don't have to worry about it anymore. The rare is at 590, then it goes to seven. The altar is at 19. Secret rare is at 70. That's going down. Maybe the altar rare is going to catch up with the secret rare. Uh, maybe I can will it so. 279 on uh, the common. Ooh, I'll go for that. Can I get it? Didn't get it. F you snipers. Where are you, Casey BMW? Couldn't get that one. It was 340 for 978. Um, all right, I'm just going to keep giving you prices because I need to know when to sell. Let's see what we get. Let's see. Uh, I must have, yeah, there's a five purchase limit. Two uncommons at SR. It's still not bad. Rob Cook's good to see you. Just picked up the SR for 60. I think that might be a good deal. Bought four, one common, one uncommon, two rares. Kryptoni, congrats. What did D get? By the way, good to see everyone. Thank you for dropping by. If you're new here, uh, thank you. If you hold on, we're going to be doing some uh, racing here. Uh, I'm going to put my dog suit on. I'm going to become B-Dog. And we're going to have a lot of fun because some people are going to win some free crypto. And then, of course, everyone leaves and it'll be a nice, fun little group. Uh, hit that like button if you don't mind, though. We do have 100 people in here. It'd be nice to get that to like 60 or 100. Uh, I would like that. That would be nice. Uh, you What? You bought 20? Wow. Three commons. Two of them, three digits. Oh, not bad. Uh, one uncommon, one rare. Not so terrible. I agree. I still haven't looked yet. All right. So 
Uh, we're at 560 on the uncommon. I do think that's going to go up. The altar is at 750. 1750, that's going down. There is a 590. Um, and the secret is at 59. Is this sold out? Were we kidding? Is it you can still buy it? So there's 1259. This is selling out. Anyone who thinks it's not, I think it's gonna be wrong. It's gonna sell out. Um, then those prices might go back up, but don't go too crazy on this, Pete. I'm gonna hold on to my ultra rare and the uncommon at this point. And let's see what I got. Wait. Did I get, oh man, what did I get? I'm trying to see what I got on my third one. Wait, I, oh yeah, I bought one. Holy shit. I got another ultra rare. So I got a rare uncommon, which I bought a three digit and I got two ultra rares on the market. Ooh, I like that. I like that. I can keep one and I can sell one. That's the best position I could be in. Uh, bought 11, three commons, three uncommons, one rear, one ultra rare, and three secrets. Out of here. Get out of here. Now I don't even care about your family member who was a cardinal. I hate you. Unless you want to send me one of those. If you want to sell me one of those for 10 gems, I'd like that. Uh, let's see. Max 20, one secret rare, two ultra rares, four rares, uncommon, seven common, notable mints. Ooh, one, two, three, four. And 2023, congrats, man. That's good. 2023 is not worth anything. Put it up for like a dollar. I'll buy it. Um, all right. The so what's gonna happen once these sell out, these will go up. I think not financial advice, do your own research. We're already down to 490 on that uh uncommon. The rare is at 550. I'm not sure if that's gonna go above retail. 19 on the ultra rare. That I'm gonna keep. I think that's gonna go up. Not financial advice. We're at 50 on the comic, uh, on the secret rare. Um, man, I wish I would have gotten that 2023. There's 222 for 10. Somebody just pulled that off. Got that. I do think 1980, if you could get that, get a good three digit around four gems, might be worth it. Um, but don't go crazy. I don't know how well this is actually going to do. There is the man I've not seen in a while, man. How was your vacation? Good to see you, Michael Campa. He is the whale. We got two whales in the house here. Uh, challenging again to anyone that thinks... It has uh, bad luck. I bought 10, six uncommon, four common. Yeah, you don't have good luck. The only good luck you have is when you actually just go out and pay the full retail price for stuff. Not even the retail, the market price. Uh, how have you been doing, man? You definitely, ooh, there's $6 for a three digit. Maybe I was dumb to pay what I paid. Um, Yeah, Michael, we got to get you in on this uh, muzzle run action here. Greyhound Racing, like I said, I want you to come on a special stream with me and some others. So think about it. Um, I'm going to be doing that soon if you want to watch. Probably too late to get anyone a dog. But anyone who wants to sign up now, you do need a MetaMask. I always suggest you get a new MetaMask. Uh, it's just safe for any Web3 games. Just get new ones each time. Um, and you can join through my link that is pinned to the top. Uh, and then if you let me know, I'll get you set up. I'll get you set up stuff. Uh, five pulls, two rares, ultra rares, and two SRs. Wow. Uh, the 2023 is a rare. What do you think it's worth? So that's the first year this came out. I mean, if you don't have to get rid of it, um, I mean, I don't know what you're going to actually sell it for. You know, maybe 100 to sell instantly, maybe 200. Um, if you are not in any type of rush to sell it, I'd put it at 500 and just let it sit, maybe even a little more. I did not do well. I don't feel like I'll find out. I think I did. Purchased eight, got two SRs. Wow. So maybe I should have gone for more went for two more got two more commons sr prices are low yeah they are uh, uh jason Pena, good to see you hey b went for nine two srs and at least one each rarity what do you uh need minting the new oh what do you need for the minting we don't know um but if you got two srs sell one of those and then keep the rest i mean seriously that pays for everything um, I'm going to give you the prices now real quick for anyone who's still sniping. We're down to three on the, uh, original, on the common 450 on the, um, uncommon. They are probably going to be low until they sell out. The rare is at 488. Oh, look who's there. There's greedy one. Um, the addictions at 1869 then goes to 20. So it's moving up slowly, which is what I expect. Secret rare is at. 
Let's see where we're at here. We're at 50, and I expect that to go up too. Don't know how that how high that's going to go. Um, there's one for 45. I mean, it could go low, but we don't know with this crafting what is going to happen. So I like what Dr. Strange says. I've got two of the altar rares I'd like to say. Here's one for $16.99. I wish I could pick some up for like 12 because I think they'll go up from there, but not financial best. Good, Evan. I got three comments, five uncommon super rares and five ultra rares. I think you're going to do well on that. You definitely make your jemmies back. Yeah, SR prices are kind of low right now, but I mean, especially those who got a couple, I mean, the way I would do it is I'd sell one and then I'd hold the other to see what happens in the market. On um, the ultra rare, I'm not going to do that yet. I don't think I have to. I'm going to wait for that to go back up and see uh, how many are left. Let's check this out. Uh, 496 peeps. This is almost sold out. It is almost sold out. Let me refresh this. I bet you this is going to sell out on the next five minutes or less. Um, 496, maybe not. Let me go back out and go back in. I mean, it's probably going to sell out real quick here. Ha! <laughs> It's at 596. Now it's at 601. I don't know how that works. How do you gain uh, comics? Now we're at 601. All right. That's weird. Only on VV. Now we're down to 496 again. So maybe it will. If this is going to sell out. We we're just at 1200 like six minutes ago. So this will sell out. I don't think you should maybe go crazy and go buy a bunch. Um, but um, could be some opportunities out there. Ultra Rare back up to 18. Secret Rare is at 50. Um, and that uncommon at 450. I mean, again, VV logo um, could be worth having. 3245 for 492. I don't know how much longer I'm going to do this. I probably should have been sitting on this, actually trying to snipe stuff. Um, where does it say what comics are needed? It doesn't. It does not say it anywhere. I'm going to take these off because nobody cares. Let's go here. All it says here is uh, there will be two secret rare covers available for crafting. More details to come on crafting at a later date. Hashtag VV soon. By the way, 70 votes, peeps. We got 112 votes. Um, 70% went for this. 112 votes total. Love it. Uh, got 98 people in here. Good to see. We got. I know we have some new people lurking in the background. You can come out. Say hi. Say hi to everyone. Uh, 58 likes. Get that better, people. That should be at 70 easily. Really does help the channel, especially uh, since I don't make any money doing this. Uh, so I don't know if it does anything. Uh, two daily MCP points on those rares. Ledges, five commons, four rares, six uncommons, five ultra rares. Bought an SR for 44, landed 2018 common. Wow. Well, that is definitely probably one of the best ones because that one we know for sure is when VV was founded. Uh, so Ledges, I hate you. You're not get out of here. You're not allowed. What uh, crafting mean burning? No. So I think we heard you're not going to have to burn, but maybe that would be better if you did. If you had to burn these, uh, let me get you some prices. 1750 on the uncommon. The secret is uh, up to 50. Certainly going to be some good buys in there. Uh, let's check how many are left. We're down to 279. It's almost gone, peeps. If you want to get one, I still have 1923 symbiote. Is that worth any? I think so. That is the year Disney was born. Not uh not Walt Disney, but the actual company, Disney Brothers. That's when they incorporated. So I think 1923 on any of the Marvel Disney stuff is worth it. Others may not may disagree. They may say, well, Disney may not own them in the future. Right now, I think it's worth having. I've got 1923 R2D2 animated. So I I mean, I Definitely think that's good mint. I know Casey BMW collects it, um, but he won't pay a lot for it. 256 left in the market. Uh, I wish we knew how many secret rares there were. I think we can look that up. Um, all right, let me. What's nice is we can actually see the comics showing up this one all the time. Uh, yep, there you go. Uh, Uncommon 449. So it looks like it's going up just a tad bit. Still 18 on the ultra. Rare. Once these sell out, Pete, they are going to go. Uh, and 51 on that secret rare 399 on the rare sucks and 299 on the common but man that 2018 on the common that is killer that is killer all right let's see jeff i got x-men number two sr mint 999 and x-men 97 number two mint 99 oh wow how much can i sell so i sold 
on a crappy one, I sold my 999. Not even a crappy one. It was actually a decent one. I only sold it for 25. Uh, but on the SR, holy crap. A, a good amount. Uh, what was were they both SRs? And X197, I it depends what it is. That 97, that may only be a little bit above retail. Uh, maybe 10, 15 above retail, but I don't know for sure. All right. I think I am. Let's see. Oh, now the prices are going up. Uh, that just means that it's about to be sold out. It says 256 left. I don't believe it. No, it still says 256. So we might, it might be another 10 minutes before this sells out, but it should be pretty quick. I also may not be very, oh no, it's sold out now. It's definitely sold out. All right. So there you go. Now prices are going to go up. Um, there you go. It, it it says 256 remaining, but it's sold out. Um, there could be a rebound here uh, in a second, uh, but it does say sold out. I don't think that's going to happen. So prices should go up a little bit. I don't know where they're going to stay because we don't know what we need. Uh, but let's check this out and then let's do some muzzle run. Um, all right. Two dollars. Oh, I'll buy that. Are you kidding me? Probably somebody bought that. Nope, I didn't get it. Fuck. It was a common for two. I'm like, I'll buy that for two. There's 917 for 250. I'll buy that. Why not? Come on. I didn't get it. I'm not direct plugged in, so I'm not going to do well today. Uh, 490 on the uncommon. That's going up. The rare is at 490. That's staying about the same. Ultra rare is at 20. That is moving up. And the secret rare is still at 50. So it is possible that that ultra rare might actually flip the secret rare and i'm only saying that to pump my bags remember because if i'm talking about it i'm pumping my bags and if any other creator is they're also doing the same um oh wow got down to 68 now on who went for this all right hit that like button who is ready for some muzzle run who is ready to get out of here if anyone is interested let me know uh if you sign up under my link i'll actually know later Probably too late for today, but if you sign up under my affiliate code, which is linked to the top here, um, I will figure out how to get you uh, a racer, get you involved for free, and you can join all the free races I do. And I do five, four to five hundred dollars worth of free crypto every week. It's not a scam. You literally don't have to spend one penny, but most likely you will get addicted to this game. Uh, they are working on the graphics, but overall, it's just a fun game to race my races are made so you can just kind of win uh, you don't have to dive in too much uh but some of the others you can get more intricate into how to actually race uh yes he's voxen's definitely we got the muzzle run people this is when everyone starts leaving uh but i'm gonna do one more just in case you're new here one more i'm gonna have to make new ones here i'm gonna do one more time if you don't know what muzzle run is you are missing out let's check it out one more time and then we are going to transition into muzzle run. And there you go. I'm trying to recruit VV people so we can knock off people like Boxing and Ghosty. Even though they are great people, I want VV people to be successful in the Web3 world, and I want them to kick some butt. So even if you're a little scared, like I wasn't too much into the crypto part. I set up a new MetaMask. I got helped out, and here I am. And now I'm actually streaming this stuff. So um, if you're interested, go ahead and use my affiliate link. I normally don't like clicking any links, but this is why I say... Just start a new MetaMask and you don't have to worry about anything. I'll even get you a few pennies so you can do all the transfers and stuff. Sign up. Let me know today. Let me know in a DM on Twitter and I'll figure out how to hook you up. Uh, rebound 2010 rare. Wow. 
Oh, there was a, just a rebound. He's excited for Wolverine. We're excited for Muzzle Run. Uh, one more time. Yeah, I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm up over 120 Matic in free races. Yeah, I mean, in last month, and my wife is up 75, been kicking butt. Voxton's been kicking butt. I just broke the five Matic race winning mark. Wow, congrats, Voxton. That is like, well, last month, that was more than 5,000. Right now, he's averaging about 5,000. That is really insane. Started in mid-December, and I've made a dollar. Uh, love all the couple. Yes, there you go. So anyways, uh, if you don't mind, hit that like button one last time. Even if you're leaving, this is when people leave. But seriously, VV people, we have, I really do have free crypto. Um, yeah. So let me, hold on a second. I got to get a few things ready here. I think I've got this set. Let me see if I can do this quick switch over here. It's probably not going to work out. Uh, but. Let's try it. I've got 34 seconds to do this, everyone. Let's see if I can switch everything out. All right. I'll be right back. What's up, everyone? I am B Dog. All right, so I didn't get everything done in that time. I thought that was a pretty good transition. There we go. Let's get my name right, B Dog. I am right now in a in a hot tub here, having some pizza. I'm a little fucking salty about last night, but it looks like it worked out because the uh, ultra rare now was going up, and now it's going back down. Got up to 25. It's going back down. I'm just going to hold on to it and lose more money. Anyways, we are here for a muzzle run race. So who's excited? You are going to get rugged, everyone, including myself. Uh, I don't even know if my uh, wife is here. Is Shelby Cobra here? Should I even warn her that we're going to do a race? I feel like that's not smart, but I could. But here, let's do this. Let's let's get what we're going to just a little idea of what we're going to be doing. Let me share my screen here. You got to love uh, being AI because they must be on crack over there because this does not look right. But this is what we're going to do. This is the yeah. What the heck is that, people? I'm like, can you do a rug, a big rug up top? I don't know. And then it turned like a dog and there's a guy. What the heck is going? It's like Indiana Jones in here riding. The, that is not at all what I asked uh, being a there. Here's. A horse, I didn't even know, and some dogs, and another guy back here. I think being a, I might have been doing some smoking. I'm not sure. Uh, but yes, uh, we are here now. Yeah, B Dog D, this is B Dog. Roof. Don't worry, I will not be entertaining. Uh, hey, B Dog, what my miss? Yes, tell B E. I said thanks for the VB stream. I will, I will tell him, even though he is still a little salty about everyone doing that. She's on a call. There she is. Looks like a hearty grade. You're speaking a language that I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Raiders of the Lost Bark. Ooh, I like that's a good name for a dog, too. Ooh, I like that. All right. So here's the question. I know we've got a good amount of people in here, but we really don't. So just to help me out, please put in there if you are into racing. Put hashtag race. I just want to see. You don't even have to do a hashtag. I just want to see who's here for the race. Just put race or hashtag race. And try to get an idea. If you're not doing muzzle run today or you're interested in this is for people who actually have dogs ready to be in the race that can make the right number. Uh, how dare you know what a t uh, tardy grade is? Okay. All right. We're, we're counting here. I can't multitask. All right. This is getting crazy here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Where's um where's big A? Is he in a tornado? 
think I got all that. Big A. So we're at like 14. It's 28. 15. Come on. What do we got here? I think that might be it. All right. I'm going to go pull up the race and see where I'm at. Definitely 32. I just wish we could do a little bit more than 32, but not 40. Anyone else here? I got you, Kryptoni, already. I actually counted you already. Holy cow, I almost screwed that up. That would have been bad. Um, we'll go do that. We're going to only allow two. Oh, you're kidding, sis. There's a problem. Um, Bruin, uh, let's see. Log out and make sure. I think if you log out and log back in, you should be okay. You should be. Um, but yes, if you're just joining me, I am B Dog, and we've got some muzzle run racing here. This is a Web Three Greyhound racing game. The dogs and the breeders are NFTs, and you can breed them, race them. You can even burn them for training points if you get a bad dog. All right, so we've got race sixteen. We're about sixteen right now. It's going to be close. We got anyone else? Anyone else lurking in the background here? Oh, delete the app and reinstall. I can wait. I can wait as Reggie tells everyone that we're about to race here. Uh, anyone else sitting out there? I still may go with the 32 because I don't want to be racing. Bruin, um, fuck. Let me make sure I got this right. I got you, JR. I got you. Um, all right, I'm just making sure I did this. I probably did not do it right. You know, I don't know what I'm doing. This is all messed up. I'm going to go to create tournament, but I'm not quite ready. Make sure you have your word phrases. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's probably good. Bruin, are you going to kill me if I get started here? Because I really wanted you to be in, but I will do another one for you, Bruin. We'll make it make it easy. Butters, uh-oh. Uh, man, that's like 35. We're going to be five. We're going to be waiting here for five fucking people. Uh, it's an or, okay, here we go. We're going to learn out what it is. an, uh, organism that can take radiation. It's probably extraterrestrial and can rearrange its DNA. Okay, perfect. Uh, uh, don't wait for me. All right. So I am going to do 40 because I think we're going to fill this up pretty quickly. Everyone, you can do four dogs. You can't do four dogs. You could do two dogs. We have 40 people. I could do, I don't want to do, do we want to do a long one? I don't want to do a long one. I like my short ones. Wife on lunch, she's going to try to get in. Okay, perfect. That's plenty. Uh, so everyone have your stuff ready. Have your sit and go ready. Um, Yeah, let's see. I, I'm going to set mine up here. I'm going to leave the rug thing up. All right. I am going to, let me take, I got a bunch of windows up here. I'm going to take them off. I'm going to get this puppy going. All right, here we go. Let me make sure. I'm not going to look at chat for a second. I got to do one other thing here, and then we're going to get this party started. Could happen at any second. All right. Race is about to go live, everyone. Once I see, I'm nervous. Who's nervous? There we go. Good luck, everyone. You might have to be fast. Oh, and I've got something for you. I've got something to make you nervous when it's time to enter this race. Thanks to Ronnie Lido, I fixed it up a little bit. All right, it's going to any second now, it's going to come up. You better be quick. I tried to get two in yesterday on one of mine, and I fucked it up. All because I had a bunch of stuff going on on my computer, probably slowed it down. But hopefully I'll get two in. Should be able to get at least one in here. Um, man, where is it? It's not showing up yet. Don't worry. Come on. I know it's already accepted it. Oh, my Lord. This is driving me nuts. I can't tell you, Raven. I'd have to kill you. You don't know what I'm doing. You just have to be fast. There we
Bam! That was perfect. It literally ended at when we were at 40. All right, everyone. You probably tried to read it. I don't even know if I got it right, but here we go. Informer presents B Dog's Rug Fest. Can B Dog rug the chat by winning his own race? You must suck to get to the finals, but the final results will be in the normal order. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seven place gets 1,000 froth. Why? Because maybe I'm guessing I'm going to be seven place. Probably not. I will get rugged in this. Uh, but this is definitely... Oh, Doctor Strange, I I bet you my um, music stopped because I can't do MetaMask and that. I was lucky to get in. Um, I think it was just kind of busy. Bad dogs to make the finals with good dog prize placement in the... Yes, exactly. Exactly. I don't even know how that works out. Uh, that timing was perfect. I, I, I did it right. This should be interesting. Yeah. This gives everyone a chance. I got a new terrible dog and it wouldn't let me put it in. Literally. I had everything. You could do whatever rip. Didn't get any in. I'm glad I put it at 40. Um, we got one minute into this next one. Let me go ahead and share this screen here. Let's go ahead and check this out. Sorry for the people who didn't get in. Uh, but again, this is a rug fest. Uh, we got to wait about 30 seconds here. Um, here, let me make this look a little better. Shrink it up a little bit. There we go. We can go, we can go to there. There we go. All right. So let's see who's frothing. Again, like the order is all messed up. I don't remember. Somebody wants to like put it out in chat. You can. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the heck I did. So maybe you want to be frothing. I think you want to be near the end, but you could still do okay if you're doing well. But it is, you know, you got to be bad and then good at the end. Oh, wow. Ghosty's frothing on one. Ronnie Lido. And I am fucking wonderful. Just my luck, everyone. All right. Well, we'll see what happens with that. Again, when I try to cheat, there's this thing called karma that just doesn't allow it to happen. Which, of course, this is why I'm a little salty, as you can tell in the back. But, man, that pizza's good. And this this water's really warm because I just pissed in here. It's nice. It's a good hot tub. I picked it up on Open Sea for 3 Matic, so I'm happy. Um, By the way, our Michael is Liberty Spitting. Really? Oh, yeah, we got to have you on, too. All right, so after this, we'll do some type of deal. Here's the first race. I'm thinking for the first per I got to think what I'm going to do here. Um, I don't even know if it's a good deal. Look at that. Dookie Dasher, I'm going to get screwed. I think I got the worst point. Literally got the worst amount of points. Holy crap. Well, that did not work out well for me. And always, I hate my life. I'm telling you, I think Tom and Low Budge are out there making sure that I don't screw over. All right, so we got the Light Knight. I don't know. Whatever. Bend over. Kryptoni over there. And stop winning Big A. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, my Lord. I'm frothing twice. Literally, these are my worst dogs. And they're frothing. Wow. Okay. I hate, I hate you all. Let me go back here. I'm going to go pull up the, um, man, I just closed some windows down. Let me pull up the race here so I can have it ready to go. I cannot believe I got rugged already. 40 seconds. 40 seconds in the next race. Um, all right. Let's see what we got here in chat. Never text while the TV is on. I said I'm going to smoke a bowl for good luck. I knew what you were saying. Uh, my worst dog's frothing. Love to see. Yeah, right. Isn't that a uh, wife said she got an error message. Couldn't get in. I think there's a lot of people trying to get him. Um, I, it doesn't matter. I got two in and I'm frothing. So, um, by the way, let's take a look at the comic right now. So the addiction comic did come down. So, you know, most people say, get rid of it quickly. It's usually true. Um, I have some faith that this might go up, but there's certainly no guarantees that it will. But I'm not going to spend any more money. Worst case, I can sell one, and that will pay for two, and we'll see where we end up. Hopefully, I get to craft one, and we'll see what that does. All right, so here we go. Uh, stop winning Big A. Oh, don't rug me at the last minute. Are you fucking kidding me? 
Second again. Look at that. Worst place twice in a row. Literally the worst place. I'm going to have to remember that for next time. Next time, B-Dog, remember second place is where... <laughs> God damn. Oh, my Lord. All right. Well, let's go to the next one. Since I have no chance, maybe the wife will have a chance here. Look at that. All right. I got to go check the scoring because um, I have no clue what's going on. All right. So in this one, we got Goosey Lucy, Cobra Dojo, Frothing, Not Good, Indigo, Nickel, and Crip Boney. Wow. How do you guys? I don't know how you do this. Um, but here, let me let me go in and check the point system so I can see how I rugged myself. So it's oh no, actually second isn't too bad. Two, three, two, three, four, seven, six, five. Okay, so actually second wasn't so bad. It's not great. Um, I mean, I'm nowhere near the top. Um, I'm gonna have to win or lose or something, but I guess that's still good. All right, so I feel a little better. A little better. So second place is where you actually so maybe I was rugging everyone there um all right second place is three points fifth place if that makes it yeah no nothing makes sense in my races but this is that my hope is that everyone has a chance but it always seems that like reggie wins and ronnie lido so i don't know all right we are now back to our intimate crowd here we got up to over 100 we've got 39 people and we got to 61 like if you're just joining me, hit that like button. It really does help me and um, gets me ready for doggy style. All right, we got Crip Boney in the front. We got a short sprint here. Um, what is going to happen? Looks like Crip Boney is screwed. Indigo is going to get second. But who got first? Nickel, Reggie, and Shadow Inferno. So congrats, people. Since I wasn't in that, I actually mean it. Uh, did I close down my window? I did. I suck. I have no clue how to run a stream. I really don't. Um, let me, uh, where am I going? Sit and go. I got to go find this fucking thing again. I already lost it. Um, all right. God damn it. I need to hire new staff. I'm going to fire this one. Uh, wait, what is going on here? Are we still going? Oh, here we go. This is the one we need right here. All right, let's see who's frothing. Good luck, everyone. Two pump jump. The wife is in here. She's not frothing. Alejandro, Ken Ojo, and Yada Peanut Gallery Stables. They are frothing. Uh, but again, as we see, that doesn't necessarily mean anything. All right, good luck. Let me get that next one going. I cannot believe I'm already out. Already out of the race. All right, good luck, everyone. Uh, so I was trying to, yeah, thumbs up. All my dogs are too fast. Yeah, Krypton, I can't even cheat. My dogs are only good at turning right and turning slow. Man, I just hate mine at the very end always rug me. So, all right. So I'm trying to think of my deal. Do this. Hold on one second. That is. Um, and if I. Five. How does that work out? I'm just trying to think what I can do here. Mm. All right. I don't know what I want to do yet. What's your best uh, boxing? What's the best dog that you have that we should that you would suggest somebody should breed off of? If anyone even want, does anyone even want to open packs? Before I tell you any of the deals, Dutch Master. Look at Don Ojo. Taking second, which we know is not anything great, but it's not horrible. Uh, Peanut Galley, look at that again at the bottom. Bread and Butter and Reggie, all the good players I'm trying to rug. Two Pump Chomp, the wife got rugged. All right, well, there you go. That's how the cookie crumbles here. Jeff Goldblum is frothing Vader and Ben 33444, Miss. All right, good luck, everyone. We'll get this up. Share that tab. Let me tell you who's who is it, who is in first. Who's on first? Uh, right now, of course, this is going to change. We got Midnight Flame, Bread and Butter, Ken Ojo. Uh, we've got Reggie, we got Ghosty, uh, Fifax, Nickel, and Ronnie Lido. All the people I don't want to be in there. Um, and I'm nowhere near the top. I'm like, fuck. 
and the wife is not near there. But of course, this all can come down to you get a win and you never know what's going to happen here. But yeah, I'm, I'm doing trash here. So uh, I hope the good people do bad in the next leg so I have a chance. That's what I really hope. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Michael is our top reader. 380 uh, over. Very rare. Trinity is close. Second, 378 rare. And both great options. I'm over this game. Don't be over, babe. Don't forget, you win like the 60 froth from Mo that you can buy half a rabbit with. Ever thought about doing a best of the worst and then regular one to teach people how to dial in dogs to win? Yes, but see, if I do that, then the people who don't know how to play will never win anything and then they'll never be excited. But yes, I have thought about that. I'm just waiting for me to learn how to play the game. <laughs> That's what I'm waiting for. As soon as I've mastered it, then we'll do that. Don't worry. We'll do another one for those who stick around. We'll do something. All right. Look at that. Kristen Weiss there getting first and second at the last place in Legends. Good to see that. All right. So we are going to go. Not it is. Not, let's see. Is this all updated? Midnight Flame, Better and Butter. It's all the same people. All right, but we'll go get the schedule going here. Let's go to the next race. Yep, we've seen them all. We got one minute until the next race. Let's see who's frothing here. Frothing is not necessarily the worst thing, but it's not great. Am I in this? Oh, Dookie Dasher. And I stopped winning Big A. And probably both are going to be frothing in this. How long is this fucking thing? Uh, what is this? Oh, it's at 200? Oh, man. How do I make it so they're not so short? <laughs> I'm not going to do well in this. Crap. All right. Well, good luck, everyone. And when I say good luck, I mean, I hope you lose. I really do. I really, I promise you that I hope you lose. Let's see how much I'm losing on my addiction comic. Uh, it's down to 17, then it goes to 19. I'm trying to find its middle ground there. Um, I kind of think Muzzle Run would benefit from a rookie group, only new. I agree, who registered a kennel that month. I've actually thought about that. Smaller prize pool, but more uh, even competition. I completely agree. Bring those obstacle courses back. Those are my favorite. No, I completely agree. And Chris completely does not agree. <laughs> so He's like, I want to keep winning. But don't worry, everyone. I am not at all salty about this. All right, so all that matters is that my Dookie Dasher doesn't fuck me in the end, which normally is what happens. Come on, stop winning Big A. Come to the back. Dookie Dasher screwing me over. It does Big A. Look at that bullshit. Fifth and second. I don't care. Voxton taking last. Fifax uh, second and Wapmiss third. I hate you. And I had both my dogs in there. So that's it. It is over for me. Here's 2-2. Two, two. Who's frothing? Light Night, Goosey Lucy, The Wifey, and Don Ojo. Ken Ojo. I don't know why I said Don Ojo. All right. Well, let's get this up here. So I can just watch everyone else win my race, which is my favorite. At least we're keeping keeping up with it. Did you guys get nervous with my little um, racing thing there? Did you like that? Did you like, I was trying to do, this. I was trying to do that. Um, first of all, I fixed it because Ronnie Lido told me it sucked, which he was right. But did that make you a little nervous? That's, that was the whole point of that. I'm going to come up with some better stuff. Uh, let's see. You should do a high price small race for people who name starts with A. I completely agree, and I just changed my name to A. Uh, let me ask. That is so big A. I agree. I like the idea. A, either A, B, or uh, C, right? Alejandro, B Dog, and Cobra. I like it. Oh, my Lord. I'm so pissed. Totally fucked myself on this. These short races. Are the next one's going to be longer? What do you got? We, these are all short races. Are you kidding me? They're all short. How does that work out? 
They're all short races. That's unbelievable, which is my worst whatever. Oh, fuck my life. All right, uh, look at that. Uh, Midnight Flame first, KKW Racing second, Pushing Daisies, Box One third. Ken Ojo taking that shitty place. And the wifey, Goosey Lucy, not doing too well. Babe, we are not going to be winning anything today, at least in this race. Uh, so, yeah. So, let's enjoy. <laughs> She's so over this. She is so over this. Not only because of my horrible streaming. Uh, she's just over losing. All right, so we got Purinity, Jeff Goldblum, and Crip Boney frothing in here. Uh, yeah, let's see what's going to happen here. I have no clue. Other than I'm not going to win. That I, that I have a clue about. I'm pretty sure that's that's how this is going to happen. All right, there's two pump chump. I'm sure she'll be frothing again. All right, so uh, let's see. Sprints make best of the worst very random. Absolutely. Plus, then you take in my shitty scoring. That makes it very random. Um, I would love to get a couple packs, but for some reason, it's not letting me buy Matic on MetaMask right now. Yeah, I think there's been a lot of issues uh, with that. Not sure why, but I'm amused with BE's commentary. I think it's because he's unfiltered and amateur. What did you call me the other day? Uh, I think it was you who said... I was like raw. It was like a backhanded compliment. It was awesome. I loved it. It was like, you suck. You're awesome. Or like it's something like that. I don't know. Whatever it was, most people would be offended. I found it hysterical. So, yes. Thank you, Wapmas. You're no longer allowed here. Get the fuck out of here. All right. 200 meters. Who's going to win? Don't really care. Actually, I do care. I, I need somebody to win here who's going to rug somebody who's rugging me right now. But I know Reggie and all you bread and butters and all you good players. You're so you've been playing for 15 years. There's no way we can do it. I frothed on every race. I know it's horrible. I'll rip one pack off the Michael. Who do I send to? Um, you can send to me, and I will give you a uh, a training point too. All right, so there we go. We've got uh, Fortune Fish. Actually, if you put um, exclamation muzz, that should bring up my address. Can you try that out? Actually, put that in the chat. Put ex actually, let me let me see if it works here. I'll try it myself. Does it work? Is the bot botrix gonna fucking work? There you. What the fuck? That's not the right one. Uh, there it is. Look at there. I don't know if you can copy that. If not, let me know and I'll I'll figure it out. I'll put it in Discord. All right, here we go. Let's get into this one. Who is frothing on here? Am I on here? Oh, Indigo, Indigo, full blown, and Dutch Masters. Good luck, everyone. And when I say good luck, I mean please gotta let two pump chump win because that is my wife. And if she doesn't win, that guarantees no doggy style. I mean no style. Nothing's nothing's gonna happen. Probably nothing's gonna happen anyways. But there's more chance because I did get how many likes did I get in this fucking thing today? Lord, 62 and I had over 100 people. That's crazy. Uh, all right, here we go. Who's going to win? Uh, let me know if you're unable to copy. You may not be able to copy that. Um, what on this? And boxing, I don't even know where to send this to. We don't have we got to get in touch on some platform i've had you on here before i forgot where i said i probably sent it to uh to disc oh they rugged oh i guess that's okay could be worse wow look at that so boxing fucking us bread and butter all the good players it's wonderful so wonderful everyone all right well we're almost we're almost done let me hear oh, let me do this here let's go see here two five we're on to the we're gonna be on to three one here in just a second um let's see yeah discord would be pretty easy uh both my dogs are running against each other today in the same race as well all right, so let's see. On this one, we got Ronnie Lido frothing. We got uh, RJ frothing, Bolero, and Ken Ojo frothing. Oh, there. Oh, you did get in um, Doctor Strange. Cool. 
that's somebody I want to see win. Because he hasn't won. He's won, but he hasn't won much. And if I'm not going to win, well, then fuck you all. All right, let's go check out who is going to be in this so far. Ghosty rugging us. Midnight Flame rugging. Nickel 305 kind of new. Whoa, look at you, Reggie Go. Got two there. Bread and Butter, Fifax, and Peanut Gallery. Literally all the wrong people. Holy shit. But it's anyone's game. Kind of wish uh, Tom would let me. Feel oh, we just got a switch there. Uh, probably made my life harder. It did. Still all the same people rugging everyone. So good luck. We're going to get to the finals. Basically, if I don't do something big here, it is over for me. And these are quick races. It's like they knew. All right. Don B1. Oh, Lady J. Come on. Look at that. Oh, no. Go slower. You got third. That's okay. That could be good. All right. So, Freak, congrats on that. I like that. I like Ronnie Lido. He's winning big, but at least it's not the people have been doing it a lot. And it's not out. So, we got Dr. Strange. Cool. Good to see that. Good to see that. All right. So, here we go. Well, now we're going to go into... We're going to go into our third round. Oh, that was it. Actually, we already had who was frothing here. All right, Vader. Of course I'm frothing. Well, there you go. That's it for me on that. I'm not going to win on, on a 200. I'll definitely hit the front. All right, so we've got that. Uh, let me... Uh, oh, actually, here. Let's go do this. I'm going to go check to see uh, how bad the entrance is. Okay, so we still got... Ghosty, Bread and Butter, Midnight Flame, Nickel 305, Midnight Flame, Reggie, Reggie, Bread and Butter. Basically the same fucking people. All right, come on. We need to do some rugging here. I need some people to do some winning. I need some BB people here to kind of pull this out of their ass. Good luck, peeps. Uh, Wapmamis, do you have my address or no? Do you still want to do it or are you changing your mind? And then Boxton, let me open up uh, uh, what the fuck? Uh, what am I doing here? I have no clue what I'm doing. All right, so I'm going to go into Discord. All right, let's see what we got. Dude, I'm going to put don't. Actually, let me put it in. I'm going to put it in the uh, newbie chat. That way less people will see it. I'm going to put it in here only for Vox and, or, and Ghosty too if you want to go. I spell that wrong? I think I did. Wow, this is this did not turn out the way I wanted it, people. It absolutely did not. Well, that is it for stop winning big A. No chance there. Um, I'm also gonna put that um Watma miss. I'll put the address in there too. All right, so here we go. Voxen, I've got it in there. When you're done with that, I'll erase it. Watma miss. Let me. All right. So we got uh, Kristen free and box one. Cool. Good job pulling that off. That should help rug some people. And Jeff Goldblum, Ken Ojo, and Ronnie Lido are frothing in this one. Let's get that going. Let me click around here a little bit. Got that one coming up. And let me get you an address here. Watma miss. Must have run. All right. I just got to re log in like a third fucking time here. All right. So, Wapmus, in the newbie chat, I put my uh, address in there if you want to rip. It's 15 Matic. You'll get a point. Uh, yes. All right. Oh, my Lord. I cannot believe this. Okay, who's in this? Uh, the Cobra Dojo's in here. All right, babe, you got to really pull this off. You got to get a win here. Because I there's no way we're going to win any money off of this. I'll send you now? Okay, cool. I'll keep an eye out. All right, and I guess uh, Voxton, I've got that in there. If you, I guess you're going to send me the dog, and then we'll, if you want to come on talk or not come on just let me know when you got that sent and then we'll do a rip and see if anyone else wants to do some insane deal 
And if Wapamas ends up liking my deal, he'll get first dibs. But probably gonna be expensive. All right, two pump chump getting rugged there at the very end. Oh my lord. Nope, not gonna be enough. Don't think that's gonna be enough there, babe. You needed that last place. All right, three, two. Let's go to three, three here. Good luck, everyone. All right. Oh my lord, I've got I missed all of this stuff. Can't copy Addy was just messaging Discord. Okay, you got Discord. Oh, it's not the full address? Hold on a second. I'm going to give me one second here, Vox, and I'm going to put it back in here. How is that not the full address? Yeah, it is. It's in there again. That's the right one. Should be the right address. All right, let me turn this horrible music off. Let's get Voxton on here, man. There he is. Finally, somebody who knows what he's talking about. <laughs> what up? What up? Good to see you, man. Good to see you, brother. Yes, I'm not doing a good job here. Let's see. Oh, we got to watch the race, don't we? We got a race going on here. Yeah, I'm getting rugged. You're doing pretty good here. I think you're going to be in. Hey, e -E, Muzz address is not your... Wait, what? Yeah, so the in, in the Discord, it's got the full address, but it looks like it's cutting off a handful of the uh, digits on the YouTube comment when the bot responds. It ends at the oh, A7. Oh, on the bot. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I yeah, thought he meant YouTube in Discord. Chat, okay. It's leaving off like 15 characters because I think it's going too long for a YouTube comment and just cutting it off. Gotcha. Well, this is why I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So, <laughs> I just well, here we go. Support. Yeah, I've, I've had to fix some things on there too. Didn't work out. Holy crap here. This sucks. Come on, Dookie Dash. You're supposed to suck. And I'm out. I'm completely out. All right. So I tried to rug everyone. Did not work out. But nickel and then bread and butter, bread and butter. Look at that rugging going on. We're almost done with this. Thank God, because I stand no chance. I'm just going to go right to the damn thing. I don't even care at this point since I'm not winning. Who cares? But let's go ahead and check. Let's actually check and see. Who who is still in this? Ghosty's in for sure. Locked in. Ronnie Lido. Look at that. Midnight Flame Free is in there. So I like to see that. Peanut Gallery. Kristen New. We got new people. Bread and butter nickel. Cobra Dojo. Too little, too late. Um, there's no way she can win. But uh, there's a lot of people under there that could still actually get up. And uh yeah, I'm completely out. I hate my life. All right, Mike like should be in kennel and ready to rip, brother. Okay, all right, so let me check here. Got the got the money. All right, so let me go pull up the kennel here. We got the race up. All right, let's see what we got here. Let me go to recent. Uh, let me do a, a full page reset. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer than it should. Always worries me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Which one is this? Oh, it's a... Uh, uh... should be the Michael. All right, hold on. Let me... <clears throat> it's... I don't have it yet, but sometimes it says it take a few minutes. It takes a minute. To... It's still showing under my kennel for now. It should okay, all right. That makes me feel better. I'll check back in a yeah, second. He's, he should be there now. He just left mine, so... Uh, let's see. Wow, got one in the music. Definitely got me again. Yeah, see, that's the that's the whole point of the music. Does it get you, boxing? Are you you as cool as a cucumber? I yeah. I mean, it it makes me nervous, but you know, seeing where it's going each time um, definitely makes <laughs> it a relief. Seeing the kennel names, you know. Yeah, it's definitely here. Let me get this last one out of the way here. Uh, wait a second. Do we have two more? Yeah, we got one more, right? One more. Let's go ahead and just go right in. This is your. This is where you're going to get in, right? This is how you are going to win this thing. Uh, let me go check here. Let's see if we got Body this. Circle just mid tier. All there home. we go. We got it. <laughs> All right. So we got the race here. All right. Um, I'll tell you what. We'll just go look at the. It doesn't matter. Let's just go pull up this other screen. We got the Michael. We are going to go uh, breed with this. 
is there any special thing like do i need a wave a wand or anything like that i mean i I sing to him every once in a while and that tends to uh produce decent results well do you want to do it because i can't sing i'm afraid i will make i mean not good singing he's not a fan of good singing oh not good well then i can i can definitely do that um no, I can't even do that. <laughs> I mean, can't even do that. Um, Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater, had a wife and liked to beat her, slapped her twice across the head, fucked her ass, and went to bed. How about that? Does that there work? You go. There you go. He, there might you go. Like he might like some he might, poetry. Let's, let's, let's do this. All right, here we go. It is a Michael. Let's breed it. Good luck. Yeah, he's put out uh, three liberties so far, and he's already got one that's put out for this tournament coming up. I'm going to try again. It was crazy expensive. Let's just do it. Come on, people. Five cents. It is busy because everyone was having a hard time uh, um, getting into the race. Even I was having a problem. I obviously could not run my song and get and run MetaMask, even though this computer is supposed to like actually do that. All right. So uh, we'll let that kind of go. Let's see who won that race. You can't say, I'll come back to it. There's only one pack in there. You don't have to worry. Uh oh, it won't give me the it still says it's running. Whatever. Let's just go to the entrance and we'll see. Look at that. Ghosty's in it. Bread and butter. Ronnie Lido. Fifax. Who can rug? Is there anybody who can rug? Ooh, can you there we go? There, there we go. Again. Wow. Ghosty bread and butter. Ronnie Lido. Look at that. Fifax. Nickel. Midnight flame. You did and bread and butter rugging Reggie. Holy cow, he's been rugged a couple Ooh. times this week. Yeah, that's the, point of the burn hasn't been making too many final finals lately. It's weird. Some of these best of the worst dogs they perform really well for a while and then they just stop. <laughs> you mean they start doing well? <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> right? they start- yeah, they start doing well. They stop performing in the back and then they start running more mid tier. And then against some of these best of the worst, even with low form, they'll just start getting more podiums and more podiums. It's weird. Yeah, that kind of sucks. There it is. All right. So, yeah, I rugged oh, Reggie. Sorry about that, brother. Yeah, he got rugged a couple times. Uh, yeah, that's not cool. Oh, I'm kind of not staying up with the uh, chat. Sorry, everyone. Yep, uh, the Cobra is over the game. She's she's done. Like you just gotta dial in. Sorry, everyone. I'm missing all of these. Holy shit! Did I get behind? All right, I just literally skipped everyone. <laughs> uh, let's see. Are we doing? Yeah, I'll do another one. I'll do. Uh, We'll do one to rug everyone. You got rug. They, like everyone got rug. Andrew Dice Clay, very good. That was all right. What, Miss? Are you ready? Uh, I wait. What? I did some beauty treatments so I look more handsome than normal today. The only way I could do that if I just cut my head off. Uh, let's see. Katie, what? It was the scoring they got. Yes. Well, that's why I did it. Uh, let's see. I have another call at eleven thirty. Well, just I'm not going to be able to do that quick. But it's what moment? Oh, ready. We got ready. All right, here we go. Good luck. I already did your singing. All right, let's see what you get. All right, what are we looking for? Liberty? Are we looking for eighth? Only five points. Yeah. Yikes. I mean, I'm assuming this is a reroll. Wapmamis, what do you want to do? You want to wipe your ass with this? You want to re-roll it? Adela's a pretty solid re-roll ski. (laughs) (laughs) Right. All right, here we go. We're going to re-roll this. Good luck. Please, God. Come on, be good. Be something good. Oh, man. I've had some people get some really good stuff. Uh, Never me. I, I don't get that lucky. Okay, come on. The Oompa Loompas are working hard in the background here. <laughs> but they got sidetracked making the chocolate. Come on, people. Yikes. Oof. A grace. Don't see many graces pull either. I've only pulled maybe three. I mean, it's got good consistency, but uh, yeah, there's yeah. really not much you could do with this. It's got that fawn coat. 96. Yeah, all the fawn coats will have that 96 consistency. So they're good tournament hounds to shoot for because they're going to run pretty solid without having to add any to the consistency. Interesting. All right. So we've got that. Let me go ahead and uh Watmamis, can you put your address in in the uh Discord so I can send that to you? 
Let me pull that up here. Yeah, I'll just wait. Just go ahead and put that in newbie chat. So I was trying to figure out. Hold on a second here. Uh, I don't even know what a good deal would be. I definitely. Let me check something out here real quick. Use my doggy calculator. Let's see. Let's see. So if I do this is I think this is a good deal, but you guys can tell me if you buy this would be a lot. But if you bought by four, you get one free and I'm only going to do this once because I was going to do less. I'll give you 10 training points. I don't know if that's a good deal. That may not be good enough to sweeten the pot, but is anyone interested in that deal? And no worries if not. Okay, here, let me get, I've got, uh, wow, let me, you're going to get somebody hop on that pretty quick, I'm sure. I Last week I did one and I'm like, please don't do it because I'm going to do it. <laughs> but I had to offer it um, in order to do it. All right, so let me go to recently. Um, where's the, oh, no, that's not the right one. I guess we'll refresh it here. Yeah, you yeah, basically so weird. 75 Matic worth of rips for 60 Matic plus 50 Matic worth of training credits. Like that's a deal and a half right there. Yeah, no, it's definitely a good deal. Oh, no, this is right. This is the great And story. Wapman has said he's sending for three more. Yeah, you're. And... El he's eligible for, for that deal. So he's going to take Boom. it. There you go. But it's going to be the 10. You'll just get the 10, not 11 now. All right, let me. Um... All right, we got Wapman miss. I'm sending. Network busy. It's only a penny. I paid four cents more last time. It seems like a bargain. Like a penny, like you think about gas prices back in the day, you know, with Ethereum and stuff. Like I can handle pennies. I like fractions of pennies, but I can deal with this. Hey, we got Andy Shady back here. And we got a Lancelot. If you're going to be pulling for best of the worst, Reggie, Lancelot is the is the one to pull from. Um, I feel like a purebred Amelia would be a little too good but getting an amelia from a lance would be the lowest status breeder from the second lowest status breeder and he's kind of like that rounded out like level playing field so if a pure amelia is going to be too good then the next best amelia would be from the second worst breeder which would be lancelot that's why we got the two lancelot auto breeders so every month we're going to get two auto packs we haven't really had a major pull yet for a botw but yeah lance is is the the go-to is it good? Um, I was thinking about that. What would be the go-to for? I got to look at my shitty breeders and see if I have anything good that could do something bad. Yeah, yeah. um, Watma Miss definitely just sent uh, for three more. So 45 Matic, you'll be at 60, and then you're going to get, uh, you've got a one, you'll get four more dogs and the 10 training points. What the hell was I thinking? All right, um, I'm just waiting for that. Let me know. Just real quick, uh, here are my breeders. I don't know if you can see these. Um. That is yours, not mine. Are any of these good for shit? Paulina, Adele, Patrick, Philip, Kevin. I mean, I don't even have good bad dogs. Edward. Really, you've got like a bunch Alexander. of like mid tier rares and mid tier commons. No BOTW. Roger's a decent one. Butt Sniffer and Running Circles are both Rogers. Really? Um, they're a little high because of the consistency and the 89 speed instead of the 92 or the um, 87. But uh, yeah, butt sniffers done pretty well for me in BOTWs, and then uh, my new one running circles is hit or miss. But of your breeders, your Rogers definitely your top BOTW breeder. Yeah, fuck that. No way, not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have not been. Uh, okay, there we go. We've got it. We've got it. All right. So, um, Wapmus, you want all four from the Michael? We're gonna just mint four packs. Is that what we're doing? Yep, I got it. Uh, I want that Kevin. That Kevin, why? What's good about Kevin? Kevin what? is, uh, so he is the top uh, 87 speed OG. Uh, there's not another 87 speeder that has better substats as Kevin. He's a three out of four stat match to George. So he's got okay. the 95 acceleration, the 96 cons uh, endurance, and the 96 consistency that George has. So being that three out of four stat match to George in the way that Spotties and Brindles have inverted stat pa uh, passing. So um, 
they don't have one to one on their speed, acceleration, indo, and consistency on Brendel's two stat swap and on Spotty's two different stat swap, um, making Kevin a solid breeder for Spotty's and Brendel's. He's kind of like that dual threat for either, so you can rip solid Brendel's from him. Brendel's from your normal OG breeders don't always right. end up producing because of that stat swapping, depending on where those stats lie. Uh, but Kevin. Because any stat that swaps with speed is going to be a maximum stat swap. He's going to produce high end brindles and spotties. Interesting. I don't know what the fuck you just said, but yeah, that was interesting. David's <laughs> a, a bomb ass breeder to begin with. You're amazing. You're absolutely. David amazing. is literally one step above a Kevin. He's an 89 speeder with the same three stat matches to George. So he's just one notch above a Kevin. And then going up to that, you got your 92 speed. The next notch up from a, from a, a David is a Clark. And then from Clark up to um, George. George. Okay. All right. Well, maybe one of these days I might take a chance. All right. So um, I guess Wap Miss uh, Big A since he's had an Amelia too, if you want that. Or do you want to stick with the four Michaels? I'm going to get one. I'm, let me get them started because at least we know there's going to be a couple. Let me breed. I don't like doing the multiple at one time. That does not work out well for me. Oh, right, snap the one. final ran if you want to go and uh, play the final. Oh, yeah. Let's go do that. We'll let that come up. Oh, give me a second here. Yeah, totally forgot about that. Because who cares? I wasn't in it. That's that's all I care. About. <laughs> right, we're not gonna read. We're not gonna reveal the results. Let's watch this thing. All right. There's the pack has been minted. Wapmus just let me know uh, two and two. Okay, so I guess Big A, he wants you to send that Amelia, if you don't mind. It's uh, yeah, you got it. It's in the newbie chat. All right, good luck, everyone. Um, just remember that I hate you, cause all you fuckers rugged me. All right, so this is what's great. The winner actually wins this time. People slouch on their Davids, Denny. He's not going to be able to produce you Spotties um, or Brendels because he's not a common, but he does still have that three out of four stat match to George. And if you were to pull Clark, Liberty, um, pretty much any of the high-end fawns or any of the VR fawns from a David, it's going to have some really good performance. Wow, look at that. Pushing daisies, getting the 2200, rugging light night, but still getting 800 there. Uvox and got the 1500. And uh, Ronnie Lytle getting that 1,000 on the 7th. Nickel getting 900. Not bad. And everyone got 500. Uh, go buy a couple rabbits with that because you cannot buy rabbits. with 1,800. That's uh, yeah. one of the guys that Chris brought to the game. He One of Chris Don's real-life friends. Oh, wow. Nice. Um, yeah, he doesn't make a whole lot of finals. I don't know if, if – I think he's made three or four. But an 1,800 froth win is is a dope placement That's, for FIFAX as a, a newer That channel. is – yeah, that's a definite good one. All right, so I'm going to breed one more of these, Michaels. And then uh, Big A, Amelia is sent. Holy cow. Matic is rugging me. This is going to cost me like 15 cents to do all these. I'm totally kidding. Um, all right, minting in progress. So we got two of those. Let me go see if the Amelia is showing up after this. Um, you want to yeah, for it, Amelia, you're probably not going to want to hunt for the pure Amelia, but a Lancelot from Amelia would be a solid pull. Um, Lance, a Allen would be decent. Um, Roger, Odin's not a bad pull. Any of those are going to be solid BOTWs. Um, We'll, we'll see what they are. But yeah, the, the pure Amelia is the only thing that you probably wouldn't want to do. I feel like pure Amelia's are going to run kind of like the airdrop Amelia's, just a little bit better than a trash Amelia could run. And yeah, crossing over between any of the other lowest end, either um, fawn or blue gray, bottom tier 87 across the board of the first three stats is uh, a good play for ripping Amelia. I mean, purebred's not going to be bad. It's going to run like an airdrop, and they still win well. But Ernest, yeah. Ernest. We have an Ernest, and we have a Lance a lot, but I prefer pulling from the Lance over the Ernest because of that 96 consistency on the Ernest side. So the, we're going to do two Amelias now. Um, and so that's a common, though, but you still think um, that is the way to go on that. So why why is that common better than, let's say, to do it with a very rare? You're just looking for a certain... Here, let's get this 
minted here. Well, for the for the best of the worst uh, dogs, we want as low a stat possible for translating on to any of them. So uh, if you get a brindle, it, it's brindles run pretty crappy anyway, and they have the stat flipping. So if you can get one of those like 88 accelerations, any of the BOTW bottom end, and have that swip, swap over for the um, speed on the brindle side, you know, if you get the 87s, you, you want to have a dog with 87s in both speed and acceleration because right, that's right, the two course. stats that flip flop on the brindle breeding. And on uh, spotties, it's endurance and consistency. Um, all spotties get 97 endo. That's just their natural. They don't have like a set consistency like all the uh, other um, breeds of racers do. Their consistency actually fluctuates okay. instead of their endurance because of that stat flipping. Uh, and that's kind of what helped me pinpoint the two stats that flip between the two race breeds that came out. And um, so, yeah, any of those 87s are going to be good for the brindle breeding for a trash brindle. Uh, I don't know what the trash brindle is because I don't pull trash brindles enough. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> there there. should be an 87 or brindler somewhere in the mix. Come on, Pat. I'm like, I'm be, all these packs should be here by now. All right, so Wapamas, here we go. Do you want any order? You want to stop from the bottom? You want to do bottom, top, top, bottom, mix it up? Let me know. Whatever, whatever you'd like, I will do here. Good luck. But yeah, I've not been doing good in my races. Like, everyone's getting so good at reading everything. I'm ready for whatever. All right, so... Let me start here. We'll start with Amelia. Let's see what you got here. Good luck. All right. So we want something bad on this. I better write all this down. Not that we wouldn't know. It just makes it easier just in case. Okay. Consistency 97. So this is not one you want to keep. I'm assuming. Uh, so Rugger... Yeah, with the 92 speed and the 97 consistency on the rugger, um, it's it's going to be a mid-pack performer, probably better for like landmines or the bullseye tournaments for commons because he's going to he's not going to get too many last plays. Okay, sorry, he wants yeah. a reroll. Let's go ahead and do it. Good luck, <laughs> rugger. That's awesome. All right. Come on. Something good or something bad, I guess. Ooh. Not, it's a rare, but interesting. Kellens are actually really decent dogs. <laughs> um, the 97 base speed. Um, you know, your Brindle coats are always going to give that 97 consistency. That's just what they got. So they're the only dogs with slightly better con than your, your fawn line. Um so for the brindles to make it a solid BOTW, you're going to want to go for those like 87 and 90s. Um, I'm trying to think of the name. Lenny maybe, or Sonny. I think Sonny might be one of the, the high-end ones. But Kellen actually is a pretty good performer with good training. Actually runs really clean, but I don't know about one from an Amelia. Uh, that one's going to be kind of... That's going to be maybe not so good. All right, let's try a Michael. Unless he says something different. Box, can you check DMs? Yeah, just letting BE not to let go of his, because that'll uh, be better odds for spotties for December. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <clears throat> I'm not going to sell any of those anyways. Uh, not a frothy anyways. I think that was a froth. All right, so good luck here. Let's get something good. Let's get like an extremely rare. Not an extremely common. <clears throat> All right, come on. We got some pack ripping going on here. We got Paxton joining. Ooh. Look at that consistency. I mean, you could. This would be a hard. Wow. Brooks. Brooks is a monster. I mean, that I is mean, an absolute monster pull. Training um, it would suck, but. Training them is actually really, really fun. I mean, they, they're one of the easiest ones to train well. Um it's the highest <clears throat> added rare in the game. And uh, yeah, he's a 380 base, just like Michael is. So he has the potential of being a 395 with perfect rolls. Um, I keep all Brooks because they are monster hounds, especially coming from a VR. Like that's a, a very valuable pull. Oh, sure. Right, so I'm gonna, he's going to keep it. I'm hitting accept. 
Yeah, that's yeah. a banger. That's a banger pull right there. That's hot. That's <clears> I'd <throat> hit the hype pull for a for a Brooks for sure. Because yeah, that's the highest added rare, um, and a monster. Nice, good job. No way to turn down a rare froth for a Kevin. He's trying to make me a deal. What the fuck's going on here? I don't know what I'm doing. He's gonna. I'm gonna get bamboozled when I don't know. Andy saying, "Boom!" It's an awesome pool. Yeah, nice. Congrats. We'll get. We'll get a race here going. To a porter. Porter is another fucking keep. Porter is basically the Brooks in the black gray coat, but that's an Amelia Porter. So you're getting the black gray line. The the last the Brooks was from Michael. This one's uh, Amelia. Porter's an amazing hound. Somebody would probably still buy and race it coming from an Amelia. It could still get high rolls. That is the highest statted rear black gray coat in the game. Mm -hmm. And uh, you got a black gray match to an Amelia. Look at that. Two bangers. Uh, I'm assuming you're keeping this Wapma miss, but I got to get got to get verification. Keep. All right. Perfect. Reroll. Right. Just kidding. All right. We're going to keep it. <laughs> I <laughs> know, right? Like any mistake here, and I'm gonna be yeah, on that's the line. that's wild. That's two like so those are actually the same identical, like where they place in the dog tiers. Uh Porter, Brooks, and Trinity are the three OGs that are in that vein that are the three out of four stat match. So yeah, the Brooks was from Michael. That that would have been badass to pull a Brooks and a Porter from Mike, and they get two bad dogs from Amelia. <laughs> well, let's check this last one and see. What's going on? Yeah, maybe we get a porter from Michael, and then you can re-roll the porter from Amelia. <laughs> that is, let's see here. Here comes a Trinity. It's a Grace. We already, I no, we didn't see one today. I saw one yesterday. I'm assuming this is a re-roll. I re-roll Grace's. What yeah, she's too good with all of uh you know the 95 acceleration 92 endo 96 consistency that 89 speed like it's a mid upper tier 89 speed performer <laughs> right but like that's not gonna do anything. it's not gonna really be relevant in just about any race factory right exactly yikes um Chanel. well but you got you got two really good ones and i normally will do that and i get none so i mean that's pretty good. All right, so I mean, you can't be sad with the Brooks. The Brooks alone made four pack rips worth it, in and of itself. But right. he's getting and then he got yeah an extra free pack rip and ten training credits. So can't beat that. Oh yeah, no, it's definitely a good deal. Um, all right, so we've got the the porter. The, I'm just making sure these are all and I can do all these together, right? Let's try. Last time I tried this, it didn't work. So as long as your wallet is refreshed and you've refreshed to the latest version of the app and there's no issues with MetaMask, then yeah, you could bulk transfer them just by clicking those check marks and attempting to. But yeah, sometimes I get errors and lately I just send them in one at a time. Yeah, I'll give it one shot. So we got the so so we know we got the Brooks, we got the Chanel, got the Kellen. And we got the porter. All looks good. We're going to do a bulk transfer. Aller will be very proud of me, but it probably is not going to work. So, what, my miss? All right. It looks good. I'm going to do it. Please, God, work. Oh, it says air. Well, I'm not going to fuck around with that. I knew that was going to happen. All right. Well, whatever. We'll just... yeah, I've been getting errors on the browsers since I, uh, since they updated the workout breeders to have the you know when you select the multiple check boxes and it says run a race with x breeders right. when they added that feature i started having issues with bulk transfer on the website i can still do it on the phone if i'm on my metamask on the phone it goes through just fine with bulk transfers but on the browser for some reason it, it doesn't work. work yeah i've had no luck with it the past couple days so <clears throat> not that i'm doing that much all right so there Let's see here. Did that go already? We got. All right. There's the. Wait, did I just send the porter? Was that right? Or was that. Did it already go? Yeah, yeah that no, should have been the good. porter. But it doesn't show that it's gone. All right. Okay. Let's go. Yeah. To he'll sit porter. in there for like a minute and a half before he disappears. And if you try to send him again, then it just gives you that error or something went wrong or something. All right. It looks like it's funny how after like five minutes later, then the fees are all. It's like free. Is it ever free to send on with Matic? I've seen some really low fees. 
I paid, I think, 15 cents one day. It was so, so busy. All right, so here we go. We got the Chanel. Let's transfer this. The worst one of the day. All right. And then we got the Brooks. Man, that was nice to get that Brooks. Well, I guess you've used up all the luck that I could have. Yeah, Brooks was a banger pull. I mean, that's that's just absolute fire right there. The only thing that I'd want more than a, a Brooks would probably be a VR or a Trinity because the Trinity does match uh, pretty well on the stats. Leonard's nice, too. I love a Leonard from that Michael. All right, so what, Mamis, uh, I'll take a few minutes. I'm going to go send you those training points now, too. Let's get those out of the way. It says success. All right, so let me get these uh, training points out, and then we can do a race. I don't know if anyone else really wants to uh, do any pack rips. Um, what's the date today? Uh, Lord. I mean, I could just get rid of all of them now anyways. Um... There we go. It's weird how it takes a second for this to load up. Come on. What is this, 1990s? It's like waiting for the 1200 baud modem to go. All right, here yeah, we I go. Just, I think it's a lot of just network traffic on pretty much everything. Solana, I've been getting network congestion messages. MetaMask. It's, like, it's in the theme, but it's not giving me the portal. That's weird. Hold on, let me go back. There we go. This time it should work. There we go. All right. I do like this. This makes it easier. All right, we got Wapmamis. He's getting 10 credits. They're on the way. All right. Congrat. What a deal. Right. Mega deal. Come on, credits. This is taking forever. All right, there we go. All right, so let me know. Let's see. Uh, still need to sell my. Anyone want to buy his uh, purebred Aurora? He'd like to sell it. He's offering a deal. A purebred Aurora. I don't know. What about a? Shouldn't he put that in the uh, the maiden race? Um, or no? I mean, if it's currently unraced, it'd be good in a maiden. It can't go in the current weekly maiden though, because they're doing a ninety-two speed limited. Okay. Yeah, uh, Big A, how much do you want for that? I so a Kevin is more valuable Brian than would a be, Brian breeder. A Brian would honestly probably be a better breeder all around. Um, So a Brian is like the black gray coat version of a Leonard. He's a 93 acceleration, um, just a step down under Porter. So Porter's got the 95. Um, a Brian just has two points less in acceleration, kind of how Michael drops down to 93. Uh, so he's a 97, 93, 92, 92. Okay. And Brian, pretty good black pool. Um, uh, black gray, uh, definitely, uh, one of the highest black gray rares out there for sure. But, um, in December, Kevin's would probably, cause those, those spotties and Kevin, if you plan on pulling heavy in December, Kevin's worth having. If not, Brian's worth having the rest of the year because hunting spotties is going to be better than hunting brindles. Um, so it just kind of depends on when you plan on doing your ripping. If you want to have a high-end spotty ripper come December time, if you want to try to pull for more, not many people like the people that have Kevin's don't sell them for large amounts. So you can probably scoop one up on OpenSea or the marketplace or the marketplace, whatever they're calling. I don't know if you can actually buy on there yet, but... Uh, it just kind of depends. Brian would be the better 11 months out of the year breeder. And then December, Kevin would be the monster. So, yeah, because everyone wants them that one time. So Reggie's trying to rug me. No, no, the, the Brian that Reggie's I'm kidding, offering I'm is, is an 11 month improvement over the Kevin. For one month, your Kevin will be the better option. And for 11 months of the year. The Brian would be the more ideal breeder, in my opinion. I like Brian. I think you had an Alexander. I like Brian more than Alexander. Um, I think that would probably be your best breeder. Your best in-house breeder would be a Brian, and it's a solid rare. Yeah, I mean, just for Big A, I got to keep it. So he can breed off of that. Um, no, I'm Reggie. I have no clue what I'm doing. I'm just a fucking basic-ass dog. So, yeah, no, I don't think you're trying to screw I mean, I do think you're trying to screw me, but... 
that's totally okay. <laughs> it's totally okay. I don't. I see where the it's 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 like a wash, right? The, like uh, it's it's a pretty game. tertiary move. I mean, it, it's not like it's a a super high end, but it is a, a nice rare. It's a rare worth pulling from, especially if you were to pull a black gray like coat match of like a Hickman from it. Brian Hickman would be an amazing pull. Um, Brian Alex or Brian uh, Andrew would be an amazing pull. Uh, that'd actually be an even better match than the Hickman because of the 93 acceleration, but the Hickman's obviously an ER and going to be a little bit more juiced up. But, right. uh, I mean, it's, it's definitely a fair trade um, without bloodline theory, like knowledge or belief in the bloodline theories, then Brian's a m more valuable breeder, probably about a hundred Matic more valuable breeder than what people normally will sell their Kevins for because right. not many people early in the game started – theorizing from which commons would be the best ones. He's still regarded a high in common because Kevin's, I think a three seventy three or three seventy four. Um, be yeah, a Brian's a better breeder for 11 months out of the year, hundred percent and not a bad pickup for an in kennel rare. If you don't have one better than a Brian. So it's really what you decide to do in that regard. And you know, you, you got a good hound or a good breeder, on either side of the coin. The only right. caveat that I would say Brian has a, a much higher like favor point is because he is a rare. There are only going to be 80 Brian breeders ever. Whereas with the, the commons, there's like a hundred and something, I think I forget how many there are, but there's, there's quite a few of the, uh, the commons compared to the rares. So there will be more Kevin's in the market than there will be Brian's once all 10,000 breeders are minted out. Gotcha. Okay. That makes sense. Well, I need to think about it, uh, Reggie. Um, yeah, let me think about it. I'm not going to make a deal right this second, but yeah, maybe we can make a deal. We'll, we'll talk about it. I got to talk, talk to some people, but yeah, maybe we'll do it. Maybe not. We'll see. Um, all right. So should we do a race? Does anyone else want to open any packs? Do I need to make a good deal? Does anyone want to? I mean, I'm sure pretty much everyone's bored of watching people open packs. They just want races. But does anyone uh, want to open any packs? You can say yes. You can say no. Um, what do I have? Hold on. I do have. I mean, honestly, I wasn't going to ever run that deal again. But uh, I don't want to be. I don't. I don't always go through all my training points. I will do that deal again if somebody else wants to do it. Do the buy four. Get one free and get 10 training points. Is anyone interested in doing that deal? Keep your Kevin uh, big A. It's all good. I'm rugging you. No worries. I'm what? I'm rugging. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Did I do something bad? Did I get some? <laughs> I honestly didn't know what I had. So I just have to think about it. All right, so nobody nobody else wants to do pack rips. No worries. But if you want to, now's the time to speak up because otherwise we're going to just move on here. I'm not going to make this a hard sell. But if you want to get, you buy four, get one free plus 10 training points. Uh, not enough money yet. There you go. Kevin. Yeah, I, Big A, I didn't know. I think he's talking about my Kevin because I said you'd want to rip off of it. But okay, all right, nobody wants to do it. All right, so here's the question What race do I do so I can fucking win? <laughs> That's the question because I have no clue. I obviously can't hounds? win the best of the work. What was that? What are your hounds? Um, here, let me pull them up. Let me pull up another window just so I can keep that one. Give me a second here. Let me log in here. I'll pull up my next window and you can see the beauties that I have here. All right, so let's go ahead and well, I mean, you can see everything. Put them up, Porter. So any of those are going to be how well you've got them dialed in. I'm not sure how well you've learned your dogs or which ones you're the most confident in. Um, yeah. For SNGs, uh, try to have at least whatever hounds you want to run. If you're going to be running for just like those top three or podium placements, have a hound with some form. Um, form is kind of like the equal other half of consistency and it plays a pretty major factor in your dog being able to run its best race 
the odds of running a perfect RNG race with 50 form are half or more less likely than when you're just running with 100 form every time. And even on 100 form dogs with high consistency, you're still going to hit those bad RNG races, but you're going to hit them a lot less frequently if you manage to keep your form high. Hmm. All right. Well, I think that just means that I'm not ready <laughs> yet for the. <laughs> I'm everyone likes everyone likes my tornadoes and hurdles and curveballs. So let's go see. Let's create something. Let's see what I've done in the past here. The question is, I mean, everyone's going to know how to play this. So this curveball, best of the worst. Uh, let's see one play. I mean, we could do that. How many people are in here? Like if we just did, do we really have 23? If I just do, we don't have 24 people in here. I was going to do just the 16 and only allow you to have one dog to put in, not two. Uh, but we could try. Now we got 25 in here and we got some on Twitter, but I don't, I can't communicate with the Twitter people. Uh, what do you think? Uh, let's see. Sh Ronnie Lido is here. Curveballs and tornadoes. What was the curveball and tornado one? Let me just go see. Oh, my Lord. Where was it? I've done some really effed up uh, curveballs in a hurricane. What the hell was that one? Uh, position one is the biggest win, but after that, loser wins in this order. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I mean, that was pretty good because that gives somebody a chance. Yeah. Yeah, you can either race for firsts or you can race for lasts, either one. So if you've got a well-dialed-in dog that you put a rabbit on, you can try to hit for that first place every time and make the finals. Or you can just run your BOTWs and and uh, try to make it that way. Yeah, let's go fucking do that. All right, so it will – you think – let's see. It's all up BE. Yeah, my race is – this one isn't as much luck because this is pretty uh, clear. You think we can do 24? Oh, yeah, we'd be able cool. to fill 24, I'm sure. All right, so let's go ahead. Let me get my – get everyone, get your S&G, get ready. I will be playing my music, which will fucking rug me. Um, But I still like it. So, all right, so here we go. I think the money's all right. It's nothing crazy. But um, let's go ahead and oh, – wait, did I set it to 24? Let me go check. I don't think it is. Yes, it is. All right, 2, 4, 24. Sometimes you just go over it and you really screw yourself over. All right, this is weird how I have to do this on um, Chrome. I don't know why it does that. All right, let me make sure I've got everything ready. Is everyone ready to get in? You're going to have to be quick now that everyone knows what it is. Uh, yeah, let me make sure I've got my hurry music. All right, let's go. Let's get this in. Uh, I'll tell you when it's accepted it, and then I'm going to go wait for this. All right. It's a success, everyone. Good luck. Let's see if I can rug you all here. Get you nervous. Yeah, this might not fill it. Well, we got 21 in here. Yeah, we'll we see how quickly right. we should be able to fill it. We see. I mean, why the hell would anyone be listening to this if they weren't racing? That would be crazy. Come on. This sometimes takes a little bit longer than I expect. Sometimes it pops like immediately, and then sometimes it takes a minute. And I, I, I think that maybe it just waits to populate at the minute rollover. So in like four seconds oh, when the when the minute rolls over to 11.58. Um, yep, that's okay. it.
And there we go. We got it filled. Um, yeah, every time. So does this, just from the audience, from the chat, does it uh, pause? Does that song pause like while I'm trying to enter? Because for me, it like completely stops. MetaMask totally rugs me. So I wasn't sure. Uh, we're still waiting for this to populate. Boxing will be back to school us on some of our Greyhounds and Curveballs in a hurricane. Uh, I made it in time. There you go. I'm sure I won't be winning this. Was selling to Kevin and didn't realize. Well, when did you sell it? Just now? Curveballs and Tornadoes and Hurdle. Oh, no, that's old. I'm sorry. I totally got fucked up here. Wapmas got rug. Good luck. Uh, what the hell? I got rug. Really? I didn't get in. Holy crap. Oh, well, next time. That sucks because you guys. Big A, I'll DM you. There you go. Oh, okay. So he's going to buy from you. Perfect. Yeah, Big A, you can sell it because I'll just keep mine and you know you can use mine. Um, couldn't get my second dog in. Weird. I don't understand what's going on. But let's go look. Oh, this will be a quick one too. Let's see who's frothing. It's a 600. I love how like this one, you know, not that I'm going to do well, but I'll have a better chance. Um Last one was all short races, so that sucked. But good luck, everyone. Denny OC, it's time for you to let other people win. Network congestion. Yeah, it's totally, the network was horrible. I can't believe I got two. Did the wifey get two? Cobra, did you get two in there? Let's see here. I'm sure you're, you'll be frothing with that bolting, but maybe. Did you play the bolting with a rabbit? That might have been the smart play. I don't know. We shall see. How the fuck my wife get in? I know. Isn't that the worst? You taught him everything. Yep. Okay. So she got two in. I got two in. Still probably won't help us win. There you go. Frothing. Look, get him in. Get him in. Frothing too. He always does well. Ronnie Lido does well. All right. So let's get that going. I'll get the next one up. 20 seconds for that. I'm all, Am I in the next race? Bubble Butt is in the next race, which is the wife. And then I'll be in the one after that. So we are represented in each race. Good luck, everyone. And when I say good luck, you know, I don't fucking mean it. So Peanut Gallery, Midnight Flame, all you good people, go suck it. But I still love you. Thank you for coming by and wasting your day with me for like $10. Smart play. Did I sell this? Oh, I sold my. All right. So I sold one of my Alta Rare uh, comic today for 17 That was my hedge. Um, and we'll see what happens later. All right, I'm not even paying attention. Stop winning big A's in the back. I'm just looking at the comics now to see what is going on here. Uh, common, uncommon is coming up, and the yeah, the ultra rare is going up too. So I might have sold too low, but fuck it. Look at that. Could bolting and me, it, there's no way. Could this happen? Wow, you're gonna win, babe, first. Can you keep that up? Holy crap. Is that even... Oh, no. Here's Stop Winning Big A. This is where I get fucked right here. I hate my life. Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't hate my life. All right. There we go. I think Voxen fell in the toilet. I hope he's okay. All right. There you go. So, uh, actually, first is first. Then it's second, Nickel and Peanut Gallery. Thank God Nickel's in there. I'm in there. Cobra. All those shitty people. Of course, when I have the froth very low, that's what happens. All right, so on the next one, Reggie, he's frothing. Bud is frothing. Boxton and Alejandro, who's always frothing. All right, so good luck. Let's see what happens here. No rabbits either. I know, right? Damn that. Yeah, that she's been trying to. Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't think it's boosted anymore what? no because don't i have oh i didn't turn off boosting i meant to turn fucking boosting off just so in case people had boosted stuff they wouldn't waste it but maybe it is boosted i don't know i don't know she'd have to go look i really don't know i don't pay attention to these things maybe that would be smart maybe i could start rugging you guys more if i started cheating like that uh i'm in with good from me i'm with big a fuck i don't stand a damn chance all right. Is it boosted? I don't know. Babe, is it boosted? Oh, no rabbits. Maybe boosted. So from the tourney. Oh, really? Oh, wow. Then well played. I didn't even know that I was cheating. That's the best. 
That's the best. When you don't know you're cheating. All right, here's the mouse. Let's see what we got here. Reggie's up in the front, got a big lead. Bubble butt in the back, but not no guarantee there. The OC family, Denny OC. Oh, here comes a big rug right here. Point me to the burn. Never know what's going to happen. Pretty sure Reggie has the first place locked in. Locked in. Bubble butt. Oh, man. Oh, Lord. Come on. Nope. She's totally going to get like, oh, ooh, ooh. Are you going to get, oh, wow. Well, you got second or you got third place. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Point me to the burn. Reggie taking one and two. I hate your guts. Uh, Big A losing to Dog Mother and to Kobodosho. So congrats on that. He knows what he's doing. All right, so um, wait, wasn't that the one we just did? Oh, no, no, here's here's this one. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. All right, so here's this. I'll tell you who's frothing in this. Uh, Muzzle Michael, Eternity, and Happy Momo. Uh, oh, I've got, oh, no, my Dookie Dasher. Okay. I don't know how well that's going to do. That is a new dog. All right, so we're going to go after this. We're going to head on to two. Which has get them in, get them in, good from behind, bubble butt, Mariposa, Dookie Dasher, uh, Eternity, Dark Fortune, and Luna Lena. Yena, actually, is how you would say that, right? <coughs> Babe, Yena. Trying to learn. Trying to learn. All right. Uh, oh, I am in this. Dookie Dasher. Fuck. Let's go back and see if I can rug all y'all. Let's see. Fingers crossed. I don't get hard, long, cloudy tracks. Let's see. Uh, I went in with rabbits. I turned boosts off. I meant to do that, though. I apologize. Actually, that was part of it. My Dookie Dasher is a horrible best of the worst because I think it's from a Brooks. I don't know. The thing is, I hate it. Oh, my Lord. It just rugs me all the time. It's new, too. I don't stand a chance. Don't stand a chance because it always does like a last minute like boost. Oh, see, there it goes. There's that sprint. Fucking me. Look at that. It needs to be a 750 or something, and maybe I won't get screwed. All right, there you go. Well, Muzzle Michael, good from behind. Big A. Uh, and look at that. Boxton and Ken Ojo. I like to see that. I like to see that. All right, so let's get on to the next race here. There's all your frothers. Get them in, get them in. All right, so yeah, get them in. Uh, Mariposa, Mariposa, and Luna Yena. All frothing. Uh, good from behind, Bubble Butt and Dookie Dasher. Uh, this is a 600 again. It's weird. I guess they just keep playing the same ones. I don't get it. The last one was 600, right? The next one's 600. I guess I figured it would switch it up. I guess it doesn't. All right, on the next one, am I in the next one? Uh, Bolting is. Cobra is in the next one. All right, good luck, everyone. It's about to start. And I think uh, Voxen has been murdered. Okay. Now, there he is. He was. Just, you were just murdering somebody. I thought you were murdered, but okay. All right. Good. Oh, right. yeah, I was definitely smothered, smothering and smooching <laughs> on the ghosty. Nice. I love it. I love it. So, yeah, you did pretty good on that last race, so I hate you. Uh, we've got my Dookie Dasher is not a good 356. I'll tell you. It's from a Brooks, yeah. I think. Uh, yeah, that's my problem is my – I got that on a pack rip, and I was all excited, but it's done nothing but rug me. So Yeah. <clears throat> I'll pull some monsters that I think are going to be super performers, and they don't do anything. And then I'll pull some just stealth wonders sometimes that just surprise the living crap out of me. Yeah, I don't get it. But it looks like the wifey is going to be last. So that's good. And I will be third to last. Well, not really. It's actually fourth place because first is really first in this. Wow, that no, well, she's dialed in on shit. Good job, babe. Fucking hate this. She always wins. All right. So that was. Uh, oh, no, I already had two. two up. We were ready to go. We we're ready to go already. All right, so we got Bud, you're frothing, bolting, Cobra Dojo, and Reggie. 
All right. Good luck. It's so weird, the silence. It's kind of weird when you have two people on to actually play music, but I'll put a little light music in the background just so it's not. Break it up a little bit. Less than that. There we go. That way we can talk over it, but it's not all me. Uh, I'm exhausted. Vivi had a fucking comic drop last night at 2 a.m. So I was up from that and I couldn't go to sleep. And then my avatar stopped working. So then I had to download it from Steam and cool. redo it all. Yeah, because the one I have for just Windows isn't working. So that took a while to get working. Not that it mattered. I guess I could have stayed the whole time as BE instead of B Dog. Nobody wants to look at me, including myself. So. I'm there hoping that Bud runs pretty clean here. She loves running on soft track. She prefers rain to hail, but. Uh... Oh, Reggie's going to rug the wife with that burst. Oh, come on, babe. Hit the button. Poof. The solid Clark. Oh, man. He is a solid Clark. Look at that. Look at that rug. Well, that's fine. Then go back because the point is better at third. All right. And misdirection. We'll come back here. We won't even see what happened. Wow. All right. Lots of rugging going on in this. You never can yeah. tell. Have you ever studied the sprint so you know when you're going to get fucked? So like you'll be dialed in to like, oh my God, I'm screwed. I mean, you can tell. You can yeah, you can up. usually watch and know pretty early on where the rug will happen. <laughs> right. Yeah, I got oh, rugged on Bud both days by Reggie there. He, he got uh, Regis Clark. I caught him in both races and he got the first. I got the second. Uh, he did get rugged last race. So, I mean, I guess that's fair. That he and I got to race him on the last day, too. He's probably going to rug Bud the last day. Well, well here we go. We got Ken Ojo, Happy Momo Legis, and Legis twice. And I'm in this. This is a long one. I don't know. This, I normally will do really well and at the very end rug myself so that's my favorite but we're almost done which is nice because i'm getting bored <laughs> all right we'll get this up yeah after a couple hours of vv and this stuff it's not fun <laughs> but you did you did that easter stream what was that it was like uh it was five days in a row it was like a 15 hour no it was like a four we, or five we did a nine stream. and a half hour stream on easter or no <clears throat> it was long whatever it was, it was long yeah i fell asleep woke up fell asleep woke up fell asleep and woke up again you were still going so yeah we we did a marathon the other day too we did like uh, a stream like a two and a half hour stream and then a nine and a half hour stream and then a short break like in a two hour break and then did another like four hour stream it was wow. uh, pretty draining <laughs> yeah no it's definitely i did with mo we did two cubathons that were eight and a half hours please look at that. there's that rug that i'm talking about fuck you stop winning big a and loves it in the rear come on fucking rug no but here comes the sprint here come oh i hate my life come on stop just like st i wish sometimes they would just stop like literally stop nope not gonna happen all right fifth i don't know i think i got rugged there we go. Legis up there. Reggie. Reggie's definitely in the final. Big A and Peanut Gallery. Congrats on all you fuckers. I hate you. Um, all right. So that was 3 1. Wait, was that 2? Was that 2, right? No, uh, that was 2 3. Yeah, now we're on 3 1. Here we go. Here we go. I'm just a dog. I have no clue what's going on. Plus, I'm running on two hours of sleep. Uh, oh, I completely don't know how to run a stream either. <laughs> i'll tell you what uh Same stream yard is horrible it's literally the worst because it doesn't allow me to have multiple windows really yeah it, like i can have you on there but i can't have two videos or even just a photo like to split this in half can't do it huh. all right so let's see who's, yeah it's really um there's not there's another one stream something stream labs and that's more OBS based, but you can't have like 11 people on there easily. So Reggie's frothing, uh, you're frothing, and uh, the wife is frothing. Ooh. Ooh. Bolt's a clean runner. Love a good bolt. Just Avicii so is the, uh, the VR spotty I'm going to be hunting for in December. 
So this is where we have before, obviously we have this whole race, so we don't know what's gonna happen. But right now we've got Reggie, Reggie, Big A, Cobra Dojo, Nickel, Informant, BHP Racing, and Big A, but you are right there, uh, Boxton. And then Cobra Dojo's after that, Ronnie Lido, and I'm at like 17, so I stand no chance. Uh, if I do well, though, I might get to the finals, so we'll see. Um, oh, my lord, Bolting is going to get rugged here, I think. Now, if she can get this win, if you can get the win here, babe, that will that might be a lock, but I don't, it doesn't <clears throat> look like it. You need a sprint here, but she doesn't slow down too much. Yeah, she's uh 15 to 15 confirmed on the god breeder, and she doesn't mind the mud. Yeah, looks like oh, bolting no. might get it. There we go. There you go, babe. Thank you for the rug. Damn. I knew if I hit that button, they, they said A A B A up down, up down, left, 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 right. Got to bring them cheat codes. Wow, look at that. That was, I mean, even if she doesn't get in, she just rugged a lot of people. Yeah, Bud got the second place rug all three oh, days. Oh, wow. Nine total points. This is like watching paint dry for this last one. What the fuck is wrong with that dog? All right, well, there you go. Cobra Dojo taking one. Peanut Gallery, Ronnie Lido, and Alejandro taking the next ones there. Um, Where are we at here? I am totally don't know what I'm doing. All right, so we are now... One second away. Let me just get this going. I hate how it doesn't start right away. Like, it makes you wait if you're a little late. But let me tell you who's frothing on here. We've got, uh, point me to the burn, Reggie. We've got stop winning big A, fucking A, which is not good for me. And get him in, get him in. Because that was my only chance. That was my chance to get into the finals. Shit. All right, good luck, everyone. Look at that. I'm already at the front. It's not even going to happen. Bubble Butt is there. Good from behind is going to do the rugging. It's so weird how I'm getting screwed here. <laughs> <laughs> I think if I would have slapped boosts on Bud, it might have made a bit of a difference. Might have been able to squeeze out a couple of firsts, but I didn't uh, leave the apply boosts on there. I don't typically do them in the freeze. Yeah, this is, I mean... Get him in, get him in. Good from behind. Oh, there, come on. No, he's going to get a big run here. I know it. I just feel it. I feel Dookie Dasher and Stop Winning Big A going to get rug me at the very end here. Come on. I think Dookie Dasher is completely out. Look at that bullshit. Oh, man. Loves it in the rear. Look, Big A always screw me over. Ooh, looks like you caught a little bit of mud. You might be okay. I think you're going to get dead last, potentially. Nah. It never happens that way. There it is. Uh, there it is. Dookie Dasher and Informa. Wow. Look at that. And then Big A, Big A. All right, now we're going to get to the uh, final ones about to start here. Let's just get it up and rolling. Coverage has not started. What the fuck are you talking about? It has started. There we go. Get it up and running. All right, let's see. Let's see the potential. Good from behind. Informer, Cobra Dojo, Fortune Fish, Ronnie Lytle, Fortune Fish, Cobra Dojo, Peanut Gallery, Big, Big A. So I'm not going to. My Dookie Dasher did well, but it's not going to get in. Might be able to keep up at the top there. I don't think Cobra Doge. Is she in this? Is Bubble Butt in this? No, she's out. Lots of rugging that could go on in here. Especially from you, right? We're here. He to drop way back. He likes to drop back late in these 850s. And he slaps on the brakes big time. But every once in a while, he'll run too hard on an 850 and end up getting like a third place. Um, usually he doesn't have his best of the worst like movement until about halfway through the curve and then he'll drop pretty far back and then on that last stretch he sometimes will go into like a full-on walk <laughs> i mean you only need third i think if you get third you'll be in oh come on oh man it looks like reggie's gonna be doing the rug in this race 
I mean, in the whole tournament. What's the points to get into G1? I don't know. That was a paid for win. Oh, because of what? Because you were uh, boosted? Oh, my Lord. This is like, this is horribly awful to watch. <laughs> this is like, <laughs> oh, my God. Your Yours is trying so hard to do he bad. Is. He's like stuck he in the mud. Can't make up his mind. Oh, look at that. That's what you need. Oh, I don't know. That might be enough to get you into the finals. We'll find out here quick. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. He might. It's a fourth. Waiting for this last Fifth. one. Holy crap. There we go. All right. So I'm still in. Is the, oh, the wifey's out. No, the wifey's still in, but I think we're going to get rugged here. How many two? Where's the, uh, oh, no, we're in. Yep. Ernie didn't make All it right. happen. There we go. We got BHP Racing. We got Big A, Informant, Nickel, Cobra Dojo, Reggie, Ronnie Lido, and Reggie in there twice because he got rugged twice yesterday. There is our finals doggies there. Wow. Okay. I'll take I'll take being represented in the uh finals. That means, although this is a shitty prize one, I should have made it higher. Uh not very good. Look at that. Three. I'll end up, trust me, I'll end up with the 300, maybe the 500. Uh, that's just how Tom rolls. <laughs> that's how, and trust me, I'll be frothing fucking too, but not good enough to win. Hopefully, Bolting will be frothing. If she's froth, oh, you can't see what I'm saying. If she's frothing, that would be uh, good. Seven right. dogs tied at 19 points. I know, Fifth right? To 11th. <laughs> Two class points for trials. Look at that. Reggie, Ronnie Lido. Wow, look at that. The race for first is real. I'm sure Big A will yeah. fuck us all. Yeah, for, for trials, it's 200 class points, and then you have to enter the Group 1 trials race and place in, like, the top, I think it was 52 last month. Uh, I don't know if it's the same every month, um, but they relegate the bottom 52 or whatever it is out of G1 and replace them with the winners of the trial, or the top 52 of the trials. When's the, the maiden, is it weekly, or is there going to be a big one for the month? Um, so maidens run weekly, they run a maiden daily and it changes what it is every week. So, um, we had an untrained maiden and then we had a maiden G4. And then now we have a 92 speed, any rarity maiden that's currently open. And then I'm sure the next one's probably going to be a trained maiden. Oh, a trained one. Really? Oh, we were trying to get the code. I first see a measly 300 froth, babe. I do too. But worst case scenario, we got 600 froth. We're getting McDonald's tonight. There you go. We're getting these. Uh, actually, we're just getting ramen noodles. I don't know. That's fine. Yeah, I can deal. I can deal. All right, let's see here. All right, so we got two minutes here. Um, oh, wait, what's she saying here? Which one am I supposed to get my? So she has the Amera untrained. She okay. wasn't training to get it in and then was going to train it. Is that her best right. bet? So what, what you do is you put it in the untrained and you're not allowed to train it till after the race runs. So you'll run it untrained and then you'll train it. And then if it didn't hit it first in the maiden for whatever reason, or if you don't race it and learn it in between, then you could do it trained and put it in another maiden. Um, like I had, I think it was two of my dogs I put in the untrained maiden that didn't place at all. So I... I, uh, the very next week, they had a train made, and so I trained them, slapped them in that, and then went and did more rabbit data after that. So as long as they don't have that first win, they could run in two maidens back to back if they don't catch oh, a wow. win. How much are they to join? Um, I think they're typically like 300 froth. 300 froth? All right. So there you Redago. go, baby. We can join two and maybe win like 20,000 froth. All right. We still got a minute, six seconds. Um. And I'm still fucking bored. <laughs> what time is it? It's 12. Can't wait to sleep. Let's see if I got rugged on these comics. Because as soon as I sell. Yep. There you go. As soon as I sell, then it jumps up. Fuck you, VV. All right. That's how that's how it happens, though. Uh, to my rare. I need that rare to go up. The secret rare. You don't go for any of this stuff, right? You're smart <laughs> for the VV stuff. Oh, yeah. I don't mess around with VV. <laughs> it's probably smart. It's just. Maybe I mean, I like someday, it. But yeah. 
play money for virtual comics right now just in cards for us <laughs> no but we'll let you know when there's one worth going for right now there's not one worth going for but like uh on dc if action comic number one comes out and you somehow can get it that would be worth it or captain america one if that came out there's a few that like you're guaranteed to make some money but it's like comic book to... keys but in nft form are valuable exactly yes so i have a Seeker or AF-15. So that's the first comic that Spider-Man was premiered in. And I was dumb and didn't sell it the first day I got it for like $20,000. Uh, and it's worth probably about $8,000 right now. Jeez. Right? For a fucking digital, like for a JPEG. I think for $20,000, I probably would have pulled the trigger on that. I should have. But everyone thought, well, I could win money. I don't know. Come on, stop winning, Big A. Oh, uh, Fuck, you gotta fuck over Big A. That's the rules. Nope, look at that. Stop it, Big A. Stop it. And the wifey's right. She's gonna get totally screwed there. And at the very end, I know my stop winning Big A is gonna be like first. Which would be fine. Oh my lord. Come on, slow down. There he goes. Oh my god, slow down. <laughs> Fuck! Fuck you! Big A. Oh, my lord. Just white. Why do I even try? Oh, my god. Ooh, well, I think I won finish. like... I think I won 500. That was oh. a tight finish. Reggie edged out the first just before the finish line, and then Muzzle Michael from Andy edged back out just before the race went I to mean... finished. So I don't know if it was a before the cut. So second like split second there you go reggie got it and look and he got it basically twice holy shit he look at that getting almost 3500 yeah. froth 3950 between the yeah. two and then big uh one. nickel did well mm -hmm. uh big a fucked me so there <laughs> you go babe we got 800 froth uh, Ronnie Lido got 300, which he's always winning. But man, Reggie doing the rug, man. That's great. I'm so happy for you. Said nobody ever. Um, all right. So what is I, I will try one more time. Does anyone else want to do a pack rip? Because I want to get the hell out of here. Uh, if you want to, I don't even know if Voxen can even stay here for that. But if you want to, mm -hmm. I'll throw the deal out again. Buy four, get one free and 10 training points. I'm probably not going to offer that again, but I box in. I do need your address. Gotcha. Can you put that in the newbie chat? Yep. And we'll then do. let's see here. Uh, yes, there's, there's our final race. Well, at least I got something for five hours of work. Okay, there we go. There it is. All right. So I got to decide, like, how many pack rips have you done, and how many extremely rares have you gotten? I have never pulled an extremely rare for me. I've, I mean, for like rip nights and things, we've ripped 500 plus packs probably, and I've pulled one Hickman purebred on a Hickman rip night. Um, There's the Michael. Now, there after is. that, VRs, we've pulled probably five or six. Uh, Michael spit out two VRs uh liberty or not liberty roses spit out two i believe trinity spit out no roses spit out one trinity spit out two um but oh, the did. pull rate on a vr is like two point something percent it's low er's is point something percent so oh uh legis it would be 60 matic so it's buy four get one free plus get 10 training points if you want to do it one er in all the doghouse really so it's like not even yeah he wanted to know the cost of to do the pack rips oops i was lagging yeah did you want to do it because otherwise i'm about to send this off to boxton i've got 10 points i mean it's not a bad deal i would have done this but i did one last week uh ledges are you interested or no no biggie I don't think he's interested. What happens is I'll send it. It'll be like, oh, I'm interested. <laughs> it's right. no rush, man. We can wait and wait for him to respond. Fiat, what kind of bullshit is this? Um, I guess. Uh, let's hold on a second. Let me see here. 
do I oh I don't even have enough matic in here well no I could transfer it over from I mean I guess you could you're gonna send it to my PayPal Lord that's so confusing uh it's so funny because normally I'd be like hell yeah fuck that crypto shit <laughs> <laughs> is matic even or not is he I don't think either one of us get rugged on that he might get rugged a little bit let me see what Maddox's at it was almost even the other day. Um, Looks like it's oh, less it's than a dollar. Down. Right wow, it's way down. But well, Bitcoin tanked, so I'm thinking that's probably why. Yeah, because there's a half man. I almost want to go buy uh, somatic. Uh, let's see. I'd rather you just send it in Matic. I mean, it'd be cheaper. I don't want to be doing all this calculating. I mean, you can send it, but then I'm still going to just want 60, which is going to be more for you. Because then I'm going to have to move it back because I got to finish paying off my uh, my re-roller because Aussie made me a good deal. Well, he didn't make me the best deal, but I could pay it over time. So it was a good deal, I guess. Yeah, I mean, that, that'd probably be still pretty fair because, I mean, going through outside payments, PayPal to convert it all and do all your stuff. You I mean, you oh, yeah, I forgot fees. I got a fee too. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about yeah, the fee. little fees. So 60, 60 through PayPal would be pretty pretty equal to 60 Matt. Like he's just taking I, a little bit of a loss going that way. Let me see if I've got, I do have Venmo. I can check real quick. It's not a biggie though if you don't want to do it. Um, I do, but I don't know. I've got my other phone here. I, I couldn't get rid of my iPhone 12 mini because everything's fucking on here. But then I've got the Ultra 23 and nothing transferred. So I don't even have... Oh my God, let me see if it'll let me log in. Oh, maybe I do. Um, Give me a second here. Oh, couldn't log me in. Yeah, you don't have PayPal, do you? I can swap PayPal to Matic if it helps. Uh, Lizzie, babe, should I do any? Oh, you want to do it? Well, I mean, right now, Legis gets first dibs. Uh, I can use PayPal. Oh, you got PayPal? All right, so PayPal. Um, hold on, let me see. Uh, fuck. I think it's in chat. Let me. It should. Let me go up. If you go up through here, it should. They should put it in here. I also have the QR. Can you QR code? Watch this. Watch this awesomeness. Uh, right here. Let's do it right here. Can you do QR codes? Boom. There's the PayPal right there. And the Cash App. And the Cash App. I don't care about the special. I'm just asking. No, I'd wait. I'd wait until we have a special. Why not? And if nobody wants it, then... Yeah, let's just, that's fine. You can do PayPal. But do you, can you do that? Let me see if I've got it in uh, chat where it is. I know it's in the... Botrix puts it in there every... Oh, here it is. Uh, but I don't know if he can. All right, here we go. What bullshit on their fees? Just put that we're friends. Right? Doesn't that work? Friends and family, yeah, I think so. For sending fees. Like, there's no sending fees when you do friends and family transfer. Right, right. Uh, oops, I was lagging. Oh, no, that's just bad. Uh, she's tired of, I'm tired of losing too. Can you copy that Legis or do I need to put that in? I can put that in the, um, discord too. I think it just, oh, it says we can't find this profile. Oh, on that, it says that. God damn it. Make sure this link's right. And profile hasn't been turned off. Okay. Hold on. Let me see if it works or doesn't work anymore. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's not working. Well, that's fucking wonderful. I do have PayPal. Uh, but I got rugged here. Oh, like that's what sucks about these apps. If it logged me out or did some weird thing. All right. Let me pull it up. Let me see. What sucks is I know uh, OG Vault just. Uh... Oh, looks he like just, the QR he works. He just sent it to me. Probably to the QR. I scanned the QR to see what that would do. Oh, okay. All right. And that All right, let's seemed just... to work. Even with friends. Oh, it does? Uh... All right. Well, it looks like it's covered. All right. So let me do this real quick. Let me. We did get it. 
don't know what the heck why this pulled oh because i was looking that up all right so give me a second here i gotta go into my funds and credits here what a bullshit froth bull crap is that breeder rewards uh let me just cash this out so i can get him what he needs uh yeah we'll withdraw that I try to keep it in there, so I think I actually have more money than I do. <laughs> right? So you're like, oh, I found a $20 bill. <clears throat> I usually will pull it out just in high fluctuation periods. Because in times where Froth will hit a high run, I'll swap it over to Matic if Matic low. Because you'll get more Matic for your Froth. And then if Froth takes a dip or Matic is on a high run, you can get a little bit more Froth bag if Froth you know, drops down under that point. Well, that's so. kind of what I was thinking, like get rid of the froth and buy the Matic because the froth, you know, but I don't know if froth kind of moves down with everything. So, but yeah, Matic will go up probably more often. All right. So, all right, we are going to do, we're going to go back to the kennel. Are we going to just do uh legis? What do you want to breed off of? You want to breed off of the Michael? You want to try to go uh, do, um, switch it up and do an Amelia to try to get a crappy one or you want to do all five Michaels what do you want to do you've got five I found a 20 of a walk my dog two months ago must be nice um what do you think Legis? what would you like we've got so Michael is a very rare uh we got some good pulls off of both of them Amelia's from big a but that is for best of the worst um what would you a mix so you want uh, what would you say, Vox? And would it be better to do two Amelias, three Michaels? I'd say probably, yeah, three Michaels, two Amelias. That way, you try to hope for a monster hound on the Michael pools, and then you'd have a couple shots at the best of the worsts. All right, um, so let's that'd be my my suggestion if you're going to be mixing it up. Does that sound good, uh, Legis? If you're just joining in, you just joined the most boring stream ever, or maybe so even just... three Michaels and one Amelia. And if you get a solid hit on a best of the worst on the Amelia on the first rip, then you could rip Michael and do four and one. And if you, so you don't, think we should get start off with one. an Amelia, or you're saying start off with the Michael first? Yeah, well, you could just do one Amelia and then see, or you could do your three Michaels and then one Amelia, and then if you hit, you know, do another Michael pack, and if you don't, then try try for another best of the worst from Amelia. That way, you know, if you know something happens and doesn't get anything off Michael pulls, then. If the Amelia hits with a best of the worst, he wouldn't have to target a second BOTW and have that extra shot at a, a solid pull from Mike. So wait, uh, so which one do you think is better to start off with the Michael? I'd start off with the Mike and see if you get any. Because I mean, if you get a couple bangers in there, then you can just rip two Amelias and call it good skis. But if it's all misses and you pull your first Amelia and it's a solid best of the worst hit, then you can go back and try the Mike one more time. All right, so let's go breed. Um. Okay, we got the Michael. Here's one. I'm gonna and breed then, two. I don't know if you knew this, but for multi breeds, you can actually mm -hmm. click the breed now button as many times as you want, and then do all your conf confirmations on the other side. So, like, if I'm doing three, I'll just click breed now three times, tap, 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 and then wait for the pop up, and it'll say you have three pending transactions, and I just click confirm, confirm, confirm. So I would do two right now. Start off with one Amelia. And three Michaels. All right, so let me do two more Michaels, and then we'll do an Amelia. So I should hit this twice. I've done that before. That never worked out well, but try it. Um, did you? Is that the first one you mentioned? I thought that was the second mic you minted there. No, I only did one mic. You oh, okay, see, yeah. yeah. So yeah, you yeah. could do tap tap, and it'd breed two. You just gotta make sure it like does that little flash on it when you click it. Okay, so it only shows one up here. Uh, it says fifteen Maddox. So I only got one. So if you, yeah, you got one so far there popped up um, since the last one. So if you just click, click, it should pend up two transactions. And in, the, in your MetaMask pop-up, it'll say you have two pending. And you can just click confirm twice. So like when I'm doing bulk and somebody buys 10, instead of waiting for 10 to go through the whole minting animation, I'll just click that button you 10 do. times. and then Yeah, but confirm. I did that. I don't, well, here, we'll see what happens here. Uh, you have one pending transaction. So now I got to do it again. Okay, so maybe that is going to be two here. Or not. The fuck. Oh, uh, that's weird. Yep. Yeah, that's why I don't. Let me let me go into the let me go into that's my right there. See. 
it, it'll do that and like if you do five it layers them so much that it gets rid of like all the opacity <laughs> yeah but if you do like but i did one and then it's only it's still only showing one pack it, there's, there's delay um it's about a 45 second delay to a minute um on your breeds before they pop up into the uh breed calculator because this should already have two packs and we only have one yeah and or when they show two. up when the other two show up it'll be about the same time that the breed tab shows those two breeds oh i see what you're saying so the breed tab I don't like how this works. There we go. Okay, cool. All right, so now we got to do, and they don't even say that they're from Michael though. Why? If you refresh kennel one more time, it'll tell you what they're from. Okay. Nice. You you got all the alpha. Again, I'm just a basic S dog. All right, so we're gonna do one Amelia, um, and then we'll um, then we'll go do this and see what he wants to do on that last one. All right, so here we go. Let's go ahead. Whoops. Let's go ahead and breed this real quick. Got an Amelia. All right. Yeah, sorry. I have no clue what I'm doing. Just charge me whatever, people. Have you ever gone off the screen by accident? And what does that do if you do that? As far as what? Like where it says, do not leave the screen minting in process. Like I right have, here. And it just goes through anyway. Once you click on the confirm, it, it initiates the transaction, like the handshake on the back end. And I've left that screen. I click outside the window all the time after I mint because usually, and I do that with entering races too. Ghosty found that one that occasionally when you go to enter your hound in a race and it's on that like pending entry, if you just click outside of that window to just the race registration tab, sometimes that forces the handshake to enter your hound too. Oh, okay. All right. So here, let's go do a Michael, let's see what happens here. And then we can do an Amelia or whatever. Let's give it a try. All right. Good luck. You still here, Legis? You got to let us know what you want to do. Obviously, we'll be able to get everything sent. Come on, let's get an extremely rare or something good. A Lewis. Yeah, Louis ain't, Louis ain't a keeper. All right, Legis, I say reroll, but you got to give us. Oh, okay, you're here. Do you want to reroll? This is not a keeper. IMO, and I have no clue what I'm doing, and I still think this is not a keeper. <laughs> you want to keep it? uh he's here he is here yeah i probably was clicking too fast all right yes he wants a reroll. okay here we go good luck smart decision very smart decision either way like if you get one good out of these five packs it was worth it absolutely yeah one monster hound one high-end rare um could bring in I, I got one dog that's brought me over 2500 matic so 2650 is the Matic winnings on just one of my hounds. That's crazy. I have one yeah. that's brought me 20. Comp oh man, I was hoping this was a good uh best of the worst. John seven. All right, so nothing special here. It's got good consistency, but there's nothing you can really do. What about a 92 race though? Wouldn't this I guess because of that endurance, it's not gonna do well. All right, well, let's do should we do an Amelia? That one you're stuck with. We still have one more pack to add after all this. Um, let's do the Amelia, right? And see what happens. All right, let's try it. All right, good luck here. Come on, this is for a best of the worst. This is what we want. I guess you still could get actually something really good off of this. Let me... Ooh. That's a pretty good best of the worst, isn't it? Is That's that a, actually a, a banger best of the worst. That's the right? second best black gray best of the worst. Uh, the 89 speed is the only upgrade over an Amelia herself. Wow. And Allen's still run super clean in best of the worst performance. So uh, the 92 consistent, the only thing you would want better is 87 speed, which you'd be getting in the Amelia itself. I would personally keep an Allen any day of the week for best of the worst performance because that's most likely going to win you at least a few hundred Matic. You're going to win some of them, probably. right? Especially in my crappy races. Yeah, because yeah. that that you've the got that Allen's crappy almost at 300 Matic winnings right now in best of the worst performance. Oh wow! Yeah. All right, so Legis, you want to keep that? I would say keep this for best of the. This will be good for one of my races. Uh, and Voxton's too. He does best of the worst, and so does uh, Dave the Bowler. So smart decision, Ledges. That is definitely going to win you some best of the worst money. 
And when you say keep, you mean keep for myself, right? I'm, just <laughs> I'm not. I'm not just kidding. I'm gonna keep it. All right. So accept. All right. So we got that. So now we don't have to do another Amelia. We can just do these exactly. So now you can more. move straight on to another mic pack, and hope for a banger. That. Let's go mint that. Because that's right there. I mean, oh, if all you're entering is sometimes I don't even enter two best of the worst in a best of the worst race because those are ideal races if you're hunting class points, if you're hunting form. If right. you want to have like your high end dogs get really high form, put them in the best of the worst. There's only going to be one, two, maybe three high end dogs in there with rabbits. So you're going to end up placing on the podium just about every race. And every time you get podium, you're getting form. So, yeah, this is exciting. I'm really happy for you, Ledges, for fucking me and taking all the good luck. Um, yeah, I'm very happy. <laughs> this is like, I do this and I get rugged. But let's go ahead and see. Good luck here. Yeah, I, I, I think from well. Amelia, the, the best two to hope for would have been an Allen or a Lancelot. Uh, the right. pure Amelia, I think, would be a little bit too strong of a runner, but Allen and Lance are pretty much on par with each other. Lancelot has two additional consistency, and Amelia or um, Allen has two additional speed. This is a for sure reroll, right? Sue is a, a definite reroll. Not a bad 87 speed, but nobody's racing to win 87s right now. The 87 speed uh, sit and go is still Matic entry because it hasn't filled since they converted to froth. So eh, um, that's funny. I've got a few 87 speeders. We've ran some 87 speed tournaments, um, but there's better 87 speeders than Sue for that. Um, Kevin, Steven. So. What do you think, Legis? Yeah. Uh, re I would re-roll this. Not I'd recommend a re-roll. I mean, it's a common. Even if it was a rare, this is not like... You're really looking for... Even I know you're looking for the speed to be as high as possible. 97 speed, 97 endurance makes it a real easy re-roll if you can get that. There's a I lot heard. of relevant 92 speeders to look at. But if you have a 92 speeder with an 80 in just about anything, uh, it's worth taking a second look at to see if it'd be worth keeping or re-rolling. All right, let's see what we got going here. All right, the music is really not awesome. Anymore. Kyle. Oh, so wow. Kyle's actually the third best OG 87 speeder, if that accounts for anything. So if you did ever want to put him in any 87 limited races, or if we run more 87 commons, Kyle's a high-end 87 speed runner. He's yeah, because he's got that good... Match with Hickman endurance he's got the good decent consistency and a good acceleration yeah. for sure so black grays will never have more than 92 consistencies unless they're trained all right so so far you've got your best of the worst which is awesome now we just need to get you a good good pull off the michael but still you'll make your money back plus you get the training points too if you get something good here um not only can you train but you'll get the uh the rabbits. All right. So this looks like a... Charles is definitely a re-roller. Yeah. Consistency Legend. is too high to be a best of the worst. Any stay or marathon and he's going to run really strong. Um, yeah. yeah. All right. Is that a re-roll, Legis? I know you said before. I'm hoping we it. see his next Liberty pool here. That'd be amazing for Legis. Get that Liberty in there for mm -hmm. the 5,000 Medic Liberty tournament at the end of the month. Yeah, you'd be automatically in because that's what um, Shelby Cobra did. She got There's the been well. less Liberties pulled than there were Roses last month. Oh, really? All right, so he wants a re-roll here, and we still got one more pack. I almost want to do this. How easily can I take my cash from PayPal to Metamask? <laughs> it's, it's actually like... pretty easy. Got to do through Coinbase? Oh. Um, PayPal, you can buy crypto straight on the PayPal platform. Oh, really? I didn't even know that. Remember yeah, they got their own crypto wallet. All right, so not great. Um, not great, not terrible. Yeah, Merida is an average speed. tier 92 speeder. I have one Merida I kept and named Ursa that I pulled from, uh, I think, a Hickman. But, uh, yeah, that one's usually a, a burner credit for most folks unless you're wanting to do some G4s and don't have something better. All right, one last one. Good luck here. Come on, let's get something good. Well, like I said, I'll get these. Last back, best back. Come on. Let's get a banger. At least we got the best of the worst. I'll buy that Allen if you want to sell it. You hear that, Legis? He'll buy it. Of course he will, because he doesn't want any competition. He's like De Bears. Well, he, <laughs> he knows the value of a of an Allen for sure. 
Big A is a, a best of the worst connoisseur. He so is speak. very good at rugging uh, everyone. All right, so I'm thinking this is also. Cecilia um, is definitely a re-roll ski, but before you click it, maybe another one of those poems that uh, that brought that. Oh yeah, let me out. see if I remember. I probably just have to do the same one because I don't remember yeah. any of them. But we'll try it. Let's try it. Uh, let us let us know if you want to re-roll this. I would do it. Uh, but here we go. A little Andrew Dice Clay. Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater, had a wife and liked to beat her, slapped her twice across her ass. I don't remember. I don't even know. I don't even know. But does that count? <laughs> it's Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater, had a wife and liked to beat her, slapped her twice across the head, fucked her ass and went to bed. Oh. hey -oh. There we go. Okay. He's saying re-roll. You got the right time. That's going to do it right there. Let's get this. All right. Here we go. Get it. Ready for a nap. <laughs> nap time add a couple hours to my two hours sleep last night already not doing well yikes what is a up race again time? oof all right well wasn't the best but you did get the best of the worst which will pay which oh, will for sure. i mean yeah that will pay off right there you'll get that money back probably in a couple weeks if not much sooner all right so let's do this legis i need your address can you put that in discord in the newbie chat let me erase this paypal theme since that doesn't work yeah you could potentially make every bit you spent on all five of those packs in the next three to five days if someone runs the best of the worst oh for sure and i still have money left so all right, so we're gonna go. Um, let me. I'm gonna go send yours back. And Legis, if you can't put that in the Discord, in the uh, in the newbie chat at the top, and then let me go into the kennel here. Let's get yours sent out in big A's. All right, let's go send this Michael back. All right, Knights at the Hound Table. Good That's to go. That's me. Did you get that? on a pull or did you buy no uh, so that, that one actually has like a long history that one has traveled the world uh so to <laughs> speak so big a minted uh a, a series of breeders through me and that michael was pulled in that run of breeders big a sold michael to hems i bought a michael from adza and traded hems for that michael because i wanted one that matched my birth month and birth year so i was born march 21st 84 in the, the three four eight four so my birth month is march ghosties is in april so that's three and four my birth year is 84 put her four from april onto my birth year it makes her birth year of 88 so i was like fuck it i love numerology so i was like i really want that michael breeder and so the 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 full life cycle was i minted the blind pack big a opened it big a sold it and then i traded for it to get michael back home to the original minting like kennel so it, he, he kind of traveled a little bit <laughs> went out and saw the world and then he came back to the original minting kennel and and that's where he'll roost for his life <laughs> did i fuck that up big a i thought i did five packs hold on let's check we'll go i thought we did five packs but if not i'm pretty sure you did on. five i'm pretty sure i did five but i maybe you did not. one amelia and four mics yeah that's what i thought so we've got let's go do go up here here okay so here we go we got name there's yeah so here we got uh one two alan kyle three Grace, four and john and yep. five yep john and uh, yeah john and and john's not a bad Grace. g4 the 87 endurance is a little bit eh but all of the other stats of john are what the highest ones you'd hope for in a g4 runner and having that 370 right. balance in your sprints and in your mids he's gonna actually shine really well and if you learn his rabbits in the stays he's gonna do really well there marathons he might struggle a little bit because of the endurance but if you don't have another g4 hound to, to race to learn it's something damn it i clicked off the damn page fucker all right here we go big time kennels all right let's get the amelia off and then Legis, did you let me go check the come on fucking Matic. So on PayPal, I gotta set up a new wallet though, then to transfer 
I to... usually just um, send my PayPal. So I set up. So you have Cash App, and that's for, if you have. Do you have a Cash App card by chance? I do not. I do you not. Don't. Or Venmo. So I have a Venmo card, and I have a Cash App card, and I have a um, Chime card. So any of those that I use, you can withdraw to PayPal straight to bank instantly for like twenty five okay. cents. Right. Right. And so that's what I usually do is just move it on one of those cards to buy it instead of going the crypto route through PayPal because the crypto route through PayPal seems to have delays on it. And I don't like those. <laughs> right. Well, exactly. I don't want delays either. All right. So we've got, let me, oh, and I can't do these all at one time because of the fucking stupid ass shit. So John is the first one. Let's go ahead and transfer John. And we'll say Legis. There we go. We know that's right. All right. John is on its way. And Mike is safely home, by the way. Oh, perfect. And Big A, did you get your uh, Amelia? I'm going to have to do some maybe pack. If I can win some of my races, maybe I'll do some more pack openings next week. Or let the wifey do it because she does pretty well. I suck. Yeah, she's got the luck. I think she's going to be the one to pull the Liberty. I know, right? The pure Rose from our Rose last month. So we don't have a Liberty for the pure Liberty, but I personally would like to see a, a Liberty from now. Are, are Michael a Liberty? The, the liberties that I've gotten from Michael, they actually run really, really clean, which is really awesome because uh, good chance that it's going to run clean in the actual tournament. A lot of people that have pulled liberties have actually rugged the liberty training pretty bad. Yeah. <laughs> um, Lunar, my liberty from before the window, I had still left untrained from Michael. And then I rolled training on Lunar before I rolled on the Michael uh or the Hickman bread. Sorry, I have a Hickman bread um, uh, Liberty in the uh, tournament. And that was actually one that Ninja pulled. And he had said, if I pull an in a Liberty, you could have it because he was pulling for other stuff. Oh, wow. And so he actually ended up letting me have it. He won the, the pack rips at the end of our jackpot stream. Uh, but I got a Liberty from Hickman that I'm testing out. And it did not get as good of training. Uh, it did get a 388 overall, which isn't bad, but I got stuck with the 98 speed. But I did get the 99 endurance, 98 consistency. So I got plus two to consistency, plus three to endurance, and then plus six to speed. So somewhat rugged. Um, Lunar got 100 speed, 100 endurance. And she's not in the tournament. So Lunar ended up 193, 196. And uh, yeah, I would have rather oh, wow. had that those stats on my relevant competitive uh, liberty, though. All right, come on. This is the last one. Remember that Amelia. Yeah, that'd be a good one to hunt for, Big A, the the Pure Liberty. And then Amira Liberty is always solid. Uh, Brooks Liberty would be a good pull. Um, That's, oh, I got to accept this. Bell Liberty would be a good pull. Yeah, does any... I mean, does anyone want to do... Uh, the i mean we could if you want to in boxing you can go big a saying he's got the liberty if anyone wants to go purebred we could do a uh let's see we do buy three get one free or do we do buy two no that won't work buy three get one free I don't know if that's worth it, but if somebody wants to do try to go for a purebred liberty, we could do that, or we could try it next week. But you'll have less time to train it, I guess. But that goes live at the end of the month. Uh, yeah. Let's just so the last me... week of the month. So the last week is the final cutoff, and then the race runs for the last week of the month. So it'll be a seven day race. Uh, you want to do okay, uh, Boxen? I got to take a quick uh, bathroom break. You want to stay here for a second and talk? Yeah, or yeah, I can chill. Okay, I'll hold it down, cool. brother. Perfect. I'll be right back. Yeah, Brooks and Liberty both be solid. Gordon would be an amazing breeder. A little bit better than the Bell that I had mentioned. Um, Gordon's actually a three of four stat match to Liberty with an increase to speed. So Gordon is a, a banger uh, breeder to pull. I don't know if you have a Gordon. Um, be yeah, a Gordon. Gordon, Brooks, Pure Liberty, Amira. Regis wouldn't be terrible. Obviously, a George Liberty would be up there. Um, I'd rank him probably George at the top, then Amira, then probably probably Gordon, pretty on par with the purebred. So that'd be kind of your top three to, to hunt from would be 
George, then Amira, and then Gordon or Pure Lib. Brooks would be up there, probably in the same vein. So Brooks, Liberty, and, and Gordon would kind of be almost even playing field for the high end Liberty pulls. Yeah, Gordon would be like that's one of those I like Gordons. I like the way they run. I have one Gordon that I've pulled for me, uh, named Kamish <laughs> or the Kamish. Uh, after Commissioner Gordon from Batman. But I've only ever pulled the one Gordon before. I ended up getting him to 389. Could have been a little bit better, but I did hit the 100 speed on him. So he's 195, 98, 96. But uh, I would have liked to hit a little bit higher on the uh, the Indo rolls because I only, only ended up getting plus 6 to endurance and plus 3 to speed. So he only ended up a plus 9. Um. Oh, no, I got uh, 95 acceleration plus 2 in acceleration too. Sorry, misquoted. So I did put uh, uh, a roll into AC. So he's 195, 98, 96 instead of the 93. Yeah, yeah love a good Gordon. Don't have a Gordon breeder yet. Uh, maybe eventually we'll either get one or trade for one or something. But uh, Gordon's on my hot list for sure as far as fawns go. I, I think, okay, so my wife does want to do... Uh, she wants to do something. Should she go for a purebred Liberty or should she do like a Brooks and a Liberty? So or... Brooks Liberty and pure Liberty are pretty much on par as far as their, their, you know, top end potential on those RNG rolls on the intangibles. George is at the peak. Um, Amira is going to be like just underneath a George and uh, Amira is only going to be a better puller for the Liberties because it is a three out of four stat match with that fourth increase, just like the George would be, but they actually have the three matching. Brooks is similar vein, um, but uh, you're going to be getting a dual mismatch with the increase on the speed side and the mismatch on the endo side, which could make for it. Eh. So I wouldn't prioritize a Brooks over a pure Liberty. Uh, personally, I would rather have the pure Lib than the Brooks Lib. So the Liberty, so should you go for, should you go for like two Liberties and a Brooks or just do just all Liberty? Uh, I, I don't know really how... Uh, Big A's Brooks or his Liberty has bred in the past. Um, you'd have to pretty kind of good. That at, Brooks has done pretty good. Yeah, I got it, babe. Yeah, you'd, you'd have to look at the breeding pools and see like what I, I, I have a theory and I've, I've talked about it a little bit that there's coding for the racer breeders similar to there's coding for the coaches in soccer. And the way the coaches are, are coded is they have cities that they prioritize recruiting players from. So the right. cities they prioritize, that's like their pool of players that they're going to hit on more than other cities. And that's just a invisible stat on the coaches, but they made that invisible stat known to exist in the white paper for soccer. There's a lot of ways that breeders breed, racers race, and other things that they've released some info on the soccer side about how those coaches operate that i've seen similar patterns in in breeders and while it is quoted in the white paper and everybody always says you know like no breeders don't don't affect those things all that's ever been quoted in that vein is that the rarity of the breeder will not affect the rarity of what is pulled okay. and that would still be in line because you'd have a pool of racers with the same draw luck of rarity but that pool of racers is going to be different than another breeder's pool of racers. So if you find a breeder that's been bred a lot and it has a high end pool of what you're hunting for. So like our Trinity puts out a lot of pure trends. His Brooks puts out a lot of pure Brooks. He may have one of those that has a, a Brooks racer like deep in his pool. And so that's why he's hitting on those pure Brooks quite a bit. Um, similar vein, you find a lot of commons like grace, Michael does pull a lot of graces, he pulls a lot of Cecilia's. Um, but those are like those low end commons that I see pop up quite a bit on him. And as far as his rare and above go, I see him pull some of those more quality rares and above and he pulls banger VR so far. So, um, just finding the breeder that's never been tapped is the question mark of you could have the best. Everybody says I have the best, whatever yeah. breeder in the game, the best Gordon breeder in the game, the best, you know, Porter breeder in the game. Um, until you see how they recruit or breed their racers, 
you'll never know if it's going to be the best in the game or not. And knowing kind of what they've made helps you know what to pull from uh, for what you're hunting for. So, the big um, says his Brooks pulled two purebreds within three pulls. How is that... Brooks pulling on Clarks and Liberties? Has he put out many Clarks or Liberties? That I don't know. Big A, you're the man to answer that question. Yeah. It's pretty easy to filter all that just down in the off-string tab when he... Yeah, our, our, our Trinity Breeder's smoking. Smoking hot. I mean, we, we haven't even pulled from her all that much, and she's already put out three purebreds, two VRs, and a bunch of really high-end rares. Leonard's, and... I don't know if... She, I think Brooks came from Michael. So you have a good Trinity, and Trinity, it well, what's on the... I don't want to take something that you don't want to uh, uh, train with, so I don't really care. But what what is our best bet here? I, I would say that probably the pure Liberty would be the play if it hasn't been hit that much. The Liberty would probably be the play. I feel like pure blood dogs are going to be in the racer pool from any like racer. Like itself will be in its pool. How often it's in his pool is the question mark. But if for some reason the Brooks doesn't have the Liberty as its targeted racers, you know, you may hit on Liberties every once in a while, but you might have one out of 200 pulls be a Liberty. Whereas you find a Liberty heavy racer or a pure Liberty. I, I have a, just this hunch that especially on these mid to low rares, the roses, we saw a lot of pure roses in the rose tourney. It is a 20% chance of pulling a rare. And I feel like making sure or knowing with certainty that the racer you're hunting for is in the pool is important so without seeing okay is, if, if this is the i'm link pulling this up books. so we'll go check this up here is this oh is this going to pull up his or will it yeah this will pull up his breeder page for his brooks and you can go through and sort by rarity and then see all of them that have been pulled so senna similar uh vein to a liberty just in the blue gray coat so that's something good to see um clark's Similar vein, good to see. Oh, you're but pulling no it up. hit yet. Um, if it was me deciding, I would personally probably hunt from the Liberty than the Brooks. So that's this is what you're talking about. Yep. Right yep. You scroll down and see what they've hit on. You know, we got a John and an Elsa's all that this Liberty's ever spit out before. Um, so at least seeing what the first rare is. I mean, the very first rare that hits on this Liberty could be the purebred because we've never seen a rare, so we don't even know what vein to even start calculating. But I'm pretty sure it is a guarantee that of any breeder, itself as a racer will be in the breeding pool, so you know you'll at least have a chance at the Liberty. Like Michael spit out three Liberties. I know he spits out Liberties, so he's always one that's good to hunt for four Liberties. Uh, he has not put out a rose yet, I don't think. No, he put out one, one rose. So for 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 my wife, is she just best to do three on here, or should she do Brooks, or should she do a Trinity? Or I, I would person for this month, if you're trying to get in the race, I would do three from the Liberty and try to hunt for that pure. All right, let's fucking do it. All right, Big A, you got the. Uh, you want to send that Liberty? He probably already sent it. Um. All right, so let's go. Let's see what we got here. We'll go to the breeders. We'll get it primed for this. Yeah, just let me know when you got that, and I will uh, we'll get this bred. And so then, and then of course we got to decide what we're going to do with this Kevin. I guess if I keep him next December, he's going to be. He is, okay. and and honestly, if if you don't trade Reggie and he's still wanting a Kevin, like I have only the one Kevin, but I do have other breeders that. I plan on hitting for spotty season. I plan on breeding for my Steve more than my Kevin, honestly, because looking at stat translations, I have this gut feeling that the Steven's going to be the one that's going to give me an Avicii this December coming up. So I'm going to prioritize ripping from Steven over Kevin. Um, so I, I would, I'd be keen on a Brian for Kevin swap myself. If you don't end up taking up on it, because oh. he's a high end rare. He's going to put out solid whippets. Um, I like the way a Brian runs. Brian's have won G one tournaments. Like they, they're a clean running hound and it's high end rare. So what's its, uh, what's its stats on that? Uh, a Brian is 97, 93, 
9292 okay all right so here we go uh thank you big a all right wifey are you still here cobra dojo click to breathe so if i click this like a one two three don't do it too fast that's the way to do it because i'm gonna give it i click them fast oh you do i just after the first click when that metamask pop-up pops up I just click off the pop-up and just click it as many times as I want to click it to breed. And it, he's, he's got a Kevin and stuff. Are any one of those good or just go for, I mean, the thing that sucks is if we don't get this, are we going to get anything good that we can actually use? Well, yeah. Pulling from Liberty is going to be solid no matter what. I mean, you're, you're pulling from a 377 rare. So, I mean, that's, that's a, a high end rare. Anything that's 375 or higher is high end. Brian okay. is 374, and that's just because of the black gray coat. But um, I still like the way Brian runs. I like the way Morrison's run. I like the way Andrews run. I like black gray coats for for like hunting particular races, not necessarily tournament hounds. But if you're gonna, you know, try to train up and learn a hound for those paid known condition races, a uh, Brian's a solid choice. All right. So it's minting and it's asking me again to confirm. Can I confirm or do I wait for it to finish? Yeah, you can confirm. Yeah, you can just series. That's a, a separate handshake now. Every time on MetaMask, you're okay. just signing the contract every time you click confirm now. You don't have to wait on anything on the most side. Okay. For spotting December, I have Kevin and... Oh, okay. Not now. Yeah. I see. So the three, the three OG breeders, I mean, it's really the only breeders. There's OGs. But the three to really hunt for, if you're really hunting for those commons and, and you're doing the 87 speed, Kyle, uh, Kevin, and Steven. Kevin is going to be the all-around better producer for spotties in general. Uh, a few of them with stat matches on the Steven side are going to be a little bit better than Kevin. And Avicii being one of them that I really want to get my hands on in Avicii. And uh, he's he's a little bit better from the Kevin. Now, Hector is another high-end one. Arnold's a high-end one. Those, I have a feeling, are going to be both better from Kevin. Uh, but, yeah. How the hell did you figure all this out? I'm going to go a for the A lot of right research. <laughs> I mean, like, where, like, you're really diving in. So what I dive into the most is learning how stats translate between the hounds and the dogs. I look for, you know... Uh, both matching and non-matching hounds. I look for uh, how many races they've had to see how configured those hounds are, how many different funnels that those hounds get that are tight times to the world fastest times. Because I'll have some some hounds that should be high in pulls, and I might have one or two seconds off the world fastest in one funnel, and the rest of my funnels are just garbage, and I've got confirmed, you know, god rules on them that they're good. A Brooks! Let's freaking go. Wow. All right. I mean, that's a keeper. Yes. <laughs> any day of the week. If you pull a Brooks from any 375 plus rare, it's a keeper. That's a banger freaking pull right there. Wow. Did we train this? I hate training these things. Um, I mean, I'm gonna keep you can it. train it right away or you could keep it for the next untrained maiden. Um, I put a Brooks from Michael into the untrained maiden at the beginning of March and he got first place and won like 375 Matic. So damn, that would I would, be I would probably hang on to him. If you're not in a dire need to start running it, um, wait for the next untrained maiden, or you can train him up for the next trip maiden. If that pops up, register him and then race his little butt off. All right. Huh? On Brooks 97. Yeah. He can't get in the night. Ugh. Whew, that was almost a damn liberty. I know, right? Yeah. All right. So there we go. This is a reroll. Babe, you want to reroll this, right? God damn. Even if it was 87 speed, I'm not saying a violet, but the consistency. Yeah. Would be yeah. Violet's definitely a reroll ski. All right. Look how nice Shelby said you can keep that, bro. Because I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> That babe, I'm just gonna re-roll this, right, babe? Can you just give me the? Uh, I could enter two then. Yes, you could enter two in that race. Yeah, you can get it as many. She's as got you the can. American got a maiden open to register, and it's a high, a high quality hound. Slap as many as you can in it. But you can only train it once it's been in the race, right? Like you can only practice. train it once the race runs and it's finished. You actually won't. I'm be not able training. To... I'm sorry. Practice. I can't practice. Yes, once you register it. 
you can practice as much as you want. As soon as you have got a dog registered in a maiden race, now you can go and win as many matches as you want to in freeze to learn your hound and set up its rabbits, and it won't take him out of the maiden race. Okay. There you go. Yeah, so we'll have to. That's the thing. I want enough time to get it in to actually. I mean, we have a workout breeder. We don't have the God breeder. Oh, that's a good uh, best of the worst, isn't it? Uh, I, I mean, we have no choice. The 89 speed and the little extra consistency, there's better options out there. This is the blue gray version of an Allen. So right. not a terrible best of the worst, but it could still be a performer. It'd be worth testing out on the track. You know, I've I mean, got an IV have no choice. We have that no I've choice. ran DOTWs. But yeah, instead of burning, an IV would be worth at least checking how they run. Especially an IV is a little bit better than a Roger, and I run a Roger a lot of the time in BOTWs. So. All right. I mean, we'll give it a try. We've got some that are not good, and they were bred from, you know, like a Brooks or something like that. All my best yeah. and the worst are bred from two, two good ones. Ugh. Well, she got the Brooks. Babe, can we reroll I mean, this? It's page? a win right now. I mean, Brooks is worth yeah. more than three rips any day of the week. So. Absolutely. It was a, bad, it was a good one. the Liberty reroll right here from the Juno. Who knows? Yep, babe, I need the confirmation just in case that has something to do with luck. <laughs> and then we can get the fuck out of here. Mm, there we go. All right. Good luck, babe. All right. Here we go. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Come on, pure liberty. Come on, pure liberty. Really thinking hard. I know. Is that good or bad? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Ooh. Royce. Ugh. Second best fawn 87 speeder, just under Kevin. So, not one I'd prioritize running. Oh, right. Definitely not. On, uh, let me ask you this before we go. On, like, training. So, if I, how much are you actually watching the race? When they do that treadmill effect, if I'm seeing that, does that automatically mean that's not the right dog or i need to see that a couple or the right rabbit there's a number right. of factors the easiest way is when you go back and look at your splits to see how they run over the duration of a race so when you pull up a previously ran race and you expand it expand the details from just the race selection window okay it'll show you splits which shows you how your dog ran in every 50 meter leg of that race so if you've got splits that are in like the 2.7s 2.7s 2.8s you know, it might creep up to low threes and drift back down to the twos here and there. You know that you've got a pretty well configured hound and the rabbits or conditions are lining up. Uh, if you have low form or a hound with naturally low consistency, you're going to get those treadmill effects regardless of that. Because how that operates is there's an RNG, basically, we'll call it a, a, a fumble check over the course of a race. When right. the race starts out. A, a, a hound with high acceleration acceleration only affects the time outside of the gate so the time from leaving the gate until you are capable of reaching your maximum speed your maximum speed is going to be determined by breeding the fastest a hound can be is 80 kilometers per hour there's no guarantee that your hound's natural ability will even be 80 kilometers per hour but it's said that by training it up to a 100 speed stat then increases it up to 100 percent of your dog's potential to hit its maximum okay. speed acceleration is how quickly it can hit that speed after leaving the gate endurance is how long it can maintain a race at maximum speed before it starts to slow down in the back legs so if you're looking at your split data and you have consistent runs all the way until the last maybe five splits of the race where it slows down a little bit and you have a 98 endurance dog you know it's your endurance that's causing the treadmill in the back legs of a marathon um if you have low consistency it makes it that much harder to learn your rabbits because even on preference even with the correct rabbit you can have a low consistency hound with a hundred form and still hit treadmill mud here and there so if you if you're running really clean and hit one or two races treadmill i wouldn't discount rabbit data especially if your average times on that race 
are like 20, 30 seconds faster than the world average and like five to eight seconds off of the world fastest, it could be worth getting a little bit more data before moving on from that rabbit. So it, would you say consistency, like a, this is 94, you want 95, 96, so is 94 a good entry point for consistency? So I have a pretty much identical um, purebred Michael for Sambo the Great, or Sambo the Goat. He's a 100, 100, 98, 94, 392 overall, purebred. So he came from a Michael, runs pretty clean. Uh, I just got him to G1, but he is one of the hardest hounds for me to confidently enter into races because he has to catch on preference races to have any hope of running consistently. Right. Off preference, it is a complete gamble. At 100 form, fully boosted, you know, even on preference, he'll shit the bed sometimes. But more <laughs> often than not, he runs well on preference. But uh, that 94 is lower than I like. I like the Blue Grays because they have a good even stat and the even running style. So when I'm training my Blue Grays, I could focus on getting my Indo and speed up. And then especially on the higher end hounds like Michaels and Trinities, I can actually divide those last rolls, one into consistency, one into acceleration and have a well-rounded tournament hound that's also going to shine that's on preference times. Right, right. Interesting. And then... So like here, I mean he's I've, he's he has some okay times here. Very not very good sprinting. If I go to so the one I'm really having issues with, I don't want to take too much of your time. Is my Genity? Pull this up, which is this one, George Trinity, 100 speed, 97 act, 99 endurance, 94 consistency. So this is going to be an absolute monster hound when you get her figured out and that's what i'm trying to do but like uh, is like if i go into here and see where i there's certain things that i know but i don't so what are your times on your sprints because i see multiple rabbits showing good performance so yeah, right you definitely here. have a, a sprinter on your hands uh marathon data whatever that 5.71 second time is look at whatever rabbit you had on the 800 meter and that's going to help you really dial in your marathons because with uh with a 99 endurance hound 5.71 seconds you might be able to get that down to like five flat boosted but that's going to be a solid solid race so whatever the color rabbit is on your 800 i would lean into testing whatever gave you that 49.85 time on your 750s and 850s and see if you can get those numbers down okay just so people know you can go into here you can actually just go in and look at your 800s, filter it, and then you can check. But I don't even know. What was that? Just 49.85. 49.85. Uh, 49 uh, okay, here we go. Here it is right there. No rabbit. That was unrabbited. So it's yeah, going to so make that much harder. The, exactly right wow. i think i did i did exactly what you said i went in here i was like i think i looked at that and i had no rabbit i'm like fuck then i was like okay what's the next closest one to that it's like this 51 10 and um it's a gold rabbit which i don't think is the right rabbit for this how uh how does your dog so go to your weather and surface conditions and see what the uh primary winning conditions are all right so, so soft, soft rain rain but we had sunny hard fast times you've ran 50 sunny races um so sunny hard sunny soft sunny wet i would target just because sunny hard is going to give you your dog's fastest times because your dog doesn't seem to mind sunny or hard doesn't love hard but doesn't hate it either Right. Sunny hard are always going to give you your best times, period. But those are going to take perfect RNG races to hit. Um, you know, the way it works is like a perfectly contig configured 400 statted dog that loves to race sunny hard is going to set world records. But right. a 400 stat dog that loves muddy snow is going to still run its best times when it catches the perfect RNG sunny hard race, but most of the time when it catches a sunny hard race, it's going to shit the bed. But it's still <laughs> going to show you your best times of sunny hard. So lean into the sunny hard a little bit if you see them pop up, because that'll tell you if you actually do like sunny hard or if you're just catching a good RNG every once in a while. But if you do actually like sunny hard, 
that's going to help you really dial in your rabbits. Sunny hard dogs are the easiest ones to figure out rabbits because when you start to hit, it makes a massive difference in their performance. Well, and that's what the workout breeder is for, right? Like I can yep. literally just run that it's, race it, and I did that. If you have a hound where you know the distance you're hunting for, so if you're testing for marathons, if you have a dog where you know this is my marathon runner of my dogs, I know that I've configured my marathons really well on this one, put that hound against Genity. Even if the conditions don't line up and then just pick either neutral conditions to run or sunny hard conditions to run and then line them up against each other. A hound you know runs well. Don't just put them in against bot dogs. Right. And then that'll give you both times and placements against that hound to compare. I usually will put in all eight of my own hounds and I'll put in at least two to three known hounds for whatever distance I'm testing. And then the rest of my fill them with hounds that I want to figure out. And then as I adjust, I can see where all of those bottom hounds place and see when they start to edge their way into these podiums and their times start to tighten up to better times on their overall. Okay, perfect. And then, okay, one last thing. Let me see if I can find. Look at this one. This one should be a real banger and I can't do anything, but look at this. Put them look up at the here. fucking, look at this. Amazing sprinter, amazing mids. Uh, stays are dialed in other than that six second stay. I would make sure that whatever gave you the two second 600 is also on your six. Your marathons are pretty much dialed in too. Um, yeah. What I would tell you to do honestly on this one is make sure your form is at 100 by picking the perfect cherry picked races. So go and see like what your hound likes ideally. Oh, it looks so soft and sunny, sunny, soft. Right. I would I would not put this hound in pretty much anything other than sunny soft races. And the benefit is you have a sunny soft hound in this guy and you have a sunny soft hound in your um, last one that you had pulled up. Yeah, the Trinity. The Trinity. Yeah. So sunny soft was her best surface with her second best uh, weather condition. And this is clearly sunny soft all the way. And you have marathon data dialed in. Right. So this is a hound you could put in your workup breeder every single time you run it with your genity to help your genity get dialed in with your rabbits. And your genity will probably end up running better than the porter. That's what I'm thinking. But like here, 52, 57, 52, that's 100%. pretty dialed it's in right there, yeah. right? That's in. Yeah, your, your sprints dialed in, your mids dialed in. That's pretty close up there. Yeah, those are higher than Killer Mike's numbers and mids, and he's confirmed 15 of 15 God breeder. And then everything else doesn't have much run. Now your you marathons, know. what what gave you that five second marathon? Was that a purple? Because this one right here, whatever gave you that five fifteen eight hundred, is going to be to what what you want to lean into and check for data on your other two distances. So your forty nine twenty nine. Five. What was the uh, forty nine twenty nine? I think I looked this up yesterday. So uh, where are you? I pass it? I don't see it. What the fuck? I probably rolled right past it. 49.29. You might have to. Oh, like I have more. Thing. Yeah, because I'm at. I don't see it. 49.29. There's a 51. Yeah. You probably have to filter. Maybe put on hard. Because it'll probably be on a sunny hard track. 49 no it's not mm -mm. so soft then because he's a really solid soft runner 49 let me take off the sunny what because i'm all where the heck is this thing so maybe just try soft and no sunny i took that off oh, you did um very strange this is really weird unless oh check your um paid races down at the bottom paid races and workout breeders will adjust into your times if you've ran them through a workout or a paid. oh i see okay so then oh. i should take off all the uh no it's not in here either uh, check your workout races too if you've ever worked them out Oh, maybe I did just get this. Did I just get... Oh, here's a 48... Oh, that's a 750, though. It's not doing yeah. 800. There's the... Up towards the top, I thought I saw 40. No? Where is it? Maybe it was a 1v1. 
Oh, would that not show up? I don't think there's anywhere to see a 1v1 other than your dog's race history. They don't show up in my dog's even paid data. Interesting. So, but like if it was 49, whatever, then I know that, for instance, the, where was the 51? This one right here is pretty close. I mean, it's not the same, right? That's right. a different. And that's with but... the gold and you have mixed performance on gold. So when I see right. such a wide range, so an eight second difference, for instance, between the first and the eighth place. Right. But you can also look at the time frame. You had two weeks in between those races. Right. So he ran on 10.6 and then two weeks later ran 10.24. So you'd have to go back and see maybe that was back when he got trained. He may mm. have been running untrained before that point. And you could see that from your kennel. So when you when you clicked on view card on him, you got to go to the kennel page. And right. then on the put him up porter page of your kennel, you can click on view training logs and it'll tell you the date that he was trained. So then you can use, so up there where it says logs in green over the 99 speed. Over log. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, gotcha. Yeah. And gotcha. then it'll tell you, the, the, scroll down past all the temporary and then at the bottom you should probably see his permanence. There's his permanence. So yeah. he was trained permanently back early. in early May. Yeah. So anything before May 28th, of last year, uh, he would have had unrabbited data. Okay. Interesting. All right. So, I mean, I got a lot to learn. It just seems like you, you can sit here all day and never figure out, like, get it completely in. I'll I'll dive in, and if it takes me like three days of headbanging frustration, Don't I'll sideline the dog for a little bit and just put it into like spam race entry mode so like if right. i'm at a point where i'm like i can't figure out the rabbits i'll just put them in a bunch of races just to see if it's i've already hit them maybe and i need to, to get more data on the same colors and yeah, i'll focus on another hound on on like trying to configure just right but okay that's kind of like my methods to my madness for testing but i don't keep spreadsheets i just look at the data when when it balances i'll go back and look at it the same ways and then make adjustments get some races in readjust reassess repeat yeah i mean um and like she's saying here she's got her bolting has 100 speed 100 acceleration but it's not what your endurance that's what you want the endurance right. wasn't great on that yeah that's endurance nice. it's a endurance is pretty key Mike still has dominated in some uh, distance runs. When you um, when you think about the factors of percentages wise, ninety eight percent of your best possible um, run times is still relevant. Now ninety eight or speed and endo are still the the highest weighted stats in the game. But I feel like too many people look at one hundred speed and say, okay, one hundred speed is one hundred speed is one hundred speed, and that's not necessarily true. 100 speed just means that you're tapping into 100% of your dog's potential. But if your dog's potential is shit, right. then you're only going to be 100% shit. You know, you'll just be the fastest version of shit. Now, if your dog has really natural, like really good breeding, and so its peak speed or peak endurance is the highest it can be, that's when you're going to want to close that gap and get that extra 8% by adding eight stat points to endo or three percent by adding that three to speed um but when you run you run the math if you have a dog that's bred and bloodline capable of a, achieving the maximum hound speed that's already revealed to be 80 kilometers per hour 98 percent right. or 98 statted hounds that have the bloodline ability to hit that are instead of running 80 kilometers per hour going to run 78.6 or something like that it's a less than two kilometer per hour dis difference in the potential maximum speed. So 98 doesn't necessarily mean you've rugged a dog as long as you have the proper breeding to make your dog naturally fast already. Right. So if you have the good parents, you had a good, you know, um, I'm trying to think of one of mine that does pretty well that shouldn't like this Jovi does. Okay. It's a 198. I, I just sold Sheriff of Spottingham, my 393 Flemington, to Ninja. Um, but he's won me 550 Matic, I think, before I sent him off. And he's a 98 wow. speeder. Yes, I mean, I guess uh, this was from an Amera. It's a Fedor. 
By the way, the doors, any of these worth? I did this the other day. Or... The door's worth leaning into. Um, that especially with those rolls, getting the hundred speeds not easy on a Fedor. The plus two to Indos. You know, we would have rather seen the ninety nine, obviously. Um, the easiest way that I usually go through my dogs when I'm trying to decide what I want to race is I'll sort them by uh, overall stats. Yeah, that's, so that's what I just did. I'm just trying to see if there's one that's worth even training. I did this the other day, and I've got uh, what is this? A, oh, that's hers. That's not mine. I'm like, wait a second, that's awesome, but that's not mine. <laughs> Fuck, I'm, that's hers. Uh, what, what, I thought I had one that was worth training. Maybe I didn't. Uh, it was, a, it might have been a, a, a Fritz. Was it a uh, Fitzroy? Fitzroy? Those were good. I, was. I, I personally like Jane. I think that Jane is a solid dog. Um, I saw you saw a, I had a Jane up there. I, I personally feel like Jane have potential. Fitzies have potential right here. And it's an, a Fitzy from an up American. there. That's, that's, uh, Alexander's and uh, Jason's, uh, but this has got that 87. So the best I can get yeah, you can go for the 100, 199 on um, a Jane. So you could do the plus three to speed and then roll the rest of your four into Indo. Right. And you're going to you're gonna hit uh, potentially 100 speed, 99 endurance. And you're and saying you, that could be a good... 195, 99, 94 would have the potential of getting to and winning G4, G1 races. Really? I mean, and nothing yeah. else here is kind of. It'd be a plus fifteen, making it a, a three eighty-eight overall. And there's there's plenty of less than three eighty-eight hounds currently in G one. So. And the Fitzroy, that's not worth going. For. Fitzroy's worth training. I've trained a few Fitzroys. They're just hard to train. Fitzies are hard to train because they've got that ninety-two speed, and I believe Fitzy's a ninety-two endo. Wait a second. What did she win today? I've got two. Oh no! I was like, I got two Brooks. Did she get this? Oh, she got the Dylan. Was that from today? Uh, Dylan. Mm, Dylan's a rough one. I mean, you can yeah. do the plus three endo on Dylan and put the rest into speed and hope to hit a hundo. But that's gotta um, be hard. I I rather have ninety two minimum if I'm going to be training hounds on the speed side because if you don't hit it, you're end up putting everything into speed. I've right. I've literally had Clarks that are ninety two speed that have plus five to speed. What five right. plus one trainings into speed, um, making it a 97 speed, just shit lord, you know, right? He's right. I don't want to do so. It looks like I don't even have anything really worth training. You're saying the Jane, but man, that looks like I personally feel like a Jane would be worth leaning into if you didn't have something else on the, the potential horizon worth it. But you know, because not everybody you could is... get that three. Would you re roll that if you didn't get the three on what on the speed on the Jane? I personally would re-roll it if it was a plus one. If it was a 98, I would go for the re-roll on it. If it was a 99, I would keep. 99 or 100, uh, definitely keep. But I would re-roll a one. I know that you'd want to prioritize saving your re-roll for pushing up that endo. But I still feel like with 95 base acceleration, if you can hit 100 speed, that's going to round your dog out well in the mids and stays. Speed isn't as important in sprints, especially in the shorter sprints, because they actually, most hounds won't have the time to get up to 100% of their hounds' potential speed other than the 300s. Gotcha. Fuck, man. It's so hard to decide. Because I haven't even really dialed in on this at all. I just kind of, I don't know where I got this fight. Somebody sent it to me or whatever. I mean, look, I've got that gold rabbit, so I can fucking... Mm -hmm. Gene from Amira. That would probably would have been either Big A's or Moe's. It could have and been. I believe Mo has pulled a few Janes. That might be a, a Mo gift, maybe. It might be. Because he would have said 87, no fucking way. Oh yeah. Yeah, he'd re-roll the Jane in a heartbeat. So that was definitely a re-roll if it was Moe's, and he would have no problem giving it away because he's got much more like higher statted dogs. Right. So he'd be focusing on those. Wouldn't would he? Wouldn't be somebody prioritizing a Jane. But for new players or players that don't have a bunch of monster hounds that they're learning, a well-trained Jane is an amazing hound for starting out because you're going to be able to get in there and, and kill it with uh, um, G twos, any of your G three like G three monthly. A Jane that's trained properly and learned could have absolutely got to the finals in this last G three monthly. 
because the conditions were so across the board. Okay. Man. I was just thinking if I wanted to roll something. Have I sent all? I think I've sent all the dogs. I've sent everything back, right? Oh, no. I still um, have Yeah, I got Mike. Um, I still have Big A's. I, I think, the, Reggie, they were trying to figure out if it was you that sent the Jane, plain Jane, over to. Uh, I think it was a, I'm pretty sure it was a Mo, because he would have said, fuck that. Yeah, yeah. And we weren't not... sure if you gave that. You gave uh, Shelby Cobra a few, something. I don't remember what they were. I almost want to do just one. Is that stupid? Uh, what, one pull? One pull from this Liberty, but is that smart? I mean, you got the Brooks. There, there's there's nothing they'll say that, you know, just because you got a Brooks that you won't pull another banger. I've pulled back to back monsters before, like two pack pulls in a row. I think we pulled a Brooks and a Porter. Oh, so he did do the plane Jane. So he's probably like, he's like, no fucking way. I think it's just a hard train all right i'm gonna yeah, do i'm I'm gonna do one i gotta do one i can't fucking watch her (laughs) shelby says send me my books i'm gonna go get one now let's just do one real quick this is it i need to stop doing this god damn it all right i'm gonna do this and then i gotta go and honestly some of our very best pulls from our personal kennels came from one of one pulls when we only had the money to pull one i sent in for one pack on a on a rip night for ross and got a brooks bread regis uh ghosty sent in for one pack rip the very first time we did an amira um, ripathon and she pulled a trinity from amira and that's uh matrix and matrix has won her a ton and that was just a one of one so those one-offs sometimes produce in big ways i wouldn't know <laughs> i wouldn't i would not know but we'll yeah you'll get your win eventually maybe uh because shelby got her rose uh, purebred win last month. Maybe this will be your one of one because that was one of one on Shelby too, I believe. That I think was, she sent uh, in for just one pull that day and got the purebred rose. All right, let's let's give it a try here. All right, woohoo! Let's do. All right, that was my singing. Oh my lord, have I really been doing this since nine fifteen this morning? Holy cow! Nine twenty. Marathon, marathon streamer club. Oh my lord, what did I just do? This is like me on VV trying to get something good. That comic kind of Yes! Woo! Look at that! Look at that. I don't see anything. It's still an extremely game. rare. I oh you don't see it. I got a fucking extremely rare. Holy fuck! You Shit. just pulled a George Liberty. Are you fucking kidding me? You just got the best racer in the game. And it is a bloodline match. This is the dog to train. Let's fucking go. Should I accept it? Yes. Oh my oh, god. Oh yes. Because everyone you just got a fucking George. Oh my <laughs> god. Dude, you need to like go buy a lotto ticket, rip your shirt, run in circles. Like you literally got the best OG breeder in the game. He is a 396 or 394 base with the potential of getting up to a 398 overall. Wow. Do you know that it's my birthday this week? Well, happy early birthday. Yeah, I told you man, there's one of one pulls. We just talked about the shit. Holy shit. George, I'm so happy for you, bro. I don't know I what that so means. I'm so happy but for like, you, bro. That dog is going to win you so much, Matic. Is that one where if I trained it perfectly, I could sell it for thousands, right? You could probably, if you train that dog 15 out of 15, somebody probably offer you five grand for it. Wow. But of course, it'd be worth keeping because then I get... Hold on, yeah, he's still in a lot more train, than that in the long run. And we've seen BE train. Yes, I can't train. Oh my gosh. I can do I enter that? It. Yeah, that's crazy. Do I and you're like, I don't see him. Like, what? How do you yeah, you're like, what? And I was like, I'm just looking at dude, your racers. What's going on? All right, so <laughs> oh my lord. So you could do you could get lucky on one, and then you want the re-roll here, right? And oh yes. my god, the consistency, so- everything's perfect. Everything is the highest possible base stat of any hound other than Rocket, a spotty ER that doesn't have a breeder version. So the only higher statted base hound is Rocket. George is the number two highest stat in the game, an absolute monster. You actually have a fawn match with the breeder because Liberty is a fawn. Not the best fawn to pull a George from, but way better than pulling a George from a common, which happens a lot. Right. This is this is probably the poll of the month. There hasn't been a better poll this month. 
Do I want to trade this now, or do I want to put this in something first? Um, if you could find a maiden to slap it in, you can. It's up to you if you want to wait that long before you race him. Because uh, you'd have to probably wait until next week to put him in the trained maiden. I'm sure they'll probably do the trained maiden next week. This is a 92 speed untrained this week. So they'll probably do a trained maiden next week. So if you wanted to train him and wait, you could. If you want to train him and race, you can. Yeah. But Look, everyone's he's telling like, everyone. Might pull one. He might pull a pack. He, he pulled one pack for himself, Budge. And he's like, he was debating. And I was like, man, all the best pulls that we pulled in our kennel for one of ones. And so he just took a flyer and pulled one Liberty for himself and just got a freaking George. Well, let me ask you this. If I trash trained it, is this still good? Yes. Yeah. If you trash train, it's, it's good right now as it is. But if I train it, that doesn't change anything. It makes it better. Well, other than exactly. I can't. Yeah, Join. it's already a 384 base, which Holy is shit. fucking huge. If you get a plus five, it's a 389. I have 389 Clarks that dominate on the track. So should I train this now or should I not train it now? I I personally would not wait two weeks to race a George. If I got one, I'd be wanting to put him in a maiden race right that second. So I personally would probably train him almost right, immediately and try to start kicking people's ass. All right, so I've got, should I just burn my wrap, my gold rabbit, or should I, let's see, I need, hold on one second here. I thought I had fucking three bronze, but I guess I don't. I'm sure I had, wait a second, I know I got. There's another. a bronzy. Wait, did I, now I've got the gold. I thought but, I saw a bronzy. You know, there's one at the bottom, but I thought I had like three of these. Oh, oh no, I was going to say no. 20 days, I just got one yesterday, so where the fuck is it? Oh, load more. There we go. All right, cool. So there should I do. just burn these? I'll have my yeah. five points. All right. Burn them up. You'll have your five TCs and high sweat George training sesh. Let's freaking go. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going to freak out. I'm right, Budgie? Priority. There we go. I could have done sword by rarity. Okay, we're going to burn. Can I burn? Them? Oh, you got to wait. Okay, there we go. All right, here we go. I still want to keep that gold in case I can get the... Um... I'd say uh, this makes a strong case for the caliber of quality of uh, Big A's Liberty Breeder as well. Yeah, I would say so, because you said there's some people that have never pulled an extremely rare, because we just oh, asked yeah. that. They've only pulled the one from a Hickman uh, on a borrowed Hickman Breeder. That's the only time we've pulled an extremely rare, other than gold bunnies. But um, as far as racers go, I mean, a Liberty that spit out of George, that uh, that's the third dog um well no that's the because it's put out of brooks too uh, the three sets so that's the sixth dog that was bred from that liberty it already put out a george and a brooks in the first six breeds that's a fire breeder right there that's a fire ass liberty right there yeah now everyone's gonna want to breed you gotta you gotta pay oh, big a sure. big bucks for that all right so all right so here we go let's fucking do this i'm kind of nervous is there any like ritual i should do like like cut my arm open and bleed into a <sighs> man <laughs> you know, right training is one of the most nervous things that i've ever endured in this game because you get one shot 25 matic top liberty breeder pulls if anyone's interested absolutely <laughs> absolutely and i you will get it all sent to big a or you can just uh i can send him my breeder or my my re-roller so, um all right and here's yeah. the caveat to consider before you start your training session Okay. You cannot keep all threes. If your first four rolls are threes, you don't get a fifth roll. Because that'll put you at 198 99 99 So, your speed, you need a three for sure. Um, acceleration or endurance. So, endurance or consistency, you've got to roll a one. Or you're not going to be able to put another point in. Or acceleration, you have to roll a two, or you're not going to be able to do another roll. You're saying because I'm going to hit, there's only Over, four. Once five. you hit 98 in any stat, you're it's stuck. It. You can't train it again. Fuck. So a plus one to speed, stuck at 98. A plus two to acceleration, you're safe. But a plus three, you're at 98. Plus so three to endo, you're 99. Plus three to consistency, 99. And now you're stuck with four out of five training sessions with one that you never got to roll. So if you get a two on the speed, you keep that and just stay at 99? <sighs> that's that's a hard one. That's really a hard one. Um, 
How much I've is never the been in the seat to train a George. I would obviously want that 100 speed, but I would probably keep 99 or 100. Um, that'd be gut wrenching to hit the one on the speed and then have to use a reroll and then hit threes and everything else. Because I have really to train this, you. right? I have to train. I mean, how much is this worth if I don't train it? Untrained, a Liberty George, a few hundred Matic, probably. Yeah, that's not worth it to me. Because, I mean, can I make money on this if I get a shit roll? If, if you train this dog 11 of 15 or better, you can get it to G1s, and it will make you well over 2,000 Matic within about a three-month window if you race him right. Yeah, because I spend all my time. Fuck, what does everyone in chat say? What do I do? I do this? Do I train it now? Do I do? Do I kill my firstborn? Child? I would keep the two on speed. I would keep the ninety nine speed. I'm not going to waste the reroll on a on a George, on the speed side. Yeah, uh, there's too many other factors that you have to to chance reroll. Um, this is big TV. Yeah. Come on, Tom. Tom, this will look good if I get all hundreds. You realize that, right? This will be like, you can restream this. Low budge, can you click the button so this happens? <laughs> right? This will be huge. Yes, Shelby Cobra, her, that was from uh, his. All right, so what do I do first here? I'm about to shit my pants. I don't know what the hell to do. Before you forget, uh, sent over my trainer. Re oh, yes. I guess I do need the re-roller again because that would not be good. All right, let me make sure I got that. I forgot I sent that back. Um, Amira Brooks from Dave the Bowler would have been from his Brooks that came from Henshi, maybe? I'm pretty sure Henshi sold him that Brooks. But an Amira Brooks is an amazing combo, too. It's no George. Have, oh, there it is. There's the Edward. Okay, I got my zab all right what do you guys think in chat i mean i i trust you vox too i just like i don't know what the fuck to do <laughs> right um, I'm like... this would honestly probably be one of the few situations where when it came to speed i would get what i get and not throw a fit and keep the 98 and save my reroll just in case I would rug myself out of those other training sessions because a 98 speed George with perfect rolls, like a 98, 98, 100, 99 would be an insane George, even at 98 speed. Um, so I would personally just be in the mindset of, hey, I'm going to get speed and just keep what I get. Okay. And I'd still probably roll it first and then kick myself in the dick because I'd hit the plus one and then really want to rip my hair out from the decision. Or I'd hit the plus three and be like, yay, no, I don't have to worry. <laughs> right, exactly. If you get that. All right, so let's go to train. I'm going to shit my pants. So speed, everyone says speed, do it first. Obviously, if, on endurance, if you get one, though, that's perfect. But if you get three, that's okay also, right? Or if you get two. One, um, so so the thing is, is you got to decide what you want your second 100 to be because you're only going to be right. able to have two potential 100s on a right. George. Right. Well, I mean, you could triple 100 a George and not put any into one of the other stats if you wanted to. You could no, I don't think that would be smart. Although his his consistency is really good as is, but like, why not get it better? Consistency is already good as is, but if you wanted to go for the hundo acceleration or the hundo consistency, you could actually sacrifice and keep your 95 acceleration and still be relevant or your 96 consistency and still be relevant. I need help from the check. I need, I need, well, first of all, do I just do training first or do I do endurance first? I would start with speed just to get it out of the way. And then if I got the plus one, I would at least keep the ball in my court to change my mind on that. Because if I okay. use my re-roller on the endo already or something else, and then I roll that plus one and speed at the end, I would probably be like, oh, God, I want to get the re-roll. All right. But, so I'm uh, going to go do – all right. I'm going to go train the speed right now. It's just going to rip the Band-Aid off, and you could either keep the two or three or make the command decision on re-rolling that one. But – it's a risky move. So let's right, just I'm... pray for that plus three on the first roll. All right, let's try it. All right, wish me luck. Here we go. Oh, shit. Here we speed. Drop them threes in chats, guys. 
spam those threes in chat. Uh, all right. Um, I didn't name it. Do I need to name it first? Or no, not? you don't need to name it. You'll see him there. Uh, he'll have the slick back ears and all the other gloriousness of a George uh, right there. Up. Oh, wait, that was, was that the Brooks? That might, I think that's that the, was Brooks the Brooks there. Yeah. Uh, there in the blue rug. Is that it? Yep. Right there in the blue. Right. Oh, this one right here. Yep. All righty. Here we go. 97, 95, 96, 96. All right. All right. Here we go. Threes in the chat. All right. Good thanks, luck, brother. Everyone. Thank you. Here we go. I'm going to shit my pants. All right. If I get a one, it's all right. I'll just move on and we'll try something else. Come on. Let's see that. Three, a two. two. I would keep 99 and save my reroll. 99 is still hyper relevant in a uh, George. I would not race, re waste it and risk going down to a one just to try to hope to go up to a three. Yeah, I agree. 99. All right. So we'll go ahead and accept it. And then I can't reroll it. Right. Right. Once I accept it. All right, so once you go. accept it, it's locked in. But that's why starting with speed either rips the band aid off or puts the ball in your court to make that decision if you don't want to lock it in at 98. All right, so here we go. I'm going to accept it. I'm okay with 99. It's better than 98. Right. 99 is still going to be a badass, George. And like I was saying with the calculations, the maximum speed is 80 kilometers per hour. I'd be shocked if a George can't hit that. And uh, when you take that by 99, um, let's see here, uh, 80 kilometers. You're, oops, I did the wrong math. Hold on. Let me clear that. <laughs> Seventy nine point two. So you're losing 0.8 kilometers per hour potential by going ninety nine over a hundred. Okay, that's minute. Yes, and if you get a good roll that day, obviously I would keep nine. Okay, so yeah. All right, now I'm gonna so go next, to. I would probably hit your indo. Yeah, that's and what and if you get a two, oh. I would re-roll it. A one or a three, keep. A ninety nine endurance, ninety nine speed is hyper fucking relevant. And then you could use that other plus one in consistency, or you can see what you get in acceleration after you do your endo side. But I would probably go endo next while you still have your reroll capability and yep. hope for that plus one. Keep a one or a three because 99 is still going to be a 99, 99, still significant. Right. Um, reroll a two. All right, let's do it. We're going to do endurance right now. Let's do it. Here we go. Wish me luck. I gotta find the fucking thing again. God damn it. Oh, all right. Uh right here. 99. Right? That's, That's the good. one. All right. We're gonna we see go. that big plus one here. That'd be that'd be this would be where you'd want to see your one the most. Yeah, I feel like I'm not that lucky, but we'll see. A three. A three. I would keep this and go 99 yeah. endo. 99 speed, 99 endo. That's yeah, better I'm than getting stuck at the 98 yeah because i could re-roll it what are the chances i'm going to get two good ones all right so 99 99 that's not bad yep and you still got your re-roll and the re -roll. okay so i'm going to accept this i'm happy with 99 99 i've seen people do well with that yep consistent okay so we're going to accept it holy shit all right i'm okay it's too bad that didn't come on speed because that would have been nice all right so now We've got, I would do an, uh, consistency, right? Or no? So, you, so here, here's where you could really make your decisions because your acceleration is at 95, which means that you can get as low as a two and still keep your reroll for consistency. So a one or a two in acceleration and you're safe to put another one in there and go for the 100, 100 acceleration. So at this one, you need a one in consistency to have any hope of putting more points into consistency. And I personally would probably put the hope for that 100 consistency over the 100 acceleration because 98 acceleration is still going to be dope as hell. And that 100 consistency is just going to make it to where your hound's going to be running at that high potential the most often that it can. So do and, I do I do acceleration first, you're saying, and hope for the two, or I do, uh, <sighs> I do the... Um... It's a, it's a hard decision because this is like the gambling point. We're down to two stats left. We have two opportunities to reroll and invest a second stat. And if you don't hit it, I would personally say probably consistency would be the play. 
because if you don't hit it on consistency, you can use your reroll because you have a 66% chance of hitting a one or a two on the acceleration side. Consistency is at what? percent chance of safety on con. Is consistency is at 96 on this? Is Actually, I would I would go acceleration, honestly. Acceleration would be the play. Because then you have a higher chance of getting it on the first one and then save your reroll. Uh, so yeah, if, you, if you get a, a one or two on acceleration, you could keep either of those and dump another point in. Right. And um, then I have to reroll. Yeah. I'd probably go acceleration on this one because anything other than a three and you are safe. All right. Let's go ahead and do it. Anyone else? Yeah. Chime in. I failure think, rate. I feel like that's the right move. I won't be upset because, again, I'm I'm happy with a 99.99. Anyone else want to? Nobody wants to chime in in the chat. <laughs> They're like, I'm not fucking touching this third rail here. And hell, even if you get the three on consistency after getting a uh, three to acceleration, you're still at 99, 98, 99, 99. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do acceleration. I think that's the right way. Let's get lucky. All right, here we go. Train the hell. Let's go find him. Oh, my Lord. Not a word. Not a word, you fuckers. All right, here we go. 90 to 90. Yeah, because look, if I get one or two. All right, here we go. Let's, Let's do get it. get that big plus two right here. All right, here we go. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, shit. I'm going to shit my pants. Come on. Uh, all three. right, well, we got the three. Okay, so that's 98 acceleration. We can either lock it in. <sighs> that's pretty good. I, I personally would probably I keep think that's it. pretty good, too. And then save your reroll for consistency. Because now you know if you hit a two or a one, you can re-roll it safely and go for that second roll into con. I would go uh, acceleration next, Defo. Oh, he's saying re-roll it. Re-roll the three to acceleration? Because 98 is plenty. If you re-roll yes. now and hits... I mean, you could re-roll it and then that give you the op opportunity to dump another stat point. Because this is your highest chance of getting less than a three. For putting that second stat point into acceleration. He says, do it, Voxes. Come on, everyone. You got to chime in. I mean, I definitely, I just like to get multiple people. So if this I get is, the, this is a, it's hard. So right now I'm at 98. You you got a higher chance of rerolling this to invest the stat than you do at rerolling consistency to invest the stat. And that's why I kind of go into this thing 96. Would be better. So I, if I get a 90, if I have to get one, you got to get a one to put a second point in. Otherwise, you are just dead in the water on the next one. So yeah, you could re reroll this oh, one no. and hope to see a one or a two so you can put that second roll into. But you could reroll this to a one and then roll a, a one on your next one and have less than the plus three. Where's Tom? Where the hell's Tom? Hit that button, Tom. All right. So if I stay like this, I'm 98, um, 99, 98, 99. Mm -hmm. And if I accept this, I still have two more rolls right but, but i'm not going to get to use it this is probably the only unless way you hit a it. one or re-roll this to a one or two is the only way you're going to use your fifth roll where's the wifey shelby cobra where the fuck are you when i need you i personally don't feel like a hundred acceleration is as important as a hundred consistency and if i was in your shoes i would probably gamble on trying to hit the consistency over re-rolling the plus three because i could get a 99 there or 90 because you could end up getting a one and a one to your acceleration right now and now you've made your re-roll that you could have used anywhere else useless and you're one stat point less than the 98 you would have had you'll be stuck at 97. You know what I mean? Yeah, I want that. I want that consistency to be. I, I would try to go for the hundred consistency because I feel consistency yeah. is more important than a lot of people yeah. give it credit for because that's one half of oh, how no. well your dog performs coupled with your form. I completely agree. From from just the little bit I know and I've seen, uh, I'm with Big A. Do what Vox says. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna accept this because I've seen consistency makes a huge. This would difference. yeah. Rerolling would be the higher odds of being able to use all five points. But it, even if you don't, even if you only use four because we roll you know a three on your con you're still gonna have a 99 98 99 99 and my 98 98 98 99 dog made me over 500 matic before i got rid of it so no super arsenal you can go once you hit 97 you got one more roll so you can go to 100 on anything all right so yeah, i'm gonna I, accept I, this yeah all right let's do it holy shit that's the big go. balls move so we're hoping it pays off here with the re-roll on the last one so right, ideally, we're going to just hit the plus one consistency right now and not even need to use the re-roller. Right. That, and then we would be good. But if we even if we do, I mean, whatever. All right. So 99, 98, 99. Holy shit. Okay, you ready? 
Let's ready. fucking do this, everyone. I'm fucking ready. Like, we got this. We got this. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, I'm signed in. Come on. Ooh. Plus so 99. You got 99s across the board. So if you re-roll it and you don't hit, you're going to go down by one point. I... Uh, God. Ooh, Some people are probably going to kill me for saying this, but I would personally keep it and just. I'm keep thinking it about keeping rolls. it too because I'm 99, 98, but, 99, 99. How am I going to get a fucking? So what's the hundred? So I can't be like, you know, ninja and the best, you know, kennels in the. Ninety nine is still crazy high consistency. If you re-rolled it into a two, you're going to go down to ninety eight, which is still relevant. So I mean, oh, thinking about it that way. I think I probably would just go full D-Gen and try to hope for the one. Oh, you would. But then even then, you can get a one and a one and be just as fucked, or a one and a two. A three is still super solid. So you've got a, what, a three, a three, two, two, so three, well, six, one and a eight, two nine, would be ten. fine. If you got a one and a two, that'd be fine. The worst case scenario is I get a one and a one, right? Exactly. I re-roll this and I get one and one. But if I get one... But you could I re-roll it into a two and then you're stuck. Two. And then I'm stuck for sure. But now 98 consistency versus 99 isn't that big of a difference. 99 to 100 is not that much of a stretch. But right now, you're trying to make your hound have its maximum potential. This is like one of these moves where I can't give you like clear direction. But right. I personally would probably degen it up and try. But I've rugged That's dogs a, doing that. Right. And a they, George... They I mean, I'm almost, I mean, not full stats, but I'm 99, 98, 99, 99. He gets all threes except on speed where he needed it. I know, right? But it's all, I still think it's okay. I know it is kind of funny that I did, which is why I was considering not doing it first, but you had to. That was the best play. Yeah. And 99 is still a better play than 98. So on the speed I mean, side. I feel like I can still kill with this thing if I die. I mean, you're, you're what? Three, 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 or three, three threes and a two. So three, six, nine, ten, eleven. You're at a plus eleven right now. The lowest you can do is to re-roll this into a two right now. You'd still be at a plus ten, which is relevant for George's because not everybody uses their fifth roll anyway. So you're looking at a one stat point drop if you if you re-roll it into a two. If you re-roll into a one, then the lowest you can get is another one, making it that. 10 out of 15 as well. But if you do get it up to 100, you'd be at a 12 of 15, George, which is really fucking good. Um, How I much difference any... is that going to make? Honestly, I'd be like, I know we're talking about milliseconds, right? So that's what not a big difference. So the, your consistency is not going to affect your speeds at all. Just how often you run your best. And 99 is still fucking banger. That's what I'm I mean, saying. If I, I can get, I can get fucked here. Or like the devil you know, right? This is the devil right. I know, and it's not that bad. Right. So 99, 98, 99, 99 is still a 395 overall, I believe. Or maybe a 394. No, 395. That's a 395. Why is nobody talking in chat? We got fucking 19 people here. We've got holy shit. Who the hell's watching us on Twitter? I got another 40 people on Twitter watching this. Why? I'd, I'd probably keep it, thinking about it that way. 395, that's really high fucking statted. Yeah, I mean, and plus you've got the RNG. I mean, like, I there's the best you can hope for at this point is to go up to a 396, which I've seen a few of, but there's hardly any 395 or sixes out there. So that's uh, a pretty solid set of rolls so either way you go on this it's going to be a win a big win so 98 99 or 100 consistency is going to be a win so at this point it's whatever you're really feeling in your gut and whatever you're comfortable with but this is a, a what do you one. think babe yeah. yeah i mean she's what yeah i want to i'm still going to get my nap in now i'm going to sleep like a fucking baby now right but dreaming of george dreaming of george like my big wins here um shit i mean we're talking one point and there's no guarantee because if I get the two, I'm fucked. I'm 98 now. Now I'm left. And you, when we first started, you said you wanted 11 or plus. And that's what you're at right now. And that's what I'm at. And that was the minimum. I could go mm -hmm. to 10 
and that could affect me. What is there four or five people in the game that can beat this right now? Right now. I mean, it, any hound could beat you if you're not running on preference. Like Killer Mike, if, if you don't have snowy wet preference, I beat George's left and right. But running on preference, having multiple preferences, George is going to be a higher end performer and beat Killer Mike nine out of 10 races in conditions that are outside of my perfect preference. So All right. the wife saying the monster there. hound, you're definitely going to be able to get it to G1 if you get its rabbits to 15 of 15. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. The wife says keep it. I'm solid play. Keep it. Solid play to listen to the wives. Yeah, they're, they're right ninety nine point nine 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 percent of the time, anyway. Yeah, and maybe even more. All right, holy shit. All right, so I'm gonna accept this. Here we go. Oh uh, yes, let's just do. It. Anyone else want to chime in at the last minute and say don't do it? And when you think about it, you could have hit a one into every one of these rolls. I've the done rules. that. Trust me, I did that, and that's why I'm not allowed to train. But <laughs> so, this right. is a big time training redemption. You didn't get to use all five, but honestly, you still have a killer hound. Yeah, an absolute I'm gonna killer do it hound. Right now. And really, it. when you think about it, all you're really hoping for is one additional point out of exactly. two rolls. Yeah, just accept it. I did it. We're good. Yeah. And the, the last thing I want to do here, because I want to mint my fucking rabbits. Maybe I'll get a gold one. I need a silver. If go. I get a silver, then I'll have my. I'll still need another bronze, but then I'll yeah. need that. So, all right. This is all the way above my pay grade. Did you see what happened, Ronnie? Did you get to see all this? Did you get to see, like, I can't even believe it. I would have stayed at 99 if it was mine. Yeah, so, and that's what I did. And look at Rory. We never know what the fuck this guy's saying. He said, the only, only way I could do that. I love and it. Send love Shelby it. her books. She's okay, asked. babe. Where's your, where's your numbers? Where's Give me your... Uh, Hold on, I think it's in Discord. Yeah, she's like, I want my shit now. Uh, is she, is she trying to get me in? Where the hell is her thing? Give me a second, babe. Let me. I need to uh, simmer in this. I'm trying to find your. Uh... Oh, here it is. Okay, here we go. We get, we're going to get your Brooks. We're going to do it right now. We're going to go in. Holy shit uh there's the kennel all right we're gonna go i appreciate you staying here recently received so i'm not sending her this one i'm gonna have to come up with a cool name look at that 99 98 99 99 would have been nice if that was all 99s yeah the 99 across the board would have been really really dope that would have been fucking fire but all right this is hers right this royce and the brooks and what else is hers and this uh, ivy, ivy right yep. all right so we'll transfer the brooks first so she shut the fuck up i mean i love you babe Oh shit! I'm gonna get in trouble for that. <laughs> well, you, you'll you'll get to stay warm in the doghouse with your Brooks. You can or with your uh, George. You can snuggle up with him and stay warm in the doghouse. Exactly. All right. So there we go. We got Cobra Dojo. We're training. I was kidding, babe. I love you. I really do. All right. So we've got only one penny to transfer. There's one. She's got her Brooks. And you know what's funny is Brooks is the direct descendant of George. <laughs> It, it's a one step down in endurance. So George is 96 endo. Brooks is 92. And otherwise, they have all the same exact stats. So like when I look at my breeding charts and I look at like deep diving breeding analysis on how the best breeders match, I kind of structure them in families. So George uh, Hickman and uh, Tinsley at the top would, it would be what I consider the three different coat you know, tiers that establish the bloodlines. And then each of those extremely rares have a hound in speed, acceleration, and endurance that drop by one. Consistency stays the same. So the very rare is like the firstborn child that drops down in just acceleration, the, the <laughs> right. least weighted stat. And then you have their mid-tier. So on the, the fawn line, that'd be your Brooks with the, the 95 acceleration that matches, but he drops down in the endurance. And then you also have the Clark, which is the 304 stat match that only drops down in speed. And those are the three first generation children of George. And that actually repeats across all of the structured bloodlines for each of the three coats. That's insane that you dove in. By the way, Ronnie, so it wasn't that we didn't fully train. It was the risk of doing a re-roll on the consistency for we were i could have done a reroll on the acceleration but we were like let's save it for consistency to go for the hundred 
So that's what we did. So basically, I was only able to do four because most of these were, if you got one point, you're at 97. That was it. So that's basically, we had a chance. I could have tried to re-roll this to a one, which would have given me 97. And then if I got a three, I would have gotten 100. But I have not been that lucky. So I'm like, all right, 99, 99, 99 on those. That's great. And 98. It's it's going to make me money. It's a great. Oh, that's a monster hound. I'm super, super happy for you, man. Yeah. Like. And I'm it's glad you decided on that one of one rip, man. <laughs> You're like, I don't know if it's worth it ripping just one because we would have not, we would have had one less George in existence. I know that was crazy. Yeah, I definitely was not sure what to do. And here we go. This is what I'm hoping for here, just real quick. Can I get a gold rabbit? Let's just quickly see. Because if I get a gold rabbit or silver, uh, that would be fucking fire. That'd be if I cherry get... right there. Yeah, that really would Little be cherry on top. Yeah, the 98 fucked me. Yeah. Well, that ain't gold. That ain't gold. That ain't gold either. But at least it's happening fast. Oh, my Lord. Where's my silver? Silver. Oh. All, right. All right. Whatever. I got I got rabbits galore. Uh, when <laughs> does the next maiden so I can train my day? It'll under? probably be next week, Shelby. Um, they did the untrained and then they did the G4 and then they did the 92 speed untrained. And um, the, the next one will probably just be the fully trained. Okay. So here was the 92. Which he couldn't have done, right? That was right. Like 50. Can't get in the ninety-two speeder with a uh, Brooks because he starts at ninety-seven. So you got to wait until next week because uh, yeah. Dave the Bowler. So after that one runs, it'll probably be on Tuesday of next week when they post the maiden for next week. Would there be a trained one that I could be part of, or no? Uh, they, they do a trained maiden, uh, but it wouldn't be probably until the end of next week. So okay. after this this maiden runs, the 92 speed maiden, it's usually two days after that that they'll populate the maiden race for that following week. So uh, I think it runs on, what, Friday or third? No, it's, it's not worth waiting for. I need to just get the I button. personally wouldn't be able to wait that long. Yeah, no, this is all I want to do now. I don't even want to sleep, but I got to take a nap. <laughs> <laughs> right. I mean, it's still good. Like, I'm, I'm, it kind of sucks that I didn't get any hundreds, but... I think overall, like you say, just good, good numbers. What could I do? It could have been worse, right? And untrained George has the capability to beat most trained hounds before you even train him. So right. um, that's what I was thinking. solid pulls, even not hitting those, those hundreds. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a monster. I'm, I'm worried about facing him in races in the future. I was just saying, like, does this mean, it. you know what, uh, for Reggie and all you guys, I think we're going to start doing some, like, actual real races now, <laughs> right? There you go. Rabbits. You fire up those G3s for at least uh, a couple of days before he hits G2s because he's not going to stay in G3s very long. No, I know, I know. Uh, now, pulling him before the Group 3 monthly tournament would have been pretty huge. That would have been a, a good one to get him entered into. Yeah, I don't know. I'll, I just got to get him trained, and hope we'll see what happens. But and then, right. you might get him learned in time to drop him in the send it Sunday. It costs you four hundred draw for some data, but with ninety nine consistency and all of those other stats, like any send it Sunday, once you can pl slap boosts on him and you have him half configured, he's worth putting in the send its because he's going to run so well across so many conditions that he's going to make finals pretty regularly once you get him dialed in. I love it. I love it. All right, Vox. That was awesome. Uh, I I really appreciate it. We'll have to do yeah. it again or I'll have to come on your channel so you guys can uh, do the rips and I can listen to you go. But um, really appreciate it. By the way, everyone on here, remember that Vox also does pack rips and he does good deals and he has really good uh, dogs to rip from. And as you can see, I have no fucking clue what I'm doing. So, you know, with <laughs> me, I have some nice breeders and, and then when it comes to information and data, I've done a lot of hours of research and spent countless hours figuring out like how stats translate, what dogs to prioritize, which ones will be worth selling, which ones will be worth leaning into and learning. So if anybody ever has questions, hit me up or and ask that, one live. Yeah, I was going to say that's worth a lot. And I, I love to be able to offer people good deals. But like I said, when I first started with even Andy Mack, you know, definitely support all the streamers. Uh, but Vox, I mean, since December, 
probably knows more about this game than almost anyone else maybe even more than tom <laughs> you know but he's really <laughs> he's surprised he's... by a few of my theories you know he, he, he said he really enjoys some of my theories because they when they programmed the dogs initially um they had some ideas of how things would kind of play out but we're seeing variables in the breeding structure that they really didn't plan for because they couldn't we're just seeing how it all balances and he he said he really enjoys hearing some of my theories because he, he likes seeing kind of how that bounces off of what theirs were when they started it all. So, yes, totally. Yes, definitely not. Or we'll just do more curveballs like best of the worst with first place and second. I'll trust me, I'll rig it so I can fucking win. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to do much rigging when you got that bad boy. Yeah, I know, right? Um, yeah, whatever will give me the advantage. No, but seriously, I really appreciate it. And everyone should consider it. Like I said, I'm glad people have ripped packs of mine, but just don't forget like the information Vox can give you, like that is worth way more than even the rips. So yeah. keep that in I, mind. I rant for hours when people rip from me sometimes about how their dogs have potential or don't. So if you guys want info with your rips, uh, that's always available. And even if it's not one of my rips, if you have questions about dogs, just hit me up. Uh, my yep. DMs are open. <laughs> Absolutely. And then I'm going to have to win some money here and then come on and do some rips from you. We've, we've ripped from you too. I, oh, so yeah. Normally yeah, I have Shelby Cobra do it. Cause I don't do, I don't do well with my rips. This is it. Like, this got pretty it. good luck with her rips from us. Yeah, that one of one purebred rose was a dope pool for sure. Yeah. I mean, it's insane. It's insane. And Good-born of course, rose. Uh, <laughs> I want to thank ghosty. I want to thank big a everyone for coming today. Uh, do I have any? You have all your dogs back, yep. right? Yep, I'm right. I'm good. And then uh, let's see here. What else do I need? Um, fuck. What am I trying to do here? Oh, I need to send his back. Yep, I think. All right, Dab, Amelia, if you haven't already, and then Liberty is what. Oh yeah, I, I. Oh, that's right. Do I have his? I hope I don't still have his. So the wife should have gotten hers back. Check what we have. Yeah, because I have two. Right, I've got the uh, Liberty. Oh no, where's the re-roller? And then uh, I, I don't know if you're going to be around or not tomorrow, but um, I'm going to be doing that World War Zero X tournament tomorrow. They're doing them every Tuesday and Thursday, and they're giving out their their um, meme token with like the tournament right now. Their utility token is still kind of going through all the contract stage. But every Tuesday and Thursday, they have like a two-hour window where I'm going to be streaming tournaments. It's a free-to-play first-person shooter, low polygon game. Uh, free to download and dive into and they're going to do crypto rewards so i'm trying to like branch out into as many of these different uh play to earn games that have potential and it's really fun to play so if you like shooter games i don't know if you're into fps shooters or not but uh i'm a big fps gamer yeah i might check it out i might i might check it out so i've got the liberty here let me get his thing um let wait what the fuck just happened oh my screen just went blank all right, uh, can you stand for two seconds, Fox? Because I'm gonna head. I want to say goodbye, uh, Big A. I'm gonna send this to you, and uh, appreciate everyone hanging out. And yeah, we'll go from there. I will. I'll, I have one more race I can do. I, I I don't know if I'm gonna do it tonight or tomorrow, but we'll we'll get, I'll get it figured out probably tomorrow. And that's it. I appreciate everyone dropping by, Fox. If you can just stay for two more seconds. Uh, all right, cool, everyone. Have a great day. Thanks again, Vox. Thanks again, Big A and everyone else. I am out. Peace. Maybe I'll see you tomorrow. All right. Bye, everyone.